In this video, I have to complete every single Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Zombies Easter Egg completely solo. Now, before this video starts, I do just want to say an absolute mountain truckload thank you for the support on the channel recently. It's been absolutely insane. So if you do like this video, make sure to drop a like on it. And if you want to see more content like this, why don't you subscribe? It's completely free and you can always change your mind later. We've just broke 7k, so let's go for 8k by the end of next month. With all that said, enjoy this video. Right, okay, boys of despair, the first of many. Right, let's pop this shopping free and let's get going. Gonna grab stamina up as well really quickly. Jump, 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 jump. Right, go. Right, we're gonna get right to the Sentinel Artifact as fast as possible. And we're gonna do that as fast as we can. I don't know why I said, like, as fast as we can in both sentences there. I'm nervous. I've never done the Voyage Easter Egg before. And I'm trying to be as, like, I'm trying to sound as smart as possible, basically. Get this open. And that, I think, is the last door of the Sentinel Artifact. I might be wrong, though. Yes, it is. Okay. And we can loop around here. Get this open. Also get that open. Is there anything else we can get open? This door right here, maybe, maybe. Oh, yeah, we can. Nice. Right, let's go get the Sentinel Artifact on then. Basically, the power switch of the map. But they just wanted to be extra for this, which I kind of understand, you know. New storyline, new everything. It's all like Greek mythology and stuff. Start killing the round one zombies here, because we do need some more points. We got Burned Out as our top elixir slot as well, which is decent. Although, I would have rather like anywhere but here, but whatever. Beggars can't be choosers, and it is random. Right, get this on. Get this altar on. That's the first one. So, the first step of the Easter egg is actually getting pack up on John. And getting pack open on this map is pretty simple i'm not gonna lie you just gotta find four altars and two of them we can get open right now i'm gonna nip down here quick and see if we can find the shield piece it's not there this is one of the maps where you really can't be like doing much on these rounds honestly you get the shield built you can maybe get a free kraken going like around nine but it's quite a high round map for the easter egg at least it all does depend on rng because you can just get the kraken from the box all right the shield piece isn't there it means it's down here there it is nice double points please yes Oh, right at the end of the round. Uh, bro, it's just, it's it's the Roman W special. Double points at the end of the round. Why do I expect any less anymore? All right, let's go get the water drained. Or is this the way at the uh, altar? I can't remember. No, this is water. Let's get this drained. All right, we did manage to get a couple of kills on the double points at least. Right, here's a second altar. Turn that on. There's one at the bottom of the grand staircase. And then there's one. Hang on a minute, I'm having an Alzheimer's moment. Where's the other one? Oh, yeah, mail room. Right, we got like basically 2,000 points. I wonder what we can do with that. Is that another zombie down there? Right, we can kill him as well. Nice. Or her, sorry. We do not assume genders. On the Roman W YouTube channel. Assume an agenda of a zombie, bro. I'm gonna get cancelled. There's also a little piece I'm looking for in here. Yep, that's the distillation kit. I wanna get through the grand staircase, though. So can you please let me go back through? Yes, and there is a way through here. Nice. And you go all the way down to D deck. Because there's another one of these down here. That on. I'm gonna spin the box here just in case we do get good RNG and maybe get the crack and first hit. Please. No. Okay, double cross, whatever. We need to end the round now, anyway. Because we don't have enough points for the door. I just felt like being a bit cheeky and relying on RNG. We'll give it another go because I'm a gambling addict. No. Okay. Do need to keep our eyes peeled for the other shield pieces as well. But we'll head towards the bridge because there is a shield piece in here. It's not there. Um, is it on the bench? I've never had it spawn here. Right, it's in the other location. It's like on the railing. Around here. Around somewhere. It's usually right there. Wait, is, is it on the bench? Am I tripping? What? Bro, it wasn't there. No, no, no. Am I, I I must be going and sit. Oh, I was checking that wall. My bad. My bad. Right, let's go get the fourth altar here. Down in the mail room. Then we can start on the symbol step around four. We're not doing too bad for time here. First drain the water. Then get the altar on. Nice. Right, that's pack a bunch open. Step two is complete. All right, let's go run around and see what we can find. There's a symbol there. What symbol is it, though? It is if I don't get smacked by this zombie here. Oh, there's a few. Oh, I'm just going to end the round. I don't care. It's a triangle, so I think that's fire. What time is it? That is pointing to 4-5. Yeah, is that 4-5? Yes, that is 4-5. Right, let's go have a look for the other locations then. Pretty sure there is one up on the bridge under the desk, so we'll go have a quick look there. Yep, it's there. I don't know what symbol that is. I think that's air or earth. That's 10-11. Let me just double check. I'm reading that right. Oh, nuke. I can't pick that up, man. I'll go around the other side now. Yeah, that's 10-11. The symbol was earth. Right, two more to go. Is it here? actually. Yep, it is. That's downward and that's water. So, water is whatever the grandfather clock says here. 5-4. And the last symbol we're looking for is air. Right, let's go check the third class, like, births area. And then I'm pretty sure the only one we haven't checked then is one that I'm completely forgetting about. It'll come to me once we look at this one. Is it there? Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Right, let's go check the first class lounge. I think that was the one I was forgetting about, the one in the window. Yes, there it is. There's uh, air. And the time is... That is 3-3. Three, three. Right, let's go input them. This dial is... 
So this needs to be all the way over here. Oh, these zombies are going to get annoying, man. Right, then this one is water on four. I'm going to kill this zombie just so we have a bit of time to enter these. So that means it should be all the way over on the half one, like that. This one is... I don't know what that symbol is. Is it earth? Earth 11, so that goes like that. And then fire five is on full, like that. Right, now we've got to go all the way over to the other side of the map. We're going to go take the fast travel. And we've got to go enter the first numbers on the other side, then down in the engine room. So this one needs to be all the way over to the right. If it would do it, there we go. I'm going to clear out some of these zombies here because we don't need them all. We don't need any of them, actually. There's no soul steps on this Easter egg, I don't think. And Earth was 11, so that goes like that. I lied. Earth was 10 and we did the wrong position anyway. So that goes like that. There. Right, now we need to go down the engine room. If we can get this done before Catalyst Zombie starts spawning in, I will be one happy bunny. Why am I heading back towards the other side of the ship when the engine room is literally right here? Fire on right half, like that. Let's not die. And then this goes on full. Yeah, there we go. Nice. We did it. Heard the noise. All right, we can start the outlet step now, but now we need Catalyst Zombies. And the problem with that is it's not round nine yet. So in the meantime, I think I'm going to go hit the box. Come on, give me the Kraken. Does that look like the Kraken to you? Essex. The Mog 12. I'm going to whip out the specialist here. All right, we've got some more hits on the box. The S car go. It's not bad by any means. It's just a, like a little point weapon. Max ammo, sure. Get the box open again. A Mozu, terrible. Satisfying, but really bad. The Vendetta, a weird ass sniper rifle. It's not even really a sniper rifle. It's like an AR kind of thing. Okay, box is moved. All right, electric is here. That's good to know. We should also really get the shield built, huh? The last piece is in the uh, state rooms, which we can go do now, actually. We'll just get that done quick. There it is. There's the last bit of the shield. It's going a bit stir crazy there. I couldn't find it. All right, let's go find the mystery box again, and we'll go build the shield. Okay, that's acid. That's good to know as well. Well, so first class lounge is acid. Get this built on this table here. Hurry up. Right, thank you. Use the shield weapon here just to kill them off. Oh, we have a specialist charge. What am I doing? Just trying to get as many points as I can before we go find the box, because I'd rather get them to move than run out of points and then have it move when they get enough. That makes sense. Right, it's over this way somewhere. But full power, I'll be taking that. And yeah, we'll crack this door open. Why not? Bro, where is the box at? While we're in here, actually, though, we can look for that piece with the distillation kit. Where's it at? I know it here. Yep, there it is. Nice. There's the mystery box. Jesus. Right, okay. Oh, it's not going to give me it, is it? Please, man. BMP, Black Ops 3 Classic. Swile, I'll take it. It's a decent LMG for now. Hope we do get it here, though. Please, man. That Switchblade, Vespa, whatever they call it in this game, the Spitfire. Oh, the Helion Salvo is something I'll take. Right, that's one of two weapons that we actually want. Right, okay. Let's get out of here. We want to be well clear of this area before the Catalyst starts spawning in. Purely because I just don't want the spawns to be fucked up. Right, they're starting to Catalyze. Okay. Get me out of this area. Wait, is this... All right, that's water. Okay, well, that's good to know. We've got an acid one here. Acid is first class lounge. We can get that done now. There's an electric one as well. Yeah, this is acid, right? Where's our acid zombie at? There he is. Kill him. And that's that one done. Nice. Oh, there's an electric one. Jesus, I'm being fucking blinded. I think that one did it anyway. All right, there's an electric one here. That's at the grand staircase. We can go get that one done as well, I think. Okay, our fire one's not there. All right, see if that spawns the portal. I don't know if you can only do one of these per round. Oh, yeah, definitely. That's unfortunate. I'm really happy we got the Helion Salvo, though. That is something. Oh, yeah, sparking now. We need an electric one. We need to keep spinning for the Kraken as well. Oh, I thought I killed him. Oh, my God, there's one of these. Oh, there we go. All right, give me your key, bitch. Repair our shield as well. Bro, did he not drop a... Oh, he didn't drop a fucking thingy key. That's annoying. All right, I need some zombies to catalyze. Oh, water, bro. I don't need you. Fire, I don't need you either. As soon as we get this electric one done, we can go do, I think, water, and then we can go find fire. So we'll probably have this done about round 14. Why is it spawning so many, like, of the ones I don't need? And why is there another one of these already? Oh, there's a, oh he's there. No. I don't want to accidentally kill him. Right, give me that key. Did I pick it up? I think I did. I'm being stunned to shit by these electric zombies, though. Do need them, so can't kill them. Oh! Right, electric, come here. Quick, quickly. That should be it, hopefully. Yep, there we go. It's on the floor. Cool. Get me off of that thing. Jesus, I don't want to do that one yet. All right, I've got a water zombie here. I'm going to go and find the box real quick, wherever that is. All right, all right, we know where it is. It's engine room. All right, two out of four ain't bad for round 11. But I really want the, not the Helion Savile, the Kraken Man, like, so bad. Can't be asked to do the free glitch. Like, the, not the glitch, like, the quest line. It's just so long. A pair of shield. It's going to move as soon as I spin the box. I already know. No, it's going to give me the demon or the demon or whatever. It's moved. Okay. Something's telling me the box is in the mail room. I don't know where, though. Oh, there. Okay. The VKM. I don't need that. Cordite. ABR, bro. M16. My box has moved again. Okay, please just give me it, bro. Come on. No, it's the Hades. Useful, but I don't want it. 
I think I've had every weapon but the uh, thingy now. Ballistic now, bro. Oh, okay, a Akarambit's kind of clean, but like, come on. Give me it. Last thousand points, bro. Come on. Oh, it hates me. All right, let's go do this other power outlet then. It was on the third class births area, so. Come on, you know you want to give me a water zombie. Give me a fucking electric zombie. Bro, come on. Oh, this game hates me, man. Oh, fire cell. Maybe it doesn't. Hang on. Come on, bless me up. MP40, bro. Yes, let's go, bro. Oh, that's literally all I wanted. And now we're chilling. Let's go. I've got both weapons I need. I just need a water zombie. Okay. Rounds are getting on a little bit now. I just, I don't want it to become like round 24. And we still haven't done this step. I'm sure we won't, right? Max ammo. Oh, that's a blight for the man. Bro, we're getting really shit RNG here. Can I please just have a water zombie? The fire zombie. I swear to God, it's actually just giving me everything but a water zombie. Oh, fuck this shit, man. I'm going to go look for the fire outlet. I can't be arsed. It's just giving me everything but the one I want. Is it here? Yes, it's here. Okay. A little bit of RNG on my side this time. Thank you. Where is my fire zombie gone? There he is. Kill him. Yep, right. Okay, that's that one done. And then we just need to do water. So now, hopefully, the only catalyst that will born, born, spawn this round is water. I hope so, anyway. Because as, as long as we get this done, we're chilling. Then we go pack the Kraken. You know, get the other distillation kit piece. Get the acid kit piece. And then we're chilling, bro. Yep, there's already a water zombie there. That's perfect. That should be it. Yep, there we go. There's the circle on the floor. We are good. I keep getting full powers this run. Grab a little bit of shield repair. Where's the pack a bunch machine at? Cargo hold. Other side of the map. Off we go. Right, the first one we need to do is acid, which is the first class lounge. But, but just before we do anything, I'm going to go get my guns packed and stuff. You know, the usual. Chuck that in there. There we go. There's my Kraken. And fuck it, we'll do the Helion as well. Right, we need to go grab Quick Revive as well, whatever that. Oh, it's in the dining hall, I'm sure. We'll go grab that now, then we'll start. We don't really need Dying Wish. Should be, should be okay, I think. Yep, there's Quick Revive. There we go. All right, here's the first one we need to do. Let's get it done. So this one's Acid, okay. Oh, there's the little Acid thing we need as well. Oh my god, don't go down for it, Jesus. Right, we got it anyway. Yeah, we need that little heart thing that, that's in my HUD now. Because we need to upgrade this crack into an Acid variant for one of the steps. Oh, we've got our uh, specialist. We should be fine here. Fuck this Blightfather in particular, bro. Should be nearly done now, right? I'm going to grab the Max Ammo before we leave. Yeah, I think that's the last. Yep, there we go. There we go. Sentinel Artifact just for me. Next one's Water, and that is Third Class Births. Sorry I keep pausing. I'm just checking my little chart. Doesn't this actually cause the water to start rising again? Yes, it does. Oh, where are they? I can't see them. I can't see them, man. What the fuck? Oh, hammer's ready. Perfect. But you can fire the bolt white. Oh, that's kind of cool. Fuck you, Blightfather. I'm being shot at from every angle, don't I, man? Right, we're done. Nice. Grab this. Oh, bro, let me out of here. Right, electric's next, and then it's fire. Electric's on the grand staircase, so that's just a little jog away from here. Here we go. Grabbing that max ammo now. Yeah, the electric one can get quite hectic, to be fair, because they stun you like fuck. As long as we got a hammer charge, in which we do, we'll be fine, though. Yep, there we go. Blightfather's dead. Oh, fuck, there's another one! Jesus, man, this, this has to be the worst one. It actually does. Blightfather's dead. That's it. Get this to lower down. Thank you. Right, and the last one is fire, which is just across from here. This one usually actually gives me a little bit of trouble, so we'll see how this goes. Where's the big guy? That's what I'm most concerned about. Oh, he's there. Right, he's gone now. Right, I'm going to pick up my uh, hammer here and just use that. Ow, 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 stay back. See, them things, they give me so many issues because they take away like 100 health. So if you get smacked by two zombies, you just go down. And with a boss fight like Voyager to spare, you need every self revive you can, you can get, hence why I put on the talisman. I put on the talisman for every Easter egg, but you know, especially for this map, it's probably going to be helpful. Ow. Ah! Right, are we done? Yep. Right, I will gladly take the full Sentinel artifact off your hands. Right, and now we need the other piece for the distillation kit. And the last piece we need for that is in the cargo hold. So, oh god, don't call on me, please. Jesus Christ. Oh my fucking god, please. Oh, that was way too close. I hate this area. Let me out. All right, where's this last piece at? I know. Ow, Jesus, man. 75 HP? Really? There it is. All right, now we need to go back all the way to the engine room and then get this thing built. Where does this fast travel take me? Boiler room. Close enough. Build the distillation kit and can hurry up about it. Jesus. Oh, I'd love to save that last zombie. I really would. Because it'd make this next step so much easier. No. Quickly build it. Hurry up. Okay, ammo. Thank you. All right, now we need to shoot a shit ton of leaks. That one there. I mean, that one. Bro, come on. There's one. We've got plenty of ammo, so I'm not worried about that. I'm just more worried about the zombie dying out. Shoot that one, because I know I can shoot this one. Come on, bro. What What are the angles for these? Jesus, man. How oh, shit did you call your game, Treyarch? Right, there's that one. Come on, give me this one. Why won't it let me shoot that one? Or this one? Why does the game hate me? So one up there. Yep, got that one. There's that one as well. Nice. There's one there. That one. Still trying to shoot this one, though. Yep, there we go. And one more, and I think it's literally just this. Oh, no, there's this one here. Come on. Nope. That one up there. 
Oh, I'm not sure. I'm shooting at the wrong pipe, man. There's the other leak. It's on the other end of the blue pipe. Why am I such an idiot? There we go. That's that one. I think we're literally missing one, and it's this one back here. There we go. Done. Right, and then we need to end the round we're on, and then the pack a punch should come here, right? Yep. Pack a punch sent a lot of facts. Grab it back, and then that's that step done. Right, I'd like to drain the water of this place again, but I don't think we're gonna have time because there's so many zombies spawning in, man. Please don't make me take it down on fire underwater. Please, God. God said, nah, you're taking it down today, bro. Oh, that's so shit, man. I'm by oh, I can't even buy dying. Wish we're too poor. It's fine, though. Sod it off. I actually hate this guy, bro. Double points. Actually quite needed. We are in dire need of a max ammo as well, like Jesus. And a shield. We need, we're in dire need of everything. Go we'll get electric burst back. We also get stamina up, right? We're, we're, we're all right. We're all right. Okay, here's stamina up. Right, and that's all we can afford right now. Fine. Right, now we need to do the planet step. The lo and behold worst step of this map. Right, let's go find these symbols that we have to activate. Let's get this done. First one's right here. Yep, there's one. Our next one is down here. There we go. That's two. Eight more. These zombies. Our next one's over in the state rooms, which is just a jog away from here. By a mirror. Or like hidden behind a plant, if I can remember right. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. There's three. There's number four. There's our fifth one. This is our sixth one, I think. Seventh one. We should probably drain the water in here, huh? Definitely not the smartest idea to keep it, like, you know, flooded. All right, turn this back on. There's the ninth. I can't remember what symbol this number is, but I know it's the last one, I think. Oh, come on, man. Have you got to go prone? What a joke. All right, there we go. That's all nine, ten. I don't know. Okay, first up, Mercury. Now, where is it at? This one flies about. There it is. All right, there's the first one, hopefully. That looks about right. Okay, nice. Next up on our list is Jupiter. Saturn, I meant, sorry. All right, there's Saturn. There's the orb for Saturn. Get me out of here. Kill you, because you are doing my head in. Oh, my God, please. Woo! Right, our next one is the moon, and we need to be in the dining room for that. Oh, my God, there's so many zombies, bro. There we go. Grab the orb, and there we go. That's the moon done. Oh, that nuke would be so useful. Grab it, man. All right, let's head up to the poop deck, because our next one is Neptune. Grab a shield while we're here. There's Neptune. There we go. It's up there. Right, our next one on the list is Mars. Okay, that should be Mars. Oh, yeah, it's coming. All right, engine room. Go, go, go. Grab it. There we go. Right, that's Mars done. All right, Jupiter's next. Where am I shooting Jupiter from to get more stupider? All right, we need to be on the poop deck again. And then where is it at? Jupiter, where are you at, bro? That's Jupiter. There's the orb. Oh, my God, they're all crowded around it like cunts. I hate how they coded it to fucking do that, man. Like, they, they specifically, like, did that. That's so annoying. Fuck you, Treyarch. Oh, the cargo hold was the last place I wanted to be. All right, next one on the chopper block is your Uranus or your ass. <laughs> that wasn't funny. I didn't want to go to the poop deck. No, I wanted to be the opposite. I was there. Right, where's Uranus? There's Uranus. Haha, <laughs> lol. Right, wait for this one to drop in. Right, off it goes. Give me the orb. There we go. Take care of these zombies. Right, our next one is Venus, and we need to shoot it from the aft deck. So there's Venus. There we go. Now we need to run to the millionaire suites. Go, go, go. Okay, yeah, there's a bunch of them here. Jesus, man. Right, okay, we got the orb. Nice. Oh my god, Blightfather, hello. Right, and the last one to do is the sun. Right, here's the sun. Shoot that down. Oh, come on. Come on. Can't aim that high. There we go. Ow, you bitch. Right, there it is. Cool. Pick it up. Pick it up, man. Right, there we go. Oh, shit, I'm out of ammo. Oh, come on, bless me up with one. You know you want to. He's the hammer, maybe? Nah, the hammer's not doing shit. Wait, so what do I do now? I've got no ammo. I quite literally have, like, zero bullets. Uh... Right, got a full clip of ammo. Let's give us another go. Come on, break, you fucker. Here we go. We've just got to be really careful here. Take our time, I think. You do get a lot of it from what I saw. Okay, we're through. Okay, this one's shot. Right, there we go. Run. Jesus, that is a few of them, man. Come on. There we go, max ammo. Bro, we're nearly there. We're nearly there, man. Jesus, my health is so low. What about the raw thing here? Hurry up, melt. Blightfather, don't fuck me over, please, bro. Go. Last one. Come on. Yes! Okay. Okay. There's the boss fight thing. Right. We've got a few more things we need to do before we, you know, jump straight into it. But we're pretty much ready to go to the boss fight. We need to grab the Helion Salvo first, though, because I'm not leaving without that thing. Where's the box at? And there we go. That's what I'm looking for, the Helion Salvo. Pity is now. We've got to save up our points to pack up on shit. So let's get this round ended. Oh, yeah. And I should probably explain why things look a little bit different. And, you know, I'm like, I'm playing as Bruno instead. I think I was playing as um whatever the doctor is called, like the Richthofen clone. Shaw, his name is, I think. Um, I died in that game. I don't know if I kept it in the video because this is like post-production. Pre-production, sorry. But yeah, I died at that little wall there, hence why I picked off from where we left off. But yeah, right now, I'm just trying to build some points so we can get this Helion Salvo fully packed and then we're good to go. Right, I dare say we have enough points now. Let's head down. 
pretty sure packs in cargo hold. We can quickly just chuck it in a couple of times and we can head back up. Here's first one, second one, third, fourth, and fifth. That's just because I don't want cryo freeze. I want something better. Firebomb. That's what I was looking for. All right. We get a max ammo while we're in there. We'll go get a new shield. And then I'm saying we're, it's pretty much time for boss fight. The first two stages shouldn't be too bad. It's when we get like past stage three that it's going to be, you know, a little bit toasty. Stage was one and two are literally just all oh, survive in this room and then grab a max ammo at the end. But we're pretty much ready to go. Everything's charged up. Got homunculuses. We've got level three scepter of raw. I'll show you why I went for the scepter instead of the hammer beforehand. It's mainly because when you're doing stage three, it, things can get a little bit hectic and you can just plant that down and then focus up on the boss to an extent, mind. Like, it only slows them down. It doesn't actually kill them once you place down the scepter of raw, but it does really help out. All right, let's grab another shield. Here we go. And without further ado, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Here we go. All right, we need to swim out of this tree fast and plant our little artifact thingy majig. There we go. Give it the artifact. I've never actually watched this cutscene before. This is kind of sick. Oh, those are all the planets. Okay. Yep, and then the massive ice spawns. Here's the massive iceberg rising from the ground. You know, I'm sure it's fine. This is this is normal. This is how the Titanic happened. What do you mean? All right. Here he is. I'm going to grab the max ammo straight off the bat because we're already way too low. My liking anyway. Right, let's just survive. Shouldn't be too difficult. The one in the engine room down below is definitely going to give us some trouble though, I feel. We do have all three of our self-revives as well, which is handy. Like, very handy. Oh, you have no idea how glad I am to be finally boss fighting, man. Literally, this Easter egg took me about three days to complete. Sat in college, right? Thinking about how fast I'm going to do the rest of the Easter egg once I get in, into the house, man. <laughs> Honestly, this is quite tame so far. It's not too bad. We've got to do the engine room next and it's the exact same thing just with he can fire these little like wisp things that make the zombies stronger i think and then stage three when is when we need to start really worrying i've noticed that if you clip him in the right like area with the ice variant of the kraken it one shots him that was a two shot there i don't know why i think you've got to get him dead in the head that rhymed helion salvo also one shots him okay we're doing well we're doing very well oh there's a blight father okay he made a ruin my day blight fathers have to be some of the scariest bosses we've had man like what the fuck is that thing it's terrifying ow can you sod off? Would also really prefer to keep my dying wish charge just for stage three because it does come in very handy. All right, that's the first stage done. Let's go. There'll be another max ammo and stuff in there for us that we can grab. Might hold off on the carpenter though, just for now. All right, we'll hold off on both of them actually. We've got like a decent chunk of ammo. Yeah, these things, they don't actually damage you. They just make the zombies harder to kill. Not too terrible, not too terrible. I haven't noticed anything. I mean, it's just started, but it doesn't seem very like over the top for a boss fight, especially for its second stage. I guess it just kind of eases you into it because there's fucking five stages. I think this might be the longest boss fight in COD. Well, I might be wrong. Ancient Evil might be a bit longer. I'm not too sure. I'm just going to grab the max ammo now. We'll leave it off on the shield for a little bit. Ice variant has to hands down be the best version of the Kraken. It just slows them down so much. It's brilliant. All right, I'm grabbing the shield thing, carpenter, whatever it's called. See, those bosses are really, really easy to kill. The problem I have with them is that if you get cornered with one, you are fucked. Here's a Blightfather coming to ruin my day once again. Should hopefully be the last of the enemies, I think. We've had a Blightfather now. Nope, they're still spawning. All right, okay. Are they still spawning, man? Oh my god. When's this stage gonna end? Using all my ammo up. Oh god, please don't break my shield. Right, that's stage two done. Let's go! Right, this is the uh, be-all, end-all here. Right, I need to get at the back of this place here and then watch where he's shooting down. I am gonna quickly grab the max ammo, though. Not die to the beam, you know. Standard. And the uh, carpenter here. Right, run, 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 run to the back. What side are you shooting from first, bud? There. Ooh, we need to be careful, man. All right, we got some decent shots on him there, to be fair. I'm going to stick this down. Oh, where's my my scepter of raw? What happened? You know, if I wanted to pull out my shield, I would have said I wanted to pull out my shield. I'm panicking a little bit. There we go. Get some shots on him. Right, okay. It hurt. It said. Okay, the beam's firing again. Can we get a cheeky little shot in and get a couple in? There we go. Don't get cornered, though. Chill. It's this side this time. Yep, yeah, fire your beam. Bro, what do people want, man? Go away. My phone ringing. You're distracting me. Suppose we can just use the scepter of raw here. We'll just make our lives a little bit easier. Try to get some shots on them. Yep, there we go. Oh, there we go. That's stage three done. Let's go. Easy. All right. Don't think we need the max ammo just yet, but I will grab the carpenter because we just need to stay on top of the shield. All right, there he is. We just got to wait. All right, we get some shots on him. Nice. We're doing well. We're doing well. Charging up our scepter would be nice. I'm going to throw a homunculus so we can try to get a shot on him here. Oh, we don't have... Oh, we might get one on. Need to stay on top of the ammo as well because, like, Jesus, bro. It only has four rockets, not 40. I'm going to grab the max ammo here. You're going to fire your beam. You're going to do your thing. Yep. Okay, okay, okay. That's stage four done. Not bad, not bad. Right, stage five. This is where things can get bad. We kind of just need to completely focus everything we have on the boss. Got a shot on him there. Nice. I'm going to throw a homunculus. Make things easier. 
Jesus, man. Get a couple of shots on him again. Nice. That homunculus is doing bits, bro. There we go. Got another shot on him. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Stun him. Stun him. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. Didn't want to pop my dying wish there. We're fine. We're fine. All right, we'll grab the max ammo now. And the carpenter. Why not? Shit. Try to get some shots on him. I think we got enough there. For another homunculus. We do have the thing to do it. The budget. Get some shots on him again. Okay, I think we're nearly there. He's going to do another one. Oh, no. Never mind. Just a beam again. Oh. Oh, wait. Shit. No, he's charging up. Fuck, 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 fuck. All right, no. We stunned him. We stunned him. We stunned him. We're good. Thought we completed it there. I was jumping. <laughs> Get a bit too excited too early. There we go. He's charging up again. Get some shots in. Oh, come on. He's got to be close to being dead now. Speaking of which, our shield is not looking too good. Get some shots in on him. Oh, surely he's nearly dead, man. Stick this up here. Um, oh, fuck. He's charging up again. Oh, we might go down here. It might be over. Come on. Wait, no, we're good. We're good. Oh, did we finish it? Oh, my fucking God. Let's go. Voyage of Despair. Suck my nut. All right. On to nine. I know that seems really anticlimactic, but uh, honestly, bro, there's nothing else I can really say. <laughs> Oh, I'm happy though. I'm happy, right? Voyage of Spare. First one down. Let's go, bro. Right, okay. Here we go. Nine. First map on the BU4 chopping block. Now, we are going to start ourselves off with a little challenge here. Got to get six equipment kills, bro. We can't even do that on round one. It's only five zombies. That's over already, bro. Right, one more here. Oh, oh, oh. Never mind. There's six zombies on round one. I didn't think that existed. Bro, you're joking. Oh, my God. How did I miss that shit? Now, we got to wait for our dodgy fucking grenade to finish. Recharging in the bottom right. Right, okay. Finally, our fucking grenade recharged. Right. Come on, please kill one. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Grab the heart here. Ow. Bastard. Knife kill 13 zombies. Okay. Got some bonus points here. We should hopefully get it this round and then we can run around with shopping free and basically open the entire map and then start appeasing all the gods. But first, I want to try to get the free scorpion wonder off thing, you know, like with the free fetch quest. You know what I mean? And if you are wondering, I am playing this on controller. Now, I don't usually play a lot of zombies games on controller anymore, but BO4 is like the only exception. I don't know what it is. I'm just a lot better on controller than I am keyboard and mouse. I think it's because you can definitely tell that this game was just completely completely designed for controller like from the hood to the fucking gameplay to everything man jesus christ right there we go right what's another challenge come on slide on right that's the perfect one right let's pop a shopping free here and away we go we'll come back and do the blade challenge after i'm gonna grab stamina up as well actually oh bro you can't open doors while you're drinking perks that's ridiculous cold war on top crack this open if we're fast we can get every uh like area open and we won't have to worry about like point budget or anything crack this open crack this open oh i don't know where i am man get this open this one are we gonna be able to get this one over here yes we are right we at least got everywhere down here open and if we didn't i'm sure we've got the points to you know sort it out right let's go slide under a blade trap without taking damage then we'll get our free pack a punch weapon then we can actually start on opening pack a punch because that is the first step of this easter egg switch this on there we go pretty painful I'm not gonna lie. Right, where's my shield piece? I know there's one up here. There it is. Right, let me grab this here. Grab this as well, because we need that for the acid trap, for the free whatever. I can't remember its name. Is it like the, the segment of rot? No, that's the staff thing that you get as a specialist. Right? I don't know what it's called. Segment's kiss? I don't know. Right, it's some of the champion here. I'm gonna try to keep the round as low as possible. Right, okay, there's first head. Second one here. I think these are just gladiators. That is really easy. I can't believe they give you a pack a punch weapon straight off the bat. Tom Van Hersel, thank you for subscribing. See, I I was thinking about turning these little alerts things off because like you know i'm not streaming i'm not live or anything but it'd just be kind of cool if you were watching the video and you just see your name pop up i think i'm just gonna keep them on to be fair with you let me know in the comments if they do get annoying though and i will switch them off i just think it might be cool for some viewers i don't know all right the other shield piece can spawn down here is it down here no it is not okay patrick gissel thank you for subscribing bro i'm getting too many now i shouldn't have said anything <laughs> all right we've got the third champion here this should be easy enough honestly right, there we go there's the third one now we've got to cross over here and get the fourth i do really want to build the shield as well because having that on strap is just always nice. Is it here? No, it is not. Right, we'll sort out the gong first before we start worrying about any of that. Go. What's this one again? Is it? Yeah, it's just two gladiators. There's our shield piece anyway. Oh, fuck. We ended the round. Whatever. It was bound to happen. It's fine. Oh, can you sod off with your axes? There we go. Right, let's go get pack a punch open and then we can focus on the Easter egg because we can actually start it. Right, okay. Chuck these here and then we'll run around and grab the acid trap pieces. I think there's one right here. Question mark. Yep, the gear. There it is. And there is a piece right here on the wall. I think it's chain. Yes, it is. Okay, very nice. Now, we could go look for the skull now, but nah, I think we're gonna go do the free scorpion gun thing. We need to look for that little pot of fire that we can shoot down. I think it's in this corridor here, like, in a, in a back
barrier or a window or something? No, it's not there. There it is. Shoot that over. Right, and then we got to go look for the arrow up top. If you guys don't follow BO4, you probably don't know what I'm on about, but we're just trying to get a free wonder weapon right now. Right, where's it pointing? That is at uh, that one. Okay. Well, we didn't open them gates, so we're going to have to go back into the, the sanctum thing, but let me just make sure what color it is because I don't know the names off by heart. That is blue. Light blue. But you can tell how much I just don't play this game. It's crazy. Here's the head thing that we need, and now we need to go build the acid trap. I think it'd probably be good to just, you know, get this area open as well. Crack this open. Put the little skull down here. Oh, have we got to build it first? I'm confused. Yep, there we go. Right, and then turn that on. Bro, I could really do with a max ammo run right now. I won't lie. That's probably going to end the round. Oh, never mind. He spawned in here. Come on. Give me a max ammo. Bless me up. No, full power. Okay. Okay, so now we kind of just have to wait for the crowd to, you know, chuck stuff at us and maybe give us that, you know, cheeky little vase that we need for the little step where you get the acid from the tree. But they're not going to do it because they're bitches. So what we're going to do is we're going to go start on the main quest. We need to go look for a skull down below in the pack a punch area and then pull out our hammer and it should pop out the wall. Now, where that skull is, I've got an. I've not got it. And it becomes increasingly more difficult when you've got zombies tailing you. That's not good. Go away, man. Oh my god, there's tigers! Alright, okay, maybe fuck that off for now. Let's go back up top and see if they give us the little vase. Because I just heard a quote there, which means we could possibly get it. We do really need a gun, though, because we just completely ran out of ammo. Right, okay, we've got a max ammo here. That's fine. Got a full power there. That's always nice. Oh, we've got two full powers. Okay, hang on. Yeah, there we go. There's our gift from Circa. This is what we needed. Thank you. Right, let's grab this full power again. All right, we don't want to let the round get too high here. So here's the hole in the tree. And place down the cup. There we go. Right, and that'll start dripping. Yep, there we go. All right, we're going to leave that to do its thing. I still need to look for this fucking skull on the wall. Oh, don't be a blight father. I was going to say. All right, we've got a nuke. That's perfect. We should also probably look into getting the Helion Salvo sooner or later. Because it is just a good weapon to have for any, like, BO4 thing you're doing. Better than any wonder weapon in the game, so... I'm going to try and make a crawler here, actually. No, it killed all the zombies. That's great. And here is our skull. Because see, it's got a little blue marking on top of it. Right, okay. It's a max ammo round. I think we're just going to grab a swordfish off the wall here and call it a day. Don't know how good this thing is, but we'll find out. Chuck in the pack-a-punch machine as well. <laughs> Honestly, right, round 10 getting the skull step. Not terrible, but it could have been a lot better. Our venom for the mystery box should also be done, so we can go grab the wonder weapon soon. <laughs> they must have upped the spawns on BO4 or something, man. There's too many zombies. I just want to start the Easter egg, bro. And I'm just getting bombarded. Okay, there's our skull. Perfect. Right, now we can go get our free wonder weapon and then we can actually start grinding this skull down into bone marrow because for some fucking reason we need that. There's our full vial and hold square to poison the mystery box. Give me that free wonder weapon, bro. And also lag my entire game. Yep, cheers. All right, cool. This is literally all I wanted. Now we've got to go find this little like grinder thing that we've got to power with it. It's actually down here, so it's funny enough that we are down here. Now, if I can remember its spawn locations, that would be great, but I just can't, so I'm just going to have to keep scouring about. Is it here? No. Nope. Oh, it's there. Okay. Stick the skull in there. You gotta get a charge shot on it as well. Yep, yep, there we go. Is it doing it? Yeah, it's doing it. Charge up another shot here. I think you gotta do it three times, or is it four? I don't know. It's just until it turns into bone marrow. Right, there we go. Now we need to get bad affinity with the crowd, because funnily enough, we need actual poo to make this fertilizer. So we're just gonna keep running through the fire here and waiting for our health to regen. Right, there we go. It's almost fully red. That's what we need. Right, there we go. Fully red. That's exactly what we needed. Come on, crowd. You know you wanna do it. Do your thing. Can I, can I throw grenades off you and you'll do it? Right, there we go. This should be it, I think. Yep, there we go. Perfect. Right, now the only thing we are missing is the little spike of wood that drops off one of these spires here that we need to go and chuck, bro. Fuck off. You're not an electric zombie. You're not him. As I was saying, we need to get one of them axe things to throw his axe off that spire and he'll break off a little bit of wood that we can pick up and we need that. Right, I'm going to level up our fucking axe thing, the hammer, whatever thing here. Come on. You know you want to spawn them in game. Don't be a knob. Right, here we go. Here we go. This is the round I was waiting for. Hopefully it's not tigers. I think it should be gladiators. Right, yeah, there. Right, chuck your axe. Come on. You know you want to do it. Yep, that's it. Thank you for the little bit of wood. Chuck it on here and then we got to wait a couple of rounds for it to go charred and black and whatever. For now, we can go and kill these guys because they have no use used to us. Our Z Harmony's really not doing much anymore, huh? Right, there we go. Nice little max ammo. We can go grab the rest of our perks as well. We should probably do that. And also build the shield. How many parts are we missing? One. All right, there's Dying Wish. I think it's 5k for this perk, man. Oh, there's the final shield piece anyway. Cool. And Electric Cherry. I'm gonna go build the shield quick downstairs as well, because it's just useful to have on, even if we're not using it for the Easter egg right now. I'm gonna clear them all out here with my specialist weapon. We've got to wait this round anyway, so we're not really doing any harm by killing all these zombies here. That is a fucking napalm zombie. All right, let's quickly build the shield. Come on. Give me. There we go. All right, let's get this Death of Orion packed because we might as well. It's not that good anyway, so Pack a Munch is probably definitely going to help it out. Sir Kets Kiss. That's where I was getting that from. It's actually called the Death of Orion. Okay. 
Jesus, yeah, the set harmony is dropping off, bro. I suppose we can go check on the wood, but I, don't, I doubt it's going to be done, to be fair. But if it is, that doesn't mean we can continue on with the Easter egg. Nah, it's not done. The amount of this Easter egg that is just waiting for the rounds to like go past and everything is just fucking ridiculous, in my opinion, man. It's the game. The game wants you to get up to a high round, so it becomes more difficult. But man, I miss when you could just do all the steps like as fast as you really wanted to and not necessarily limited by what round you're on or waiting for something. And I think that's why BO3's Easter egg really shined in comparison to these and also because BO4s are just an absolute clusterfuck, I won't lie. Suppose we can try out the Death of Orion here. I doubt it's going to do much, though. Ah, well, fuck off, Tiger Man. We do have our level 2 hammer here, so we are gradually leveling that up, which is great. Now that we have a little bit of free time, I think I'm going to go hit the box, actually. Okay, right. Let's pop an immolation here. Ideally, I want the Helion Salvo. I don't think we'll get it, though, first try. Cap 45, don't do me like that, bro. Come on. Tiger Shark, not terrible. VMP, bro? The vent right, I guess we're taking the VMP then. Let's head downstairs and quickly pack a bunch of bro. I didn't feel like I, I always forget this is in the game. And it also has a MAGA 50 for some reason. I don't understand why. All right, let's go check on the wood. Surely it'll be done by now, right? Where is it? Yeah, there we go. It's all charred. Okay, yeah, this VMP is good as well. All right, okay, now we need to find the bowl, which is back here, and let them mix together, I guess. Which is, again, waiting another couple of rounds. Actually ridiculous activities from BO4. Especially this Easter egg, man. Honestly, brazen bull, best wonder weapon. Ah, it's a Blightfather. Bro, Blightfathers don't even give you drops. That's criminal. Right, is the funny dung smoking yet? No, it is not. Oh my god. All right, gladiator around that actually comes in a little bit clutch because it's basically a round skip. Ow, 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 ow. Fuck off. Bro, they are eating my bullets. All right, there we go. And that's round. Hopefully it should be done by now. I don't know if it's three or two rounds you have to wait. All right, nah, cool. It's done. All right, now we've got to shift it over to the Danu tree and then wait another two to three rounds. Bro, this Easter egg is hella boring. <laughs> it's fine, though. It's fine. We do it for the content. All right, chuck this here. All right, there we go. Now we've just got to wait for it to start smoking green. We also need firebomb on our gun, so we should probably work on that. Just need to build points, honestly. Oh, my God. Let's use a hammer here. Bull power has to be the most broken drop, bro. I've had this specialist out for, like, fucking three minutes now because I've just been getting really lucky with drops. All right, once this round's done, we'll clear out this one, round 18, and then we'll go down and get firebomb on the gun because we should have enough points by then to basically cycle every single one. Oh, fuck. Oh, the fire is so bad, man. Okay, we've got a hammer again here. I'm going to use the shit out of this thing. Oh, my God. There's a load of them. We have a hammer level three as well. That's great. I suppose we should probably go get firebomb now since we've got a bit of downtime. It'll just make this VMP fucking insane by the time we're done with it. So I'm not complaining, really. We've got the points to do it. That in there. Kilowatt. That is not what I need. Cryo freeze. Nope. Firebomb. Perfect. All right, let's see how the VMP does now. Oh, yeah. That's so much better. All right, let's see if it's smoking. Are you smoking? No, you're not. Come on. Oh, this is such a joke, man. I hate having to wait. I'm like so impatient. I'm so ADHD brain. I would fancy a max ammo right now, but I don't think we're going to get one. Oh, 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 oh. No, no, bro. That would have just been so perfect. Insta kill does work out as well, though. Ow, ow, ow. Fuck. How am I almost going down on insta kill, bro? That's criminal. Right, let's go check this thing. Oh, we ran out of ammo on the VMP, bro. Maybe we'll get blessed. Maybe we'll get blessed. Right, it is. Sw yes, we got blessed. Let's go, bro. Oh, my God. There's tigers as well. What? Hammer fucking takes quick work of them, like. Right, there we go. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, we've run out of a shield. That's why I'm getting hit so much. Okay. Right. Let's try to get this kill quick. All right, yep, there we go. It's done. It's done. It's done. I don't know what I dropped. Ooh, carpenter. I do really want another shield, though. You actually underestimate how hard BO4 is sometimes. I know I've, I used to say, like, oh, you get jug when you spawn in, blah, blah, blah. Honestly, it's still quite difficult. I do need out of here, bro. Right, we've got to go start that Danu thing. So I think we've just got to go get kills with a specialist over it. Right, let's go appease Danu. All right, pull out the specialist weapon. Start killing zombies and they should teleport us. Right, there we go. Off we go. We've just got to shoot these little red pocket things. Yep, there they are. Oh, this is bad, bro. I'm glad we got a shield. Fire off one of these and then lay into it again. I think this step's really all about patience because you can go down so easily in it, bro. Yep, there we go. Insta kill. That is actually kind of perfect. Right, there's one of the pockets gone. Maybe burned out would be good for this. I don't know. Come on, one more. There we go. Right, thanks for the max ammo. And then this is the last one. Oh, be careful, be careful. I think I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna pop a burned out here. Come on, it should be nearly done by now. There we go. Right, that's Danu done. Right, that's one of the gods. Right, now we need to go about and look for little brazen bulls to shoot with the shield because we're going to go do this one next, which is arguably one of the hardest ones. There's one up there. Just trying to clear out the round so we can go look for more of them. But I did see one above the thing. Right, okay, there's the first one. Bro, this VMP is doing nothing now, man. All right, there we go. There's the first sacrifice. We're going to go find more now. Let's go have a look underground. Okay, there's not one here. There's none there. Okay, there's one. Really trying to be careful not to 
end the round here because I can't be arsed. And there we go. There's a the second sacrifice. We need two more. There's another one. Shoot that. Run. I will give it one thing. The scorpion gun, not too terrible for taking out gladiators. They kind of fall like regular zombies once you start shooting them with this because it just takes off all their armor instantly. All right, there we go. And there's our final one. Okay. One's going to come out the wall here. Yep, there we go. All right, that's the final one. Okay, I want to try get a gun that can actually kill zombies now from the box. So we're going to go locate it because after this, we've got to kill a bunch of zombies in a certain order and I want a gun that can actually kill rather than just like dump 80 bullets into them and kill about four. Right, where's the box at? Oh, it's downstairs, isn't it? The Hitchcock? Nah. Helion Salvo, that will do. All right, let's get this shit packed. Bro, you can get AATs on a rocket launcher. What? Was that a thing in BO3 or was it just like a BO4 thing? Right, okay, we've got it in the highest tier pack. I suppose let's go start this step then. Right, okay. I need to get the little guide pulled up to read the symbols here. Hang on. Okay, so our first one is brawler. Our second one's electric. Our third one's fire. And then our fourth is water. Okay, right. Where's the brawler at? Where is the brawler? Can kill regular zombies, just not the special ones. That's the electric one. That's a fire one. Bro, where's the brawler? Come on. That's water. Bro, they're all here but the one I need. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. The fire one exploded and killed them all. Now oh, we have to go another round now. Great. Bro, the fucking Helion salvo was ridiculous. It's my first time actually properly using it, like, fully packed. Fucking lion rounds me means we have to go another... Oh, never mind. All right, it's done. I was going to say means we have to go another full round, but no, never mind. All right, let's see. Is it the same order? No, it's not. Great. Fire, gladiator, brawler, and then what the fuck is that? Blightfather, bro. No. All right, where's the fire zombie at? I'm going to kill him first. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? There he is. No way that didn't one shot him. Fuck off. Right, there we go. He's dead. Right, where's the gladiator? There's the gladiator. I fucking hate the Sekhmet's kiss, man. Oh my god. What a shit wonder weapon. We gotta go again. Okay, I shit you not. It's took me two games. Fucking nine million rounds to get the first one done. But we finally did it, bro. Look at that. Now we gotta do that shit all over again. I'm the anyway, but here and let me out here. If anybody in the comments calls God mode, by the way, I, I you, you can't open the fucking console on BO4. And I'm gonna aim a knife and show you. Now I'm not using God mode. This step just took us far too fucking long, man. I just wanna have this Easter egg over and done with. Right, let's do the next one. Right, okay. Fire, poison, electric, water. That's gonna be a fucking doozy. The way I've kind of figured it out though is you just gotta stay on top of the regular spawns and then you can uh, no i want fire first not electric oh my god that's poison see fire is one of the most annoying ones to get first ow man come on where's my fire zombie there he is shit i gotta be careful right there and then it's poison next i got him get i gotta get him out of that group though bro yeah that's poison gone somehow then we need electric which he sometimes stops in the middle so that's kind of useful hang on like that yep he's gone and last one's water yep that's it oh my god yes Yes! Oh my god, I'm so happy. Okay, okay, right. I need, I need to remember, it's still mid-round 25. Oh my god! Oh my god, okay, 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 okay. Ra has been motherfucking appeased. All right, we gotta do these two fuckers next. I am gonna wait till the end of a round, though. It feels so good to have that one out the way, man. It was giving me so much trouble. Don't want to end this round. I just want to get to, like, the last zombie-ish. Oh, fuck, man. Why did it have to give me a nuke? It just did that to be a troll. Fire sale? I mean, we can't really use that at the minute. Is it gonna be a funny round? Yes, okay. As soon as we get through this round, we can start on the next one. We're probably gonna go into the boss fight, probably, like, round 40. Maybe. Like, round 35-ish. Right, we're gonna wait till the end of this round, then we're gonna go proceed with... I think it's Zeus next. This has been an absolute doozy of an Easter egg, man. I'm saying that like it's done. Still got ages yet to go. Right, okay, that's round. Right, let's ascend this screw to the top. Did it go to the top? Nope. Almost there. There we go. Gotta find three more. I'm so glad we did this at the end of a round. It takes so long. There's the other one. Oh my god, please don't kill him. Holy shit. Well, me trying to make a crawler did end the round, unfortunately, so I think it's over. Two. I need another one. Fuck. Oh no, it's so I'm popping a burned out, bro. Raised. We need to look for the one in the Danu tunnel. I think that I think that's the last one I haven't raised. Yep, this one. When oh bro, that's so fucking annoying, man. This isn't even the hard part of this step either, bro. It's just I'm having the most annoying fucking look all the time. I actually don't like this map. So I, I actually I used to love it. I used to think it was a I think it was, I was on par with BO3. I hate this map so much. So why is there a wonder weapon, right? That has 90 bullets, fair enough, right? That probably means it's a little bit underpowered. That's calm. So why is there a wonder weapon? When, when I've shot five rounds into the boss zombie's face, it does nothing. Hmm? It's pack-a-punched. It just, it just, no, 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 it doesn't want to do anything. I'm 
actually losing my mind with this map, man. Right, okay, are we done with this step? I just raised the final one. Are we done? Riley Vibes, thank you for the sub, bro. We are done with this step because we're allowed out now. Great. Right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm getting the fucking Helion Salvo, and I'm going to go pack a bunch of it because I need a weapon that actually kills, and I'm sick of using this Z Harmony. The only reason why I held on to it so long was for the raw step, and we've done the raw step now, so I'm done. Give me the Helion Salvo. Don't do me like this. Come on. Not the fucking Locust, man. The Hitchcock... Uh, the, oh, no, no, what's it called? The Essex Model 07. What a great weapon, by the way. What a great weapon for round 28. All right, let's go get our perks back. I'm so upset, man. Electric Cherry. Fucking Dying Wish. And it's still not recharged. Honestly, right? Dying Wish is good when it's fucking charged. When it's not, when you're just waiting about for it. It's a waste of a perk slot. Where's the box, bro? Give me the Helion Salvo. This instant. Yeah, I, I, I did ask for the SDM, didn't I? Can get a little. What is that? The fucking RK7. Who do you take me for, bro? What is this? The Rampart? I, I feel like this would be... I think I feel like this is kind of like the Scar, but I'm not taking it. I want the Helion Salvo. Is the Helion Salvo just been removed in some sort of hotfix? Like, what? Huh? Huh? Is it just not in the game anymore? Can the box actually move as well? This is such a bad location for it. Yeah, there we go. There's my favorite mystery box in the whole wide world. Now, give me the Helion Salvo. But no, that, that, does that look like it? Why is it... Why does the Argus look so fat on this game? Who knew an RPG could be so rare? Okay, the Micro MG. It's not a bad weapon. I just don't want it. Oh, we got Homunculus. Okay. They're quite useful. Okay, that's the box moved again. We just not getting the Helion, is that just how this goes? And the round ended, isn't that fucking great? One more hit. The fuck is the Vendetta, bro? What is this shit? Right, give me a war weapon. I'm throwing a fucking homunculus or whatever they're called. Right, I need dead wire, bro. Come on. Yes. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. Right, I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. And right, now we've got to fill up these little electrical podiums here, which I'm working on with fucking killer what? Oh, my God. This is definitely one of the longer steps. Oh, my God. Right, there we go. That's one of them done, I think. Question mark. No, what? How many does it take? Right, I'm going to try to upgrade my weapon a little bit more and see if it, like, fixes out the problem that we're having of dead wire not killing them. Green Ross. Okay, we're at max and we have killer, killer what? That's kind of perfect. Right, let's see if this does it. Please? The fuck am I doing wrong here, bro? Something's telling- Okay, there's one of the things lit up. Thank fuck. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Oh my god, I'm still losing my mind, man. This Easter egg is killing me. Bro, it's giving me fire. I, I just want, like, a, I don't know, maybe an insta-kill or something like that. i gonna throw one of these in here. See if that does anything, I guess. Not a single killer water zombie from that. Okay, cool. This is actually abysmal, man. Gladiators are pissing me off, man. Right, okay, there's another tower lit up. That's two out of four. Okay, we're, we're making progress here. This is a, this is actual progress. Holy shit. Okay, this one here's got to be close. We've filled up, I think, three. Got to have so much patience for this Easter egg, man. It's crazy. Oh, my God. Two more of these towers left to do. Then we've got to do the specialist thing. Then we've got to do a whole other fucking god, which I think's him or him. I don't know. And now they switch the fire on. Isn't that great? Okay, that's another one. Done. All right, three out of four. Using the homunculus might be the strat. I don't know. Right, I'm going to get rid of these fucking gladiators, man. <laughs> They're so annoying. I actually feel like this map is literally... How can we make the most annoying features known to man? Because I don't feel like this when I'm playing Blood at all. Give me this. Oh my god, a max ammo. It's kind of perfect. Right, okay, we're fully done. Four out of four. Holy shit. Right, I am going to go get myself a brand spanking new shield. And we're going to go do this. It's just a specialist weapon. It is round 33 level health, but I think we've got it in the bag. Bro, we'll be fucking lucky if we get in a boss fight by round 40. Holy. There's the shield. My beloved. Oh, you can't just go for it from here. Oh, can you? No, okay. We've actually got to finish the fucking round. That's so annoying. Maybe we should go try for a, a Helion Salvo. In fact, yeah, let's go do that. I just want a weapon that can kill, man. And that's literally the only one that really can at this point. Please. The fuck is that? The ballistic that bro. No, no, no Helion Salvo for us. Okay. I'm trying to think if it's even worth it at this point. Oh my god! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I almost just went down. We'll give the box like a couple of more spins until it moves. Bro, how hard is it? Does the he I'm convinced the Helion Salvo doesn't exist. I'm also convinced this Wonder Weapon was probably designed by like Jason Blundell's left toe. It's so bad. What is that? Nothing I'd want. The fucking mog. I'm mogging right now, bro. Where is the Helion Salvo? Oh my god. Oh my god, I didn't think this day would come. Holy shit. Put that in there. Please tell me I'm still recording. Yes, I am. All right, Helion Salvo. Here I come. Absolutely perfect. We got this thing fully packed. Right, I'm ready to go into that thing. I'm going to go kill this last gladiator here. Give me my max ammo. Right, we need to run. We have a full shield. We don't have a full specialist, but we can get that really easily because we get it anywhere when we go in. I'm very nervous because I don't want to lose my self revives, especially not for the boss fight. Let's give it a go. Oh, full power. All right, okay. Here we go. We got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. I think. I'm just going to keep using the little, like, burst thing we have on the hammer here. Seems to be doing bits. Bro, we actually have, like, a train of them. What the fuck? Oh, we had a dying wish already. That is criminal. We have to send out a homunculus here. Yep, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. 
Surely we're nearly done now, man. Another homunculus going out. Oh my god, of course, of course we go down during this bit. Otherwise, why wouldn't we? Why wouldn't we? Are we done? Or did we lose because we went down? Oh no, we're done. We are done. Christ alive, man. I'm just going to pop this now because I, I just, I can't be asked to go and run grab perks again. I don't know what we got, but it looks good. Oh, we got, we, is that PhD? No, that's not PhD. A little bit of a shame. All right, let's try save a zombie because I do want to do the trick shot soon for the next one, which is this, no, this fucker. Jesus, Jesus. Round 34 is not fun, man. Oh my god, that carpenter's so clutch. All right, I think now we're pretty much ready to start the trick shots. Now, these can be so difficult or so easy, depending on, like, I want to say skill, but it's also a little bit RNG because that BO4's hit reg is, like, notoriously terrible. I think it's trick shot time anyway. Yes, it is. Okay. Oh, I thought we had it there. Oh, did they all get witness wailed? No. Probably one of the hardest steps, honestly. It's just constant trial and error. Okay, we got a crawler now. That's good, but if he dies up, we're kind of fucked. There we go, finally. Right. I know I keep tending to do a lot of the harder ones off camera, but sometimes I just need to buckle down and focus up. So I do apologize if it looks like I'm, like, I don't know, maybe cheating, but I don't see how I possibly could, bro. Like, look, F and knife, nothing, aim and knife, hang on, hang on, nothing. Oh my god, it activated a ring. Oh, I'm cheating. <laughs> okay, there's our second one. Honestly, the first one's probably the hardest. Okay, this is our last one here. Please just work first try. Nope. Oh, this one's going to be a pain in the arse and that zombie might die. No, he's good. Is that it? Yes, that's it. Oh my god, let's fucking go. Right, all we got to do now is step on that pressure plate back there. But we need to be careful because it sends us into like this lockdown Gorod Krovi type shit. And it's round 34 and it'll be round 35 by the time we go in. But I honestly think we're kind of ready. We've got to fully... Uh, nah, yeah, we're ready. We're ready. Where is it? I didn't mean to throw homunculus, bro. Oh, you can put them away in this game that's sick all right okay here we go i think the strat is probably going to be to use the death of orion here and try and slow them down before they come in let's just try and take our time with it here okay yeah the helion salvo is definitely going to help out here just need to be watchful of our ammo as well we're gonna chuck a homunculus here because we are running out of ammo in the death of orion is that fire zombie gonna fucking die jesus surely that won't be it did we get a max ammo or something i'm, I'm kind of desperate for one uh oh i'm gonna pop a, a little burned out here just to be safe so honestly, it isn't too bad. Now that I, I think this is definitely helping out, but do you know what else would help out? A fucking max ammo. Please, game? Can you just be nice for once? Oh my god. Right, okay. We're back. We're so back. It's probably going to be a blight for though, and it's going to fuck us up. To be fair with you, if you're patient with the death of Orion, it's not too bad. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of this poison zombie straight off the cuff here. I don't want anything to do with that. There's another one here. Nope. Nope. Okay, there's, an there's a couple of these coming in now. I would use the trap in the middle there, I just saw, but I feel like it would be more of a danger to me than the fucking zombies. Okay, there's more spawn, and I heard the noise. Surely we're nearly done right now. There's been like five waves. Come on. Oh, we got another max ammo. I'm not complaining. There's probably going to be a blight father. That's the only other enemy that hasn't spawned in. Oh my god. I didn't expect them all to start spawning in like that, bro. Don't do that to me. Don't spawn tigers and then and then just spawn a whole ass horde of zombies in front of me. I'm going to try and save my specialist for the blight father. Okay, it's getting a little bit hectic now. I'm going to throw a homunculus here. Lob that over there. Please don't kill me. Winter's whale's got my back. But there's still more spawning in. I see you down there. We done? No, that didn't sound like... Oh, that was the Blight Father spawning in. Okie dokie. Well, you know what that means. That's getting shot. There he is. Right. He's getting flung just here. Now, where's Mr. Blightfather? There he is. Hello. Yep. Not so big and scary now, are you? Are we getting the max ammo? Have we finished it? What, what's the crack? Oh, no. The key was just on the floor there. Cool. Right. I think we're done now. Uh, honestly, I think we're done. We just have to boss fight now. Okay. Yeah. There's the portal for the boss fight. Right. I don't know what to do here. Are we ready to go? Most definitely not. <laughs> Look at our ammo, bro. Okay. Full power's nice. Fuck off, man. Not now. Not now. I think I'm going to go one more round just in case we get the max ammo round because I don't want to go in there with like fucking 13 bullets in the Helion. Use my specialist here and try and get rid of a lot of them. Just get me the next round, bro, because I know it's going to be a max ammo round. I just know it. Are you going to give me a max ammo? No, you're not. You're going to give me a nuke. Okay, it should be a funny round. If not, please give me a max ammo. No, full power. Right, it's it's useful. Please. Yes, 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 yes. I knew I was being smart there. Once we get that max ammo, we are fucking gone, bro. All right, okay, let's use the specialist hammer here. Should be the max ammo. Yes. All right, okay. Here goes nothing. Here it comes, I think. I think it's the elephant first, not the gladiators. And then there's another elephant. Or is it gladiators? No, it's gladiators. Okay. <laughs> this is doable, because I've got the Helion Salvo. We can not just be using the uh, the Death of Orion as well, because it chains. Okay, that's a max ammo. Very nice. I'm just going to keep my distance with them all, really, because the axe throwers can only throw so far. Using my Death of Orion as well. It's another max ammo. Okay, I'm going to make the most out of this then. How come when the Helion Salvo 
locks onto something, right? It'll just go straight past it. I don't get it. Okay, tigers don't need the rocket launcher. They can just get deal with this. Oh, God. Okay, we dying wished. Okay, I'm not... Uh, right, I'm not taking any chances. Fuck it. We're just going to use this. Thanks for the 500 points. Okay, there's a max ammo there. Perfect. I'm missing an enemy here. Oh, God. Here comes the elephant. I was not expecting that. Okay. 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 We're doing this now, are we? Oh, my God. God, that thing's actually terrifying. That is actually so scary. Oh my god, there's zombies now. The zombies, the zombies, the zombies, the zombies. Right, can you just fuck off? Oh my god, bro, his attacks are crazy. It's a max ammo there, okay. That will do. Homunculus out, bro. You gotta keep shooting its ribcage, man. Just gotta keep shooting its ribcage. Now they're spawning gladiators. What? Nah, that's not fair. Run, 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 man, run. Okay. I can't tell if we're doing damage. I think we are. Let's lob another one of these. Surely he's nearly dead now, right? Oh, stay behind. Stay behind. All right, he's almost gone. He's almost gone. Oh my god, what's he doing? Whatever he's doing, I'm moving, bro. Is it a bad time to tell you that this is my first time doing this boss fight? All right, I'm gonna lob another homunculi so I can focus up on him. Jesus! Oh my god, did we kill? Right, okay. That's the first elephant down. I am, bro. I'm so proud of how far we've came. I'd like to shout out my mother, my entire family bloodline. Let's fucking go. Right, shock horror. There's another elephant. <laughs> okay, here's the second one. Is this one any different? I, I, I kind of doubt it. Do we shoot its head? I don't know what we're doing. Ribcage again? Yeah, ribcage. Okay, it's fine. Just do it exactly how we did it before. That must be a new attack because that feels way too overpowered. She just shoots all that shit around. That's not fair. Jesus! Yeah, that max ammo would be much appreciated right now. And that full power. It's a lob of homunculus. Bro, I swear to God, move. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Regen my ammo. Regen, regen, regen. I have quick revive. This feels criminal, bro. <laughs> It's actually terrifying when it starts charging at you. I don't like how fast it drains my HP with this one. That's cringe. Let's lob one of these again. I'm so glad we pulled them things from the box, bro. Ow, 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 ow. Is that his armor gone? It just, it just made a trumpet, bro. Yeah, his armor's gone. Right, cool. Fuck him up. Oh my god, what is that attack? What is that attack? What is that attack? He, like, actually almost juked me out. I'm gonna pop a stock option here, just so we have infinite rockets. All right, lob a homunculus. Far, far away. Keep shooting it, keep shooting it, keep shooting it. Oh my god, have we done it? Have we finished nine? Are we done? Please tell me we're done, bro. Please, please. Are we done? Oh my god. Oh my god, you have no idea how long I have waited to finish this stupid fucking easter egg oh my god bro this is actually hype right okay on to the next one okay well blood of the dead this is gonna be a long one now i'd be lying to you if i said i haven't already had a couple of cracks at this bro i've had like four attempts so far and they've all gone south but uh, this will be the one this will be the one one two and then knife right wellens would twice not like the knife compared to the traditional eight for whatever reason but we want to kill enough so that we have enough for both of these doors but we want to save one zombie right okay like that and then we can get this door up we can also get this one open and once we head down here we can get the first power switch on and then now we can open up the catwalk if you're wondering why i didn't pop my shopping free as soon as we spawned in we're gonna do it on the main island just so we can get as much open as possible this catwalk still gives me the nerves man it's actually still so difficult All right okay dogs are spawning in now okay warden's spawning in that's perfect try and run past them all here but now i'm pulling out the specialist fuck it come on die you stupid piece of shit come on how many Kaze slashes can bro take? You mean to tell me the Wellen is stronger than that thing? Okay, whatever. Right, we have our first shield piece. Let's hope the second one's right here. No, it is not. Right, we'll do this. We'll pop this shopping free now. Get this open. Jump down here. Get that open. Gonna run back and get the roof open because we have enough points to get down to the second power switch anyway. Get the cafeteria open. Get this open. We definitely probably could get a couple of more Citadel doors open if we're fast here. I don't think we're gonna get all the way down to power. We might get this next one open. Yeah, I think that's pretty much all we got time for. Maybe the showers too for fast. Get that open. Oh! Yeah, we got it. All right, let's go get this second power switch on then and we can also look for the other shield part. Not there. That open. By here? Please be by here. Nope, okay. Is it here? Yes, it is. Right. Crack this open. Get this other power switch on. Gonna grab an ICR off the wall. All right, nice. He gave us some extra points too. Perfect. Get the docks open. And that is pretty much the entire map, I'm pretty sure. We also got after tasting of a third elixir slot here. That's always nice. We'll go grab our third shield part and then we can start doing some stuff and things. We need to get pa pack a punch on first, not power. We've only just done that. There's the other shield piece. 
Get this shield built. There we go. Grab this acid gas piece. Acid gas? Acid gap piece, because why not? End the round. Get our 300 points. Should be a dog round now that we can use to our advantage, because we need to get the shield and stuff. All charged up. Yeah, it is a dog round. Cool. See, they just pop like balloons. If we did this with zombies, it would just take longer. There we go. Full blast. All right, let's get pack up on Tron then. Bosh. It's another warden, bro. How many times does he want to spawn in? Why doesn't he get stunned when you knock off his helmet like in BO2? Double points. I suppose we can use a little bit of it here, but I want to save the zombies for this next dog head that we're going to go do because we need to start on the Hell's Retriever as soon as possible. We need it to actually start the Easter egg. We should also work on the blunder get after that. Here's our first dog head. I don't know why I don't pick up the ICR 7 enough. It's such a good weapon. It's literally just the ICR from BO3, but better. Got another one here. We've got two more of these to do. There's one on the Warden's house, and then I'm pretty sure there's one in New Industries that we'll do last. I think he needs two more. Maybe one more. Oh, wait, no, that's it. There we go. All right, okay, let's just get this round ended. The round change music, bro, everything about this map is just so solemn. I actually really like the atmosphere that we're going for because, you know, we're all kind of dead and whatever in Blood of the Dead, but whatever. Uh, 191 is our combination for the rigging. Let's get this other dog head filled up. Same shit as before. That's his second one, so he needs four more. I swear it's six. It has to be six, right? Because 666, it would just make sense. It's his third. It's his fourth. I think this is his fifth. Right, no, so it's five. Okay, wait, whatever. All right, let's drain these zombies here so we can get another charge. We're going to need it soon anyway. All right, there we go. What was this again, quickly? 191. All right, last one's a new industry, so let's go get this finished. It's a shame they didn't incorporate the uh, Golden Gate Bridge in this. I really would have preferred if you could just build the plane again and then just fly over the pack a punch instead of the system we got in this, but they did have to change it, otherwise it would have just been the same map. They did make a lot of changes though compared to Mob of the Dead. Like, this whole catwalk area, New Industries, all this stuff was just not here. New Industries. Here's a mystery box as well. I'm gonna start spinning this so we can upgrade our shield. The Helion Salvo. Well, that's a keeper. All right, let's get this dog started. He's nearly done now. Get another hit on the box. All right, he's done. Cool. Oh, come on. Give me enough of the fast travel. No, you're joking. Can I stab him twice? All right, no, there we go. We need to go take the fast travel from the showers, which we'll go do now. All right, this is the fast travel we needed because it takes us directly through the path of the Hell's Retriever. Also, this is such a cool attention to detail because it's like the little like thing where you pick it up as fell through over the years. Bro, just the amount of detail that used to go into zombies maps is actually crazy. All right, let's start the Hell's Retriever. Free blunder get upgrade thing here. There we go. There's the first skull. Go get the one on the roof. I always struggle with this one on the roof. I don't know why. Let me just double check where it is. So it's there. See, like that. How doesn't that grab it? I don't understand. There we go. We got it. Nice. All right, we need the one down at the docks and then New Industries. Oh, on the way there, actually, we can probably grab the Warden's Office one. There we go. That's that one. Oh, while we're here, actually, we can also do this. I think the code was 191. If not, I'm going to feel like a massive idiot, but we can just do this. Hang on. There we go. And then 191. Yeah, let's go. All right, and then this big cage here drops down, I'm pretty sure. Yep, there we go. We need to go here anyway, and this is a part of the Easter egg. So first, let's grab the skull. There we go. And Spirit Blast this. Go away from my Hell's Retriever to charge up, though, first. And then blast this. We need to kill the zombie anyway, so... And then throw Tomahawk off that. Cuts off the arm. We get the spoon. And our last goal is all the way back at New Industries. We need to also start working on our Path of Sorrows down at the bottom, our specialist weapon. Because we need that shit level 2 if we want to get the free monkey bombs. Fuck it, we'll pull it out now and just start clearing out some zombies. Because we might as well. There's literally nothing else we can really be doing. There's our last skull. Alright, we'll just head back through this way. And there it is, our free blunder gas. We can start upgrading this soon. I'm just thinking, is there anything else we could be doing? We can go knife the wall, but realistically, not really. There we go. Alright, and we'll just end this round now. Carpenter, perfect. Whilst we're charging up the uh, Path of Sorrows here, we can also start the upgrade process for this. We just gotta chuck the blunder guy in there, and then we gotta charge it up. With the Helion Salvo's only other weapon, I'm a little bit worried, but it's only round six. We should be fine. Honestly, camping at the stairs might be the play here. Oh, what's this? Please be like, oh, something useful. Let's go. Oh, the Warden's on his way. How many Helion Salvo rockets, bro? I was actually better off using the Retriever. Also, that nuke doesn't help. Right, whip out the Katana. We need to charge it up anyway, so it's a good use. All right, okay, that's all of it charged, but we're still going to use the Katana, because less zombies to worry about whilst we're running about looking for these barrels to upgrade it to the Magma Gat. Oh, come on, it's nearly there. All right, that's definitely last zombie. All right, deposit the Essence. Pick up Tempered Blunder Gat. Run! That one. Need to be very careful not to click, because it, like, halves the time that you have when you shoot it. There we go. It's a barrel here. Yep, there we go. Now, this is the longest one. You've got to be super fucking quick. Jeez! Jesus, there we go. There's a barrel just here. Yep. And there's a one just outside New Industries. Chuck this in here, and there we go. Genuinely quite a fun upgrade process. Just still a bit nerve-wracking every time I do it. Fucking Warden again, bro. I think now would be a good idea. Time, which one do I want to say? 
to start grabbing our perks though anyway because quick revive just lets us regen much faster oh max ammo we've got to end the round again anyway so that's fine all right he's dead double points oh that could come in very handy i'm also going to charge my shield because we are getting up in the rounds now round eight this is what I mean, bro. Getting a full charge on the shield is actually so difficult once you start getting up into these rounds. I'll quickly use a Helion Blast here. Loads of points. All right, let's use our specialist weapon here. Please don't tell me we cleared out the entire round. I would be very upset. That's at level two now anyway, I think, the bar's full. I'm not too sure, though. And I think now would probably be a great time to upgrade the shield, but we just got to spin the box till it moves. Dog round two. Oh, bro, he locked the fucking box. No, okay, that's can't go. Come on, give me the lock. Just give me it early, come on. No, okay. Hades is a good weapon, but we have the Helion and the Magma Guy. I think we had literally the best we could possibly set be set up minus perks. Time slip's amazing for upgrading the shield, but we just don't have it. Oh, the Mog, bro. No, come on. Oh, full power. That's actually huge. We get the lock here. No, okay, bro. Okay, right. Let's forget about the shield for now, because we're just dumping our points into the box. I think I'm going to go use my full-powered katana here to try and fill up this monkey statue. Well, at least get it a little bit of the way there. All right, okay. Let's get some kills. I don't think it'll be enough on the first try, but worth a go. I never get enough on the first try. It's because they spawn way too slow. Oh, no. Hang on. We're getting a few now. Nope. Okay. We must have got a decent amount on that monkey, though. Right, okay. Let's go back to New Industries and upgrade the shield. All right, okay. Thingy is. Grab it. There we go. Oh, it's a full power. Okay, are these motherfuckers still spawning? Because if they are, I'm going to go back and quickly charge up the uh, monkey statue again. That's actually godsend RNG if it is. I don't know if it's going to be enough, though. Honestly, I think I'm just going to play it safe and end the round. It's only round 11. It shouldn't be too bad. We're just waiting for this little guy's head to go red. And then we can... I think you throw your redeemer or you shoot it or something. And then it floats off. Then you get three monkeys. Right, okay, let's start killing. Come on, surely it's nearly done now. Warden, please don't fuck me up. Okay, it's done. Never mind. We can leave. We can leave. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, let's charge up our shield since we've got a load of zombies that we have no use for, apart from, you know, souls. Oh, just a waste of blast to get out of that. All right, we've still got two, whatever. If we head back over here, in theory, there should be some... Oh, I'm an idiot. I forgot to shoot the fucking statue. Oh, my God. I'll be back. All right, there we go. We also definitely need to grab stamina up because we are running so slow, man. CC21 Savage. Thank you so much for subscribing, bro. Did no 21 Savage like zombies content. And here's a free monkeys. Nice. Whilst we're down at the docks again, actually, we can also grab stamina up, which will speed everything we're doing up tenfold. Let's grab stamina up. If Packer Punch is down here, I think we're going to pack the Magma Gat as well. Usually does go down here first. No, it's not. Okay. All right, let's force spawn a Warden in. You can do it by typing in 666 here. There we go. Because we need him to shock slam the door. Now, everyone thought that you couldn't get one of these till round 17, but because of my boy Glitch, I figured out that you can get it a lot earlier. Shout out to him because I've been using all of his guides for these. All right, let's charge up a monkey. Chuck it down at the door. Shock slam. Oh, he didn't do it. All right, got max ammo. We got another go. I hope that Warden doesn't die. Please do it. Yeah, there we go. Right, grab the red orb and then turn this on. What a sick little mini cutscene, by the way. And this is the warden. Right, okay, now we need to go find the Cronorium. So, we need to head back over to Richtofen's lab, and there'll be a Cronorium book on the floor, then we need to go look for the birds, then once we found the birds, pick up the Cronorium, place it on this chest, and we have to start the five challenges. Now, the bird step can either take, like, five minutes or two hours, just depending on what spawns you get, but I think we should be okay. We should really repair our shield as well. Place that on here, and then we'll grab the book. Yep, this stupid-ass bird Bird took our book. Okay, yeah, I did kind of forget we're mid-round, so let's just try and kill these until we get, like, one zombie that we can just run around. I think I'm going to go fast travel back to the island, though, because I want to repair this shield, because we've got blasts left on it. Right, we can't get hit. We actually just need to make a full belt for the gondola. Grab the shield. Right, we actually kept our charges. That I was fully expecting to just lose them. Let's try and get it up to four charges here, just so we have enough, like, on strap constantly. Right, we have three. Then we need some more zombies. Right, full four blasts. There we go. Right, we've got a couple of zombies left now. Right, let's go and look for this bird. Oh, wait, hang on. We can probably kill these two. Right, and there are our last ones. Right, he's not here. This step takes so long, man. I think he's down at New Industries because we've went to every area now. Uh, Electric burst. I'm not going to pick that up just yet just so we don't end the round. Definitely do need to grab other two perks at some point. Right, now our points could be used for something more useful, though, which is fast travel. Bro, he's just not here. Maybe he's at the docks? I don't know. There he is. All right, there's one bird down. All right, let's repeat the process and go again this round. We just got to, like, you know, fight our way through. I also really want to find Pack-A-Punch. I don't know where it's at, though. Oh, nuke perfect. 
We can go check the docks, but I doubt it's down there. No, it's not here. Okay. Oh, I think the bird's here, though. I just heard it. Yeah, it is, it is, it is, it is. All right, let's clear out this fucking horde. We can whip out the Pathosaurus. It's close by, bro. Ah, there he is. Okay. All right, that's the second one done. All right, let's go find Packer Punch. Suppose we could check down by the powerhouse, although I doubt it'll be there. There's the Packer Punch machine. All right, let's chuck this in. There we go. And let's do the Helion Salvo. Oh, we can also double pack it. Let's go. Before I get rid of these monkeys, what I think I'm going to do is chuck one. We'll wait for some zombies first and then we'll charge up our shield because now that it's round 15 it's going to be insanely difficult to you know do the thing of course the warden has to fuck that up cheers mate never mind i guess we'll do it later also my shield's about to break i'm gonna put my katana away then charge it up again bird isn't here i don't think i can't hear it nah i really don't think it's here right, let's go back to the prison it's not in the cafeteria is it here nah i still don't hear it i have a feeling it might be down at the docks this time could also be on the roof we haven't checked that yet while we're up here actually let's repair the shield i think he's down at the docks i still don't hear it but where is he at here he is. He's our third one. All right now, we need to listen out for the other one. But first, we need to like end the round. So, all right, once we've done this, we can look for this last one. Then the bird steps over. We've got the crinorium. All is great. Then we start the challenges, which are arguably the hardest bit. I hope it's not the lever one first. Just give me something easy, like, you know, Michigan Avenue, where I've just got to lead a guy through, or something like that. Like I said, I was going to do before, throw a monkey, and then... Oh, I didn't want to throw another one, but sure. Oh, Carpenter, let's go. Right, we've got a couple of souls there. I right, still only got two blasts, though. Just having as many spirit blasts is so favoured. All right, okay. Right, I'm going to use my katana here, because I want to get this. Oh, no, we've already got it up to level three. Okay, these are our last zombies. All right, we've got to listen out for one, but we're not allowed to look at it. Okay, right, he's on that wooden post just there but we are definitely not allowed to look at him because you know we're just not i don't know why it's just one of the steps i need my house retriever back first before we do anything but we're also need to get spawn in a zombie's blood so we can actually see that thing and like bring it into life all right okay let's go grab our house retriever again bye bye monkeys all right let's go get our free zombie's blood then shall we quickly blast this there we go. And then eight, seven, two. Pop a temporal gift. Grab this. Run, 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 run. Right, there we go, I think. No? Really? There we go. There's the crinorium. Got a little bit worried there. Right, there we go. Right, great, 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 great. That's amazing, right? We're going to head back up now. Bro, the zombies plus last forever. And fuck it, we'll craft the acid gag kit. Just for completion's sake. And I definitely did make the right decision to charge up our shield because we've got three blasts left. Every time we get a challenge, we've got to go down here and input it in the numbers we get into the Citadel Tunnel's, like, number terminal thing so by having all these charges it just makes everything way easier all right okay let's put the cranorium on his chest right our numbers are 714 for the first challenge okay let's go get these inputted then right okay so 714 please don't be the fucking simon says symbol translation bollocks one i really can't be bothered for that to be my first one just give me like michigan avenue or like the banjo one something like that no it's not michigan avenue where's it shining is that the showers or is that the docks i can't tell where that's going i think that's showers because oh yeah it's showers all right we got the banjo one first i think let's just double check here yes we did okay let's bring this here right okay now we've got to stand in here and get zombies kills this is this is why it's one of the easiest ones because it's just kills let's not fuck it up now that i've said that yeah <laughs> okay yeah this ring moves about as well oh, it's dog round bro i mean i'm not complaining about more ammo but like i just want to get on with the challenge oh they count the souls never mind we we'll try to get a shield blast here because we've used them all now spoiler alert i fucked it up and now we have to do it again i've just inputted the numbers i don't know if we get the same challenge though i'm kind of praying on it the fucking circle was it was killing me because i wasn't killing enough zombies inside of it okay where's the beam going is it down here no it's a completely the challenge uh oh if it's the most code one we're kind of in luck if not i don't know bro oh it's michigan avenue okay right, let's make this actually a thing let's kill a zombie whip out the shield right spirit blast them then we'll pop an undead man right okay 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 we're getting there we're getting there we're getting there undead man is definitely helping out here what a shout from the guide i'm following by the way to use this gobble gum honestly oh god there's a fucking warden and dogs right okay we did it we did it we did it we did it the orbs on the floor i'm just being surrounded by like 1500 different zombies doesn't help that this fucking warden will go away either man should really be using them dogs to charge up my shield man but i could not give a fuck there we go full power nice Right, I need that orb that he dropped, man. Oh, please don't kill the last zombie. Right, nice. Right, let's go get another code. Okay, stop. 536. Actually, I think I'm go we're going to have to go another round because I've barely got any charges in my shield. Or not, actually. Hang on. Fucking hate this map so much, man. I just down to three zombies. Nah, I've got to go rebuy my perks, for fuck's sake. Well, here's a plus of the next time we're down. We won't have to do that because we'll be fucking dead. Electric cherry. Hang on. What was it again to get the three, four things? Because I know when it's sparking, it means you can have it yeah there we go you just press f on it there oh my god there we go right now we have a full charge we can actually do it this round i think our code was five 
three, six. If not, I'll just do it the other way. Fine. Was it that? Yep, there we go. Let's go have a look where it's beaming down. Definitely not here, which is somewhat good because it means that it's not the most cold one yet. I really want the banjo one next. And I think it might be actually because it's shining down. Okay, it's not the banjo one. Where's it at then? Oh God, is it the lever? Oh my God, why the round end? What? I mean, it's shining in new industries. I can never remember what one this is, though. All right, this is the one where you've got to drain them a bunch of times, right? Get this to come into real life, and then we'll head over to the original Mob of the Dead spawn room where we need to kill a singular zombie and then start draining them. All right, okay, we killed one. That insta kill is going to be really handy. Where's my ghosty boy at? There he is. All right, come here. All right, we need to start draining him. Shit, there he is. <sighs> Keep draining him. All right, we need to get another spirit blast quick off these zombies. Fuck, we ended the round. Okay, right, we're nearly there. We're nearly there. It's fine. All right, okay, he's fully red. He's fully red. He's fully red. We can't drain him anymore, no? Right, no, we're good. Let's get off the catwalk before they start spawning in, yeah? I'm just going to make sure he's still following. Yes, he is. Okay, let's wait over here for him to come through. Then we have to pull the trap. There we go. Okay, right. That's the second one done. Right, there's the second orb. Now, we should probably head back and, you know, grab a new shield and all that jazz. Because it's about a break. Right, let's head through. Right, we should start getting some uh, spirit blasts on the go here. It's a shame it takes about nine years for them to actually go into the key, but whatever. We've got a dog here. We can use that. I'm also keeping my eyes out for the uh, spark and power boxes here. Because it would just make my job a lot easier. But I can't seem to find them. How many charges we got now? Three. Okay. Right, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Please don't kill them all. I beg. Right, okay. I literally just want one zombie. There we go. Right, let's go get our third challenge numbers then. The odds of it being the banjo one are like two to one. So it's going to be a long one, whatever one we get. I want numbers. 858. Javon Mills. Thank you for subscribing, bro. Right, okay. 858. All right, let's go look at the lighthouse and see which one we got. I think it might be the powerhouse one. I'm not sure, though. I'm going to go check the docks. Okay, yeah, it's the Morse code one. That's kind of jammy, I'm not going to lie. Because we do have a zombie left. Now, please don't kill him with a shield blast. Get him right away. All right. We've basically just got to trial and error this thing until it, you know, eventually works. What I'm going to do is I'll pop a temporal gift. We'll shock this thing again. Get a zombie blood. Eight, seven and then two grab this run right okay one okay so it's dot let me grab a pen and paper <laughs> dot again okay so it's dot dot dash that means the rest have to be dashes right okay so i believe our first number is two though so we got that let's fucking go bro we did it our code turned out to be um two zero <laughs> Okay, I know I cut a lot of that out, but honestly, I I'll put a screenshot, right, of the things that I wrote down on pen and paper, by the way, bro. We're taking it back to, like, 2016 on pen and paper of the code that I got to prove that I'm not bullshitting here. All right, now we need a kill in the infirmary. But first, I need a new fucking shield. Oh, it's a dog round. Right, we can charge our shield. Okay, the dog actually counts as a soul. Right, okay, here's our guy. We need to charge this guy up with zombie souls now. Shouldn't be too difficult. We got, we do have a magma gas. Bonus points. It's probably the most useful drop we could, useless drop we could have got. Right, there we go. He's on the move. Gotta keep charging him with these souls. I want him to shift because this infirmary sucks, man. All right, we gotta lead him to the gondola. Okay, this gives us a little bit of downtime. Come on, little guy. This is a terrible time for the gondola than just not be here. Give me my specialist weapon. Come on, get in here, bro. Let's go. Yo, who's this guy, bro? That was a warden coming. Of of course there is. Of course he's right there as well. I don't want to back myself into a corner. And that's perfect. There's a nuke. All right, come on, bro. Your house. It's here. Quickly. Yes, there we go. Right, okay. That's the third one done. All right, that's three out of five. I'm not doing too bad. That's another warden. Oh my god, man. That's another ward. What the fuck is going on? Just trying to get my spirit blast back up here. We nearly got four. Right, there we go. It's fully charged. I want to get to the end of the round before we try to do another challenge. I think they're still spawning, actually. Yeah, they are. All right, that's last zombie. All right, he's a runner. Good. Let's go get the numbers from the warden's chest book thing whatever and let's do the fourth challenge it's probably going to be the lever one but we do have a full shield which I, then again i don't even think is enough i think you need more than that all right stop seven four eight okay blast this quick and then it's seven four eight wait what what Takio said perhaps not did i type the code in no way oh i wasted a spirit oh spirit blast that's so annoying hang on what's the code Se what what the fuck i put in seven four eight all right okay one more time seven four eight what the fuck okay looking at that a little bit better i've realized that's a four now for fuck's sake why am i such an idiot it's four four eight are you got no 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 that looks like a seven i, I don't want to hear in the comments before you start commenting if 448 doesn't work i'm gonna point and laugh at you in the comments if you if you've done something before i've even put the code in all right four four eight sod off man <laughs> okay i think this is showers if it is i'm gonna wait till the round starts 
And I'm also going to go grab a new shield. Okay, yeah, it is. It's the banjo one where you got to do a lockdown. So I want to be like as prepared as possible because we don't have any more self-revives. We have a dying wish, which is good. We also have a charged katana. I think we're good to go, honestly. I just want to end the round first because I don't want to die like how we did last time. It just started draining my HP. All right, let's bring this to life. We got to wait on our friend here with the banjo. All right, let's grab it. All right, stand in here. Let's try to get some kills. I'm so glad this thing is still killing. Okay, now let's pull this out. Okay, that's it. I think we're done. Yeah, let's go. We got my boy's banjo. There's a nuke here. That's perfect. Right, let's give him it back. Yeah, he's happy. Let's go. Right, that's our fourth orb. Now we have the hardest one to last, which we'll do once we end the round. I also need to charge my shield for this. We need a full charge. I'm going to go check if the uh, the thing has it first, though. There we go. Oh, my God. Let's go. That was a complete guess as to whether it was that one as well. Right, we have a full shield blast. We need to save some zombies at the end of this round as well because we need to shock the thing, input the numbers, shock the thing into real life. Oh, God. We need to save, like, I want to say 15 zombies. We need more spirit blasts. One thing I will admit that the Asigar has over the Magma Gat is how fast it kills them. Because don't get me wrong, this thing's great. It's killing them, like, consistently, but fucking hell, man, is it slow. Can't tell if this is the last couple or they're just starting to spawn in again. I think it's the last couple. Right, we can go start the last one now. Now, here's the question. Did I pick up the orb in the showers? Yes, I did, I remember. I've actually got Alzheimer's. It's so over for this Easter egg, bro. Oh, we're nearly there. There's four things shooting into the lighthouse. Just need to do one more. Right, what are the numbers? 593. Right, so it is... Oh, God, I don't want to get caught. Yeah, that's the last thing I want to do. Five, nine, three. Let me out, bro. Fuck this shit. Oh, this is actually kind of where I need it to be as well, though. Okay. All right, let's bring this into real life. We should also probably boost the damage on our Helion because we're going to use it for the boss fight. And it's almost run its course for damage here. So we might as well. All right, I think that should be good enough for now. Now we got to go do Simon Says with these fucking generator lights, I think. I think that's what they are. I do want to save these shield blasts that we have left, though. So let's go repair our shield. We got the points to do it. Fucking 29,000. Okay, I cut the fourth and the fifth sequence because I kind of had to, like, stop my recording to record bits that I can watch back. So it was these three here. So that's this one. Then it was... Uh, let me stand here again so I can get my bearings. It was this one. So that's this. Right, okay. I've jotted down all the symbols I need. Oh, fuck. I need to get back in there. Oh, God. My shield's about to break. No, no, no. Shield takes priority, okay? We're going back up to fix the shield. Then once we fix the shield, we'll come back down, grab the punch card. Then we'll go do the translation bit. And then I'm pretty sure even this round, we could probably get the lever step done since we have three charges, I'm sure. Yes, we do. Right, that's the shield repaired. Still have three charges, yes? Yes. Cool. All right, let's go start the translation step. Quickly run back down and grab the punch card. Which is, should be just here on a shelf? Yes. Takio just asks, how does one read it? Well, we read it with a computer. It's a new industry, so we got a bit of fucking distance to jog like. Let's hope my shoddy drones are enough for me to actually recognize what ones are which. All right, chuck that in there. And uh, now, okay, we've got a bunch of monitors. Now we've got to decide which ones are ours. Is that one of ours? Yes, that is. That's like a grid hex thing. Oh, that might have been the worst time for the zombie to die out, man. Looks like we're going another round. Fuck. Oh, I really thought we were going to get that done. Never mind. Oh, my God. I was not prepared for another wave. I was expecting a boss fight in that round. Fuck. <laughs> right, okay. I cleared out most of the horde. Let's go finish this code. Right, okay. So that one's that. Right, okay. Here's our last one. It's like that. Right, okay. Let's go see. Our ghost friend should be there. He should be, like, pulling levers already. But, like, we've got to tell him to pull the right ones. We need to figure out what generator is which. Not that one. That one. Right, okay. That's That should be one of them, right? Pull the lever. Pull the lever. All right, no. No, no, no. Don't pull that one. No. No. Not this one either. Fuck the zombies. It's not my smartest idea trying to do this. Okay, no, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm fucking out of here. Oh my god, new fucking industries. This is not where I wanted to be. Let me out. Oh my god. Gotta end this round again, man. I don't want a fire sale. Give me a nuke or something useful, man. I fucking hate this map. Full power, that's useful. Right, okay, he's dead. Double points. Yeah, sure. Another what? Right, okay, he's dead. What did he drop? Oh, max ammo. That, that's actually useful. Okay. It's an upgrade from last time. Another warden, bro. No, I can't be arsed. Right, okay, warden's dead. I'm actually, like, fucking sweating, bro. This Easter egg is taken it out of me. I really hope our little ghosty boy is still there. No Easter egg should have you on round 30. And still doing steps. All right, we need the one at the end. Where is he? Oh, he's there. Oh, fuck. I actually need him to pull that one. I've got to wait for him to come around. It's fine. Pull, yeah, pull that one. Pull that one. Okay, I didn't fuck it up. Good. Right, the one at the end is the last one we need, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay, is it the last one? Oh, fuck. Please don't actually pull it. No, he didn't pull it. He didn't pull it. He didn't pull it. We just have to go another round. Where'd he go? Oh, no. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you to put your hands together for the biggest bit of bullshit you've ever seen in your life. You see that there? Yeah, that lever's not supposed to look like that, right? It's supposed to be one way or the other. So you see how it's both ways? Yeah, that's not supposed to happen. So in my eyes, we didn't lose. 
lose. We lost because of Jason Blundell's shitty code. Right, okay, here we are. Classified. Definitely my favourite BO4 map. Hands down has to be. I know there's probably a bunch of people in the comments that are going to be like, well, it's the simplest one. There's nothing really to it. It just looks cool. I, I don't know what it is. We are not going to end the round. We are going to get to round one and get the entire map open without... Never mind. I, I wasn't expecting that to be the end of the round. Never mind. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It doesn't necessarily matter. This Easter egg's pretty quick anyway because we're not doing the round 151. That is ridiculous. That would be its own separate video. It would make the video, like, I think at least four hours long. Where is this piece? I'm looking for a little shield piece, bro. There it is. Crack this open. Is it on the chair? No, it's not. We're going to look for this other teleporter piece. There it is. All right, let's try and piss off McNamara here and we'll get ourselves a bunch of Nova Crawlers, which in turn gives us a bunch of points and a bunch of points equals a bunch of doors. Simple math, really, bro. Okay, we'll not end round two. I think that might be the last zombie. No, it's not. There's one there. Right, that's the last zombie. <laughs> He's actually getting so pissed off. This is the fourth time I've chapped on the window. <laughs> right, there you go. Right, Samantha's pissed now. That right. Yeah, now she spawns in a bunch of these Nova fuckers, which in turn is going to give us a shit ton of points. Also got a Path of Sorrows charge. That's always good. I feel like this is a nice compromise instead of doing the round 151. Let me know in the comments what you think, though, because I will go back and do it in a separate video. Just not this one. Oh, double points. Could you have been any nicer to me? What an absolute night and day difference between this and a nine. Is that another one? It's an insta-kill. Bro, she spawned so many. This is kind of ridiculous. Is it? Does it stop? Surely it's done now. Right, okay, yeah, it is. Jesus, that was a lot of them. That's a lot more than I remember. All right, let's crack this door open here. And then we'll head downstairs. We'll get the power on, get the little amplification thing built, and then we'll start the Easter egg. It literally only takes about, like, 20 minutes if you know how to do it, really. Crack that open. This one open. I like how they, um, they decorate the prices of the doors like significantly from the original five like that door back there so it was 1500 now it's only 750 great turn this on open this up there's our other piece if we head down here the shield piece can spawn here it's not there though oh that's dogs that's a lot of dogs that's because we're not moving on from the round there's the visor for the shield that's what i was looking for war room yep get the server room open for the defcon switch hit this one then this one numero quattro un sank right okay let's go get this last piece here we can also grab the last piece for the shield once we've grabbed this one and there it is nice oh i changed the labs last second man and there's the other piece for the shield right okay let's head upstairs and we'll build the amplifier up here actually no scratch that we'll craft the riot shield up here very much Please go blue. Come on. There we go. And then we'll head down here and craft a little teleport amplification thing, which I think the buildable table is over here. Yes, it is. Okay, right. Get that crafted. War room. Oh, fuck's sake, bro. That's going to keep happening, isn't it? Right, war room. That's where I wanted to go. Now that we're here, I'm pretty sure it's just as simple as doing this. Yep, there we go. Now we can head over here, grab this, which is like this, this little key here. I don't know how people figured this out, but whatever. Take me upstairs. Yep. Let me head through to here. And where's the desk? That's not it. Is this it? No, is it the one over here? What desk is it that has the code in it, man? This one? Yeah, there we go. Right, okay, that's Dury. So our first code is 1380. Now what we do is we head down into the labs. Please change perfectly. No, okay. Right there. And we need to look for a certain window. And I think it's this one just here. Yeah, it is. Right, okay. So we need to get a frag grenade all the way back there. Oh, bro, come on. What? All right, fuck it. We'll end the round. Oh, I thought I was going to end the round. We'll use equipment here. There we go. That's what I wanted. 9912 is the Shangri-La code. Now we got to do some funny business with the DEFCON switches. Can this take me up to the second floor, please? Hurry up. There we go. I really love that feature, how it actually tells you where you're going now. Right. We need to hit these in a certain order. It's this one. And then I wanted a new area, which is the server room, which is just there. Honestly, this Easter egg's great. It should have just been the main quest, man. So that's three. This one. And then finally, this one. And we need to quickly run to a teleporter that isn't the one in the middle, because it won't take us there. President's room. Right, and then I think it's this TV? This TV? One of them. Oh, there you go. Right. 4503. And I can't... I think that's Kino? Is that Kino? I don't know. Right, okay. Now that that's done, we can leave here. Grab time slip, because why not? But we do need to end the round here, because I need points really badly because we need to pack a punched weapon and we are also completely out of ammo right, let's crack the box open here please don't give me a, i was gonna say please don't give me a winter's howl a locust will do i guess for now 4503 was the last code we just got one more to get okay the cordite is way better than the locust for points so we'll use that 
I guess now we've just got to kind of play a game of Classified. We've done all this at such a low round, man. That's actually unbelievable. Kind of makes the map ridiculously easy if you know what you're doing. Oh, these are schematics for Ted. What the fuck? I didn't even know these were here. That's actually so sick. You know, maybe if we did have like a shopping free or something, we could have sped it up even more. But it's kind of fun to just have to actually play the game instead of just speed running. <laughs> we're nearly there anyway. Bro, the round stingers on this map for a fucking season pass bonus that went all out for the soundtrack, man. We're nearly there. We might get it this round, maybe. Oh, no. Was it Max Ammo? Yeah, we'll probably get it this round. Right, okay, let's go get the Defcon switch is put on. There's Defcon 2. I'm gonna rinse this man for some extra points. Defcon 3, Defcon 4, and Defcon 5. Right, we actually get to go to Area 51 now. Chuck that in there. There we go. Can I just say as well that the teleporter on this game for Moon looks so fucking good, man. Look at that. I feel like that surely has something to do with, like, a side easter egg. That looks way too, like, in your face to not be. Right, anyway, we've got a pack weapon now. We're good. Right, okay, now we've got to go shoot some President's Portraits. Let's go up. They got everything so on point with this, man. Right. Benjamin Franklin, Abraham Lincoln, Hamilton, Washington. No? Really? I thought that was the order. Okay, let's just try this. One, three, two, four. What, bro? Right, let's try this again. One, three, two, four. Bro, there we go. Right, 4093. Right, now we've got to get uh, all these codes in the computer down below. Why did I say it like that? Computer. My accent doesn't even make me sound like that. Yeah, these dogs might be a bit of a problem if we're entering a code like. Right, okay. One, two, three, four. Get this back down to zero. There we go. There's the first one. Got to get this to 1380. There we go. There's the Reese. These images of the maps are so cool, man. Let's clear out some of this horde here. Twin Rip, thank is that how you say it? Twin Rip? Thank you for subscribing, bro. Next one we have to enter is Shang's. So that's 9912. There we go. And then our final code here is the Kino de Toten one, which is 4503. There we go. And that should be it. But yeah, there's no way can't any more codes, right? Okay, cool. Now I'm pretty sure we just have to go to Groom Lake and survive three rounds. So let's hit all these DEFCON switches. The cordite should be more than enough to survive with. Or and here's DEFCON 5. We have barely used the Path of Sorrows through this game. I've actually forgot we had it. I don't want to end the round before we go through because it means we'll have to go to 13 instead of 12. But now we've basically just got to sit here. Because this barrier will clear, and then there's a certain something waiting for there. You probably all know what it is, but for those who don't, I'm gonna keep it a secret. Because you know, I like making these videos a little bit intriguing, bro. I think I'm mysterious. The gun on the shield is fucking insane. Right, okay. We should only have to go to round 12, but I'm not sure. We're running a little bit low on ammo, but we should be okay. I think next round will be a dog round. Oh my god, they spawn from everywhere, man. I think we are going to have to go pack a punch the starting pistols here, because we are completely out of ammo on the core dice. Oh my god. Okay. Right, now we have something to fight with at least. Oh, it's round 10, not round 100. Jesus. What is that? Full power. Right, let's not waste that. Right. Grab this. One more round to go. I'm gonna pull out my katana here just to be safe. So I don't kill myself with those pistols that we just pack a bunch there. Because explosive damage on this game is kind of bad. Right, that should be it. Right? Let me through, question mark? Or was it three full rounds? Or is it gonna come up now? Right, either way, it's a dog round. We'll be fine. Oh, I can't let them get too close. Right, there we go. Even if we have to survive a little longer, we've got more ammo on the cordite now. So we're chilling, bro. There we go. Bonfire sale and a max ammo. And there it is. The Winter's Howl. Let's grab it here. And why not? We'll pack a bunch of it. What a remake of a Wonder Weapon, by the way. I absolutely love this thing on BO4. We'll use it a little bit here just for you guys. This is what we worked for. But now we've got better things to do. On to the next Easter egg. Right, okay. Here we are. Dead of the Night. Now, I've played this map like three times, but you know what it is? We're going to try the Easter egg on it anyway. Now, I don't want to waste my shopping free here. I'm going to try to use it to the best of my ability. We need to get over there to unlock the Sentinel Artifact, which is basically the power switch of this map. So, we'll crack this first door with our first 500 points, and then what we'll do is we're going to press 3, and we are going to absolutely sprint for the life of us to get the Sentinel Artifact on. There you go. That would be nice if it would hurry up. Yep, cheers. All right, okay. Let's head down here, get this door open. I'm probably not doing the optimal route, but, you know, I'm just trying to do as much as I can with as much knowledge that I have. This one open. Grab a Mozu, sure. Get this open. Grab a Bowie knife. Grab Dying Wish. Most expensive perk, why not? Is that everything that we can open right now? All right, okay, yes, I think it is. We got a decent amount open there, I think. Anyway. Right, we need to focus on Pack-A-Punch. So, our main priority right now is finding the three focusing crystals, I think they're called. And there can be one in here. We need to find it, though. Not in there. Oh, there it is. Cool. Right, we need to fill this up with zombie souls. Because you know, it's round one. They're going to be very slow, so. Oh, there we go. That's the range we're looking for. It was a good shout from me getting this fucking mozu. It's so satisfying. We 
need to be on the lookout for parts as well. We need to be looking for energy cores for the traps too. Because they're needed for the Easter eggs. We need to get one of them set up, surely. Right, okay. It's charged. We need to gaze into the stone. What challenge have we got first? That's a painting one. Okay. There's our purple crystal. We don't need to worry about that though. I'm currently looking for a certain painting. We're looking for the scared girl one, I think. It's the last one that you can possibly find. I think it's... No, is it this one? No, it's not that one. It's the other one. It's in like the tea room. This map gives me such like Resident Evil vibes. It's crazy. It actually really strikes a resemblance to the house from Resident Evil 2. Okay, I stand corrected. Maybe it is this one. Yeah, it is. There we go. There's our ghost. Have we got a follower or something? I'd imagine so. I've got a part. It's a shield visor. Nice. Oh, fuck sake. She's gone behind a door that I don't have enough points for. I guess we'll end the round. There's so many nods to like nine and stuff in this map. It's kind of crazy. They really try to go ambitious for chaos. It's so sad that it flopped. Right, there we go. Where are we going, mysterious ghost woman? Please don't tell me you're going up there because I need more points. Y you're a mong. You're a. Oh my god, bro. With BO4's weird ass point system, it's kind of hard to get points. We can focus on buildables and stuff later. Oh, never mind. There's a silver piece for our silver bullets. Oh, fire gate energy core. Perfect. Now, where's this last zombie at? There he is. Please just be a bonus point. No, nope, carpenter. Okay. Look at him waiting patiently for me. I respect that, to be fair. Right, okay. Let's get this next door open. Where are you actually headed, love? Oh, there we go. And there's my tuning fork. Thank you. Right, let's go get another crystal charged. And our elixir slot gave us aftertaste. That's honestly not terrible. Could have been a lot worse. We just done that one. I think there's a one in the master bedroom that we unlocked. It's the purple one. I think it's up here. Still kind of learning the layout of the map, so please bear with me. Here we go. Right, and he gets souls into this purple crystal. Then we got one more to do, then pack a punch is open. I hope it's the clock one. Okay, just crystals charged. Nice. It's also a specialist weapon, right? What one is it? Uh, that is... I don't know. Fuck. I don't know what one that was. It's one of them. <laughs> Right, let's go have a look at each fucking perk lo uh, location then. Oh, which one looks like- is it- is that raw? I don't know. I don't know my Greek gods. Might have been Danu. Right, we'll, we'll look, we'll look. Right, I think that was raw, so that's stamina up for us. So we need to go out to, out to the mausoleum if it's there. We can go check at least. Definitely not out here. Nope, that's Odin. He can be upstairs to be fair. We can go check that out. Is he in here? No, that is quick revive. There's also a location in the cellar, but I doubt it's the- get this door open. I don't know where it's gonna take me. Oh, it's just up here. Okay, it's the library. If I'm not- no, this is the bedroom. Here's the library. Or the study or whatever it's called. This is how you get through the mausoleum. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Question is, is the raw perk here, though? Nope, it's electric cherry. Bollocks. Okay, our crystal's not in there. I'm just uh, multitasking here to make sure that the other crystal is, in fact, in here. Yeah, it is. There's the blue one. No, our perk is not down here. All right, that means raw's in the greenhouse, which, unfortunately, is the most expensive route, I think. Because we've not been to the greenhouse laboratory yet, so I suppose we should end the round then. There we go. Wait, that wasn't last? Oh, hang on. we got to maximize our points here. Stab them up. There we go. This map is fucking massive man it's so intricate imagine showing this to someone whose last game they played was world at war with the energy core i will be taking that we can still knife them here because we have a boy knife i don't want to pick that nuke up i'm trying to get pack a bunch open as early as possible since this is the only way we haven't been i'd imagine it's through here yeah it yeah it really is okay let's get this gate open it does the both of them that's very nice Ah, there's the raw statue. Right, cool. We just gotta kill a bunch of these. What are they, werewolves? I don't know. Oh, these things. Okay. Oh, my fucking god. Bro, I'm pulling out the scepter of raw for this. They are actually terrifying. Jesus Christ, man. Tune and fork. There we go. Thank God. Right, one more stone to go, and it was down in the cellar. This is the clock one. This one's nice and easy. We should get this done this round, probably. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need a better weapon than the Mozu soon, but it should do for now. We'll work on getting Alistair's Folly soon. Right now, I just wanna fill this little crystal up just so we can get the clock one over and done with. Yep, there we go. Right, that's the grandfather clock. And if I'm not mistaken, that's just this one here, right? Yeah, it is. Fuck off, man. Oh, there's too many zombies for this. Oh my God, man. I'm pulling out the specialist weapon. Sod this. Right, he's a shambler. We should get this done. You're not. Away, oh, man. We die and wished oh, already okay round five by the way right there we go and i think that is our tuning fork yes it is that's was that another bit of silver i just saw no it's not it's the mozu right that's all three and i also want a gun that's actually going to defend me so we'll pick up the gks here use the tuning forks and that is pack a punch unlocked i think yeah there we go oh my god oh i forgot that spawns oh my god he does a lot of damage can you die like nicest way possible you are fucking terrifying it's times like this where i wish i had a wonder what that's actually so scary all right there we go he's dead all right pack a punch is open that is basically the first step of the easter egg done all right like i said we're gonna go work on the shield now then we'll start working on Al alistair's folly get that shit upgraded and then we're pretty much good to go oh we also need to do silver bullets and stuff but that's a piece of piss right, there's another shield piece we need one more now and i do believe it is near like the master bedroom area i lied it's here there we go all right let's go get this thing built 
There's a workbench not too far from here. I think it's literally in here. Is it? No, this is the study. I'm looking for the smoking room. I think that's upstairs. Oh, I'm so sorry. This is going to be such a headache. It doesn't help that all the rooms basically look the fucking same. That's the bedroom. Smoking room. There we go. And there's the workbench. Get this shield built. Oh, wait. It's custom for chaos maps? Oh, wow. This looks a lot different. All right, let's go get this funny wonder weapon pistol thing. Alistair's folly. We need four symbols. And I do believe that is towards the cemetery. So we're going to have to do a 180 here. I feel like we're getting a lot done in like a short amount of time though. So, okay. So is it here? I mean, would it be there? Yes, it's usually there. It's not there. It's not there. Is it on the lion? It's not that one. This lion over here. No, it's not there. There we go. There it is. It's like a D with a line through it. Right, we'll jot that down. Right now, we're looking for the green one. So that's going to be on the opposite side where the green house is fitting, I guess. Cheers, Treyarch. If I remember right, there's a fast travel here that we can use so we don't have to jog all the way around. Yes, there is. Mr. Green Symbol, where are you at? It's not there. There it is. Okay, it's another D. Right, and I think it's the east and the west sides of the house. So we need to go help head over there for the yellow and red symbols then we have access to the pistol by round seven honestly for a map as convoluted as this one it's not too bad but the layout and stuff is definitely going to get some like taken used to we've got the shield built and we're going to go repair it here and that is good enough for me right now honestly is that a fucking werewolf oh bro they're actually terrifying i'm gonna try to clear out a few zombies here because although it is only round seven there is a fucking few of them buy some ammo off the wall here for my gun all right so we want to be on the east side it's not there it's not there either i fuck with this weapon hard bro i didn't even know this existed i thought all like the SMGs and BO4 will burst or something. There it is. Okay, it's another D with a... Bro, come on. How many? All right, let's go look for the yellow one now. Are you out here, Mr. Symbol? No, you're not. It's not there either. Check the opposite side here. No, it's not there. It's on the window then. It's up there. What is that? That's a Z or a 2. All right, let's go to the library and enter these symbols in then. Here it is. A double points at the end of the round. Brilliant. I'm going to kill... Bro, there are so many zombies left. I thought it was like the last one. All right there. Right, we'll enter the code now. It was D. Then it was another D. Then it was another D. Oh, wait, no, shit. So it was D, D, and then the red one was, uh, was a... Oh, the red one was a D as well. The yellow one was a Z. Like that? Yeah, there we go. Cool. Alistair's Folly, hello. Oh, this thing's sick. I've never actually used it before. It has fuck. It's like, like 100... A what? It has 100 ammo. Oh, can you sod it off? Before we start, though, I think we should probably get silver bullets on one of our guns, because... If the first one we get is the mausoleum thing, we're, we're kind of fucked. Right, there's the second part of them anyway. We need one more. Oh, I love this wonder weapon already, man. Right, handily enough, our last one is in the wine cellar. And considering we're right here, that is, like I said, that is very handy. Um, Is it on the table? Nope. Is it on the table around the other side? Like here? Nope. Is it on the table? Well, wait, I'm all over the place. Hang on. Is it there? No. Is it on the opposite end? No. Is it on the... Uh, yes, it is. Right, cool. All right, let's go ahead and melt this silver down. There we go. Now we need the gunpowder pieces, so we need to go look for some charcoal first things first i think that it's going to just be dotted about all the fireplaces is it here nope there's our first piece nice it's in the master bedroom all right let's go find the funny poop and i do believe it's in the cemetery all right nice here it is all right now we need i think it's like sulfur or something i can't remember it's like, it's like a yellow substance but i know it's on the opposite side in the greenhouse so if you couldn't tell already i am following a guide but i know rough locations of stuff off when i've played with friends and it's not often i've played this map with friends as you can tell from my shit like game sense when it comes to the layout of the map. Jesus, we have 10k points. We really need to start getting like set up. So on this table, yes it is. I'm gonna hit the box if I can get a better weapon than the GKS that I can pack and give silver bullets. And whoa, my frames are going crazy. What's that yet? Nah. Okay, no, you know what? We'll just give the GKS silver bullets. I am gonna pack it first though. Or if I can find like maybe like a mog wall by, I'll stick it on that instead. There's the mog. Okay, right, we'll buy this. All right, we need to go one floor below and grab the silver bullets from the workbench, which is just through here, I think. Yeah, okay, cool. All right, Coolio. The mog now has silver bullets. I'm gonna go pack it once, and then we can actually get started with the proper Easter egg. We gotta look through the crystals again. There's the pack a punch machine. Wait, oh wait, no, I kept the silver bullets. I was so confused, the icon just wasn't there for it. it. Takes a while to load in, I guess. Right, okay, Easter egg time. Oh, we also need to get the chaos theory, and we'll do that in a bit. All right, let's go find a gaze in stone. All right, okay, yeah, it's the um the beam one. This is why we needed silver bullets because we need to shoot something on top of the mausoleum. The mausoleum's up here. Don't know why I was running towards the greenhouse there. See, I'm learning. I'm learning. Shoot that on the top of there. Hello. Right, yeah, it hit it. There we are. I was getting concerned that the mog couldn't reach it there. There we go. Now we've got to go turn a bunch of wheels until some guy's head drops off. And I know that sounds weird, but you'll see what I mean. It's a big statue. All right, here's where we need to be. Yeah, we just need to open up all three of these things. 
ones. Now we've got to turn all these wheels until this guy's head drops off. And you've basically just got to turn them all to the left, really. I'm going to end the round just for keep's sake here. Um, I'm going to keep turning this thing until the green light's blocked. And that's the green one done. QQY, thank you for subscribing. All right now we've got to do this one. I don't think we're going to have some time to do it, though. All right no, the new round started. We'll try to get a crawler or something. Grab a new shield while we're up here, too. Bonus points that would have been useful like eight rounds ago. All right, let's try to get a crawler. No, because getting crawlers in BO4 is literally almost impossible, but sure. Well, right, that's the blue one blocked. All right, there we go. Oh, let's not die. Let's move. Let's move. All right, nice one. The head fell off. An electrified zombie. Oh, I thought those fuckers stayed in nine. I stand corrected. Right, I'm going to wait till there's only a couple of zombies left, and we got to go look for some symbols and some tallies. Well, it's easier if you treat them that way. According to my man Glitch, who I'm following very closely. All right, is there a one in here? I see tallies. Oh, we have a crawler. Okay, that makes everything way easier. Max ammo too. Perfect. All right, what is this symbol here? What am I looking at? That is just like a square, right? All right, then we need the scratch marks. So that is one, two, three, four, five. There's another three here, so that's eight. That's another five, I think. Yeah, so that is... 13. The the first symbol here is 13. Okay, we've got another symbol here. It's like a weird six with a tail. Okay, that's three scratch marks. That's another three scratch marks. I think my shield broke. Bollocks. Yeah, that's three. And then the other one's up here. That's five, I think. Yeah, that is five. So three, three, five. That is 11. Right, we've got one more to find. Oh, maybe I just didn't look hard enough. It is the wine cellar. Where's its symbol? Okay, the round ended shit. There's its symbol. Okay, so that's like a little curly whatever. I don't know. All right, we'll clear out this round and then we'll go looking for some more scratch marks because I don't want to die and I need to go get another shield and stuff like that. We should probably also look into getting perks. Right, let's grab another shield. Oh my god, can these things piss off? Definitely gonna grab quick revive. Purely because we need to regen faster. I also want to grab the other two, but they're quite far away. All right, we pretty much cleared out the round there. Let's go look for some of these tally marks. And then we gotta go input them, I think, somewhere. All right, that's five. So five. That's five again, so that's ten. And that's another five, so that's fifteen. Okay, the curly one is fifteen. All right, we're done here. All right, we need to go to the green house. We're making decent time on this, to be fair. For someone who's barely played Dead of the Night by themselves, we've already got the first challenge done. I think after we've done this, we're gonna work on getting this upgraded because I'd rather do it on a lower round rather than a higher one because the upgrade process can be a bit of a pain in the arse sometimes. Okay, so our lowest one here was that funny-looking six. That one, and then it's like the little two or the square, whatever. Yep, this, and then it's a little swiggle. Uh, this one? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Right, okay, let's get the doors open. Hurry up. Bash it. There you go. Right, let's get this electric trap turned on. Run through it with a shield. There we go. Fucking Zetsubo no Shima in it up. Right, we ended the round, but that is fine. And then bash this. There we go. Right, we ignore how many attempts that took, and we ignore the fact that I've gone on two rounds since. I kept running, like, all the way around to do it, but we've done it anyway. Right. Now I'm pretty sure if we head down here, there'll be a stone. Yep, right, okay, that's the lockdown stone. We're gonna leave that in there for now, because I wanna go get the Alistair's Folly upgraded completely. We need to do Chaos Theory first, which requires, one, a werewolf, and two, a shield. We can do the shield bit. That's no bother. The werewolf might be a bit of an issue, though. I don't know when they start spawning. May or may not have accidentally popped a Perkaholic there, but it's fine. That has gave me a shit ton of per- Oh, bro, that's so unfair. I didn't even mean to pop that yet. Right, I need my- uh, I was trying to hit um, anywhere but here, but I panicked. I need my shield back. Right, there's my shield, and we'll go get this- the piece that involves the shield. I think it's in the library. Yeah, because this just doesn't look suspicious at all. There's the first bit. Now we need the werewolf. And I don't know when that spawns. There's the werewolf I've been looking for. You need to be dead by silver bullets, bro. And there's the chaos material. Perfect. Right, I am aware that the round's getting a bit high now, but we're making progress. Good progress. Gotta get the annihilator. And I know I said I wanted to do it on a lower round, but I guess not. We need to head over to the greenhouse now. So I don't know why I'm on the upper floor. Hello, Luna. Got eight shots left in the folly, bro. Oh, God. There's the workbench we need. We're gonna clear out these zombies first, though. All right, let's chuck this in here. Jesus, it's taking its time. There we go. There it is. Now we should be able to craft this thing. Yes, we can. All right, okay, let's craft the chaos theory. There we go. All right, now we need to go straight on Alistair's Annihilator. And to do that, we need vampires. And vampires equals a lot of zombies swarming us because it's round 20. We need to kill them with charged shots and we need the tornado one. So they drop these little things that we need to pick up. I think it's bile. Anyway, we'll go hang about the cemetery anyway because that's where they usually spawn. Okay, have we got any here? Any at all? Yep, I saw one. Definitely saw one. Yep, there we go. There's one. There's two. Oh my God, I'm like... 50 HP. Okay, that's two out of three. Move. 
Right, shoot another one of these charge shots here. That's a tornado one again, but I've got none of the vampires, man. Come on. Nah, I'm sure we'll get it next round. It's fine. Then once we've done that, we can go back to doing the quest lines. You know, the gazing stone. We've still got to do another two. We'll probably be boss fighting probably at like around, around 30, 35-ish. There's a vampire. Please go tornado. No, fuck. Right, okay, this should drop one, hopefully. Yep, I see it. There we go. Oh, run, that's a napalm. All right, we've got a full thing of bile now. Nice. Where's that red two map? I see it. Oh my god, these things are terrifying, man. They're everywhere. Wait, did he die? Yes, there we go. Right, Nosferatu Chaos Material. Thank you very much. Right, we've got like one good opportunity to do this. Where's the other light gone? There, there, there. And there we go. There's the back chaos material. Right. Off to the forest for us. We need to get them to dig up these little, like, spots with mushrooms growing out of them. And then we're done. We've got the Alistair's Annihilator. We can continue on. I'm proud of how far we've come. Like, this is one of my first times playing Dead of the Night solo. And we've basically done quite literally everything. We just got the other two things to do than the boss fight. Oh, and the lockdowns. Forgot about that. Still got a fair bit to do then, actually. <laughs> right, here's one. Right, get the tornado one out of the way. Get an acid zombie. Right, there's the final piece. I'm out of here, bro. Probably a terrible idea idea on my behalf to go over here with no shield on round 28 but we move anyway we thug it out well there goes my shield where's the machine where's the machine chuck that in there all right there's oh you bastard it baited me i thought it was done all right give me this there chuck another one in there there's the other piece and now we can finally craft the final upgrade of this there's so many upgrades well quests and stuff all right alistair's annihilator thank you very much move there we go. Right, now we can finally get on with this Easter egg. Let's go grab a shield and we'll go to the start the next um, stone thingy. Right, here's our shield. There we go. Very nice. Right, let's go find another stone. Right, okay, let's start the effigy one. Right, now we gotta go look for some fucking tree branches. <laughs> Accidentally opened fucking Photoshop my PC. It was gonna ruin the entire recording. I'd be lying to you if I said I would have been happy with keeping the chaos theory only. I apologize for the stuttering as well. I don't know what it is with Black Ops 4, my PC. It just doesn't like it for some reason. Right, anyway, first tree branch. Thank you. Second one. Cheers. This one too. Yep. Thank you. This one. Cheers. There's also this one. There we go. Right, okay, there's the headstone with the 1912. I've got the green vision. All right, here's the little branch work thing that we were trying to do. And now I need to get the fire effect. Yep, that's it. And let's go to hell. <laughs> Right, the only zombies easter egg where you actually have to go to literal hell. Welcome to Dead of the Night. And now we're in Mob of the Dead Afterlife. Let's go. Right, let's go look for this ghost woman. We'll go check the Danu perk location, because according to the guide, that's the most, like, common place she can spawn. No, she's not there. Fuck off. Keep opening Photoshop on my computer, man. Is she down here? Apparently she can spawn down here. Yep, she's there. Yeah, there's a way too many zombies here. I'm just gonna plonk that down. Right, can you get moving, please? Thank you. Yeah, that drop is of no use to us right now. We're just trying to get this ghost to wherever she needs to go. Oh, they broke my shield man. Oh, there's a werewolf as well. Can you sod off? Come on, lady. Keep moving. Of course it ended the round. Why wouldn't it? Where are you going? Up there? Round 30, no shield is risky business. Oh, where's the stone? She just dropped it. Right there, get me out of afterlife. Get me out of afterlife, man. You know, I spent about 10 years upgrading my thing just for it to not, like, one shot on round 30. That's a little bit sad. I mean, I'm not charging the shots, but still. Right, get me out of afterlife, man. There. Oh, get me out of here, man. I'm popping an aftertaste. I don't want to lose these perks. All right, we got one more left to do, and then we got to do the lockdowns, and then it's boss fight. All right, okay. Last challenge. It's the knight's one, right? We need to get our shield ready, and we also need... Do we have energy cores? Yes, we do. Cool. All right, let's go to the library. Stick an energy core in there. Okay, so now what we have to do is chuck this on, shoot that. Oh, is it, is it a charge shot? Hang on. Oh, fuck. We're out of ammo, man. Oh, that is the worst time. Jesus Christ. This might be a higher round than blood. One cheeky little max ammo later, and we're good. Didn't take long. Really got to be wary of how much ammo I'm using, man. This mog, by the way, like the shotgun, it's still really good. All right, okay, if there's a time to do this, I think it should be now, because there's still a few zombies that won't end the round if we use the trap. There we go. Charge shot. Give me the flames. And off we go. That one. <sighs> Shit. That one. Run. Then that one. And then this one. There we go. I think so. Anyway, did we not get it in time? I'm confused. I don't think we got it in time. I listened to the guide wrong. You have to do it in a certain order. My bad, my bad. All right, let's hope that the fire charge, whatever trap thing, doesn't need another energy cut. No, it doesn't. Okay. All right, shoot that into there. Get some flames. All right, go. Smoking room first. Where is it? This one. Nice. Back through to here. And then it's this one. And this one. And then it's billiards. Go, 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 go. Hold it up. There. Yeah, there we go. All right, we need the gem it just dropped. There it is. All right, we need to do that for two more sets. And this on. And then shoot that into there. Get some blue flames. Probably going to end around. That one. Fuck. Did it wrong. No. <laughs> All right, let's give this one more bash here then. Turn this on. Turn this blue. And then run straight through. Right, so the first one's by the Mozu Wall by, which is this one. 
Then it's straight up the stairs on the right. There we go. Then it's this one. Resi Fury, thank you for subscribing. Although right now my attention is elsewhere. This one. Then quickly, this one. There we go. Blast. All right, one more. All right, okay, I've just ended the round. We need to be fast. So it's this one. And then it's this one. And then it's all the way over in the music room. Bro, this is so far away compared to the other two. This one. Quickly. It's this one. That's it, right? Yep, there we go. Give me the gem. That's it. We're done here. We're done here. Let's go. Now I'm just going to have to clear out this horde because our next step requires that we lead literal gems. Yeah, we've got to lead gems over to the forest. Then we need to charge up souls and then kill a werewolf in between them. Sounds easy enough, right? <laughs> so I'm going to cut back once we've cleared out the rest of this round. All right, let's go pick up our pink gem friend. We need to go to the cemetery. So that is through this way. Yeah. No, I'm completely wrong. It's the opposite direction. Here's our pink gem. Right, now you, now you can see that's following us, weirdly enough. That is really odd. There's the second one, his little buddy. We just got him from there. Right, okay, next stop, gardens. There's one more gem we need to grab, and then we need to go to the forest, dump them there, and then fill up the soul boxes. But I think I'm going to hold off on that just for a little bit because our annihilator is on nine bullets. Oh, well, it's got another clip, but it's not my point. All right, here's the third one. All right, all three of them here. Nope, this one still needs to follow. Come here. All right, yep, there we go. They're all following now. Be really simple if we could just use fast travel, but unfortunately we can't because they get lost. Just straight past the woods of the forest from here. We should be good. I think they're about the same speed as these zombies that are behind us. All right, okay, here's the blue one. There we go. The green one's on his. Where's the pink one at? Come on, bud. we got to find your place. There it is. Let's lead them over there. There we go. Right, now we've got soul boxes to fill up. I need ammo, though, so we've got to go another round. That honestly did not take long at all. We got a max ammo. Go, go, go. We've been pretty lucky with the drops this game. All right, let's go and get these filled up then. Can you piss off? So these should just function as soul boxes, right? Yep, there's a tornado thing there. Oh, there's a fucking red one. Piss off. Yeah, they are. Right, nice. All right, that one's done. Or the pink guy should be over here. Yep, shoot one of them. We've got to do these twice over, so... Right there, he's gone. That's a full power. Oh, it'd be so useful. Where's our other guy? There he is. Well, he's moved, but it's fine. Right, he's at Pack-A-Punch now. He's at the right one. You're still here, though, so we'll shoot one of these. Right, that's that one done. How many are here? Right, one. Do another charge shot. Bro, the, this actually has to be one of my favorite Wonder Weapons. I will still say that the Cerberus is wicked from Cold War, but this is still really cool. Right, round 35, man, bro. We're going to be doing lockdowns, like, next round. Oh, fucking hell. Got to charge this guy up, and then he'll stand there. Then we need to kill a werewolf in the little triangle. Oh, the acid one is literally the worst charge shot. Please get me out of here. That was a drop, Annie. You know what that is? Fucking double points, right? They've moved it. Right, they've made the triangle. Nice. Ow. These fucking vampires hurt you now. Oh, there's already a werewolf here. Cool. I'm gonna pop an aftertaste just as an insurance measure here because I have a high feeling we're going down. Well, I mean, I just killed one inside it and it just didn't work. What the fuck? Oh, there's another one. They must just infra spawn them. Infra spawn them? What the fuck was that word I just said? Infinitely spawn them, I mean. Right, we'll use the scepter of all this time. Please die. Please die. All right, we'll die and wish it up. There we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Move. All right, we've done all three challenges now. Now for the lockdowns. We can probably get away with doing one with the ammo we have but it'll be a bit risky but we can give it a go no dying wish is a little bit scary right let's go do the first one that we did you know it only makes sense should probably get a full shield before we do that though how many shields have we bought this game i feel like we've bought like 10 million well you know not that high i'm just trying to be funny right okay let's start this i'd highly appreciate it if we didn't go down like right now yeah thank you it's gonna keep shooting my charge shot and stay back here oh my god man get off of me get off of me is that the fire one why didn't that shoot on the ground what the fuck as a wolf. This is how we deal with you. A big fucking laser beam. There we go, he's dead. Another what? Bro, I'm being trolled. I, bro, there's three. It's fine, we have silver bullets. We should be okay. Yeah, these, wo these wolves ain't shit, bro. There we go, and I think that is the lockdown done. Yes, it is. Perfect. Grab the stone, and I'll take that max ammo with fucking glee. All right, let's go do the other two. I'm gonna go repair my shield, and we'll go do the same thing. Next one's in the mausoleum. All right, that's a shield repaired. Let's go do the next lockdown. All there. All right, and off it goes. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please. Oh, my God. These fucking... I hate the vampires on this map. Like, they're past the point of being scary. They're just annoying. Because they lunge at you from, like, nine mile away. Come on. Where are the werewolves at? It's spinning a bit faster now. I think that means they're going to spawn in. Ah, there's a fucking red one. Yep, there they are. All right, use a specialist weapon here. Because it gets rid of them in, like, two seconds. That one's glitched, I think. Oh, wait, no. It's just a scepter of our slowing them down. Come on, where's the... Oh, there he is. Piss off. There we go. I will happily take that stone off your hands. And I will happily take this max ammo. All right, two out of three ain't bad. I honestly thought these were going to be a lot harder. 
Let's go repair the shield and let's go do the third one. Same deal as before. Let's just go get the shield repaired before we do anything. How long does Dying Wish take the charge, man? It's only halfway done. Does it get like longer as the rounds go on? I feel like it does. This will probably be the one that either downs us or I, I don't know. We can anywhere but here, I think. And it'll just stop the lockdown, but I ideally just don't want to down, you know? <laughs> oh, death. Summon this fucking stone. <laughs> That's the worst charge shot variant, man, because it just slows them down, right? It's the fire one out. Didn't think I'd have this much fun on a BO4 map. Like, nine's Easter egg was, like, long, but not good. Like, it took far too long, and the steps were so tedious. But this, honestly, I've had a lot of fun. I'm saying this like I've finished it, but, like, we're getting pretty close to the boss fight now. All right, spinning a bit faster now. That means the werewolves are going to spawn. Wow, my frames are tanking. There's the first werewolf. Fuck off. There we go. Next one. All right, one more, I think. There we go. All right, there's our last stone. And I'm pretty sure somewhere, like, in this area, the boss fight arena is just around the cut. Yep, there it is. Let's go get a full shield. Let's go buy some ammo for the mog. Oh, we just got max ammo. We don't need it. And let's just jump straight into it, honestly. One shield repair. All right, I am fully ready to go into this boss fight here. Let's go. Look at this goofy R cutscene, bro. To be fair, it's animated. For BO4, that's, like, new territory. All right, let's get turning these statues then. Where's the green square? There. Ow, fucking hell, man. I'm 25 HP already. Nah, shut up, man. That one's already pointing the right direction. That one's pointing the right direction. I need a fully charged specialist. Turn that that way. Right, there we go. They're all in there. Right, I've got a fully charged specialist. Right, plonk this down. Quick, quick, man. Right, fire into his chest. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. All right, we just got to do that a couple more times. I want to wait for my uh, scepter to run out, to be fair, though. Because I want to get that charge back up nice and quick. Oh, we're waiting, though. We can definitely turn these around. That one's right. All right, they're all right apart from that one. I want to charge my scepter up before we go for another attack. Okay, this boss fight's manageable so far. It's not too bad. Scepter's about halfway full. You know, it'd be nice if they stopped smacking my fucking shield, man. Come on, it's nearly there. Don't want to be wasting mog ammo on them. Bro, he's so loud. Right, okay, it's charged. Turn them over. Wrong way. Ow, fuck. That really hurt. This way. All right, there we go. It's all charged. Speaking of charged, I need one of these, bro. Come on. You fuck off. Plonk that down. Use the mog. Come on. Can't tell if I did it. I did it. I did it. Okay, okay, okay. All right, we're not done yet. We've got one more to do. And then after we've done this one, I'm definitely grabbing that max ammo. That one's aligned. What one's not aligned? This one. Chuck that there. Really wish I had Bandolier Bandit, but the version of BO4 I'm playing, just do you can't unlock it. There's no progression. It's quite nice how they just give you one like on deck there. That's nice. All right, Specialist's about a quarter of the way full. Shield's about halfway gone as well. I'm definitely going to grab that Carpenter probably quite soon. Probably should have put on Armamental so we could have got the Specialist weapon faster, but six and two threes really. We've still got enough ammo to probably do us until the end of this stage anyway. Because the next stage is quite easy. You just got to survive. Come on, bro. There's no way. This should be it. Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Turn this over to the square. It's not aligned yet. What? Right, is it aligned now? No, there's this one that still needs to come over. There we go. Card shot. Scepter. Mog. Did we get it? Okay, wait. I don't think we got the first. I'm not sure. I'm grabbing the max ammo. It's okay. It's okay. Don't need to stress too much yet. One more time we should have him. I'm also just going to grab the carpenter. This needs to turn over that way one more time. There we go. I'm just going to let my blood wolf bite do the job, you know. It's charging up my specialist weapon and I'm saving on ammo. <laughs> Trying to kill like hordes of them instead of just singling out ones of them with the Alistars. Because I don't think we're getting another max ammo until we've completed this stage. So I want this to be the final one. We're going to start turning this statue over because we are very close to getting our specialist. Oh, shit, bro. Give me the specialist weapon man come on come on come on come on did we do it did we do it did we do it no oh my god bro okay maybe this boss fight's not hard maybe it's just tedious as fuck you know what i'm gonna do i'm, I'm in fact i'm gonna do this i'm gonna pop one of these and then turn it over oh, which direction would it be shit i don't want to waste this come on to there yep all right come over here you big bastard there we go take that to the sh oh that should be it yeah come on yeah there we go i think it is now here's the question do we yes we do get another max ammo nice now we're on to stage two we literally just got to survive the onslaught oh i'd be pissed if we died here. No, 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 no. Can you fuck off, you red gremlin? Ow, that napalm zombie almost has killed me. Oh, werewolves? What? I am quite glad it's not three stages of the werewolf boss because that does get tedious as shit waiting for your thing to recharge. I use a gobble gun, bro. Okay, we'll grab the carpenter now. Ah! That's the first time a zombie's got a hit on me, I think. Well, like, properly anyway for me to notice. Right, okay, that's it. I'm grabbing the shit out of this max ammo. And um, we've got to turn these until they go green now because we don't know where the circle is. Right, Okay. Oh, well, there it is. It comes up after one. Right, we've nearly got a full charge on our scepter as well. Right, that's it. I'm 75 HP, bro. Plant this thing down. Come on. 
There we go. Shoot his chest. All right, that's one done. Nice. Oh, my God, I'm getting bombarded by everything. I'm popping an aftertaste. All right, it's there. Of course, though, we're not going to use it straight away because we need to charge up our scepter. Oh, shit, they randomly turn and you lose sight of the square. Okay, that, that, well, that's okay, I guess. We're not even worried about that yet. Scepter's about halfway there. We do have a max ammo at our disposal as well. All right, okay, scepter of raw is charged. We need to find the square again, though. Oh, why are these two being weird? Turn you. All right, yep, I found you. No, not that way. This way, yep, and then one more. This way. No, bro, the... Oh, what the fuck? Why would I want it that way? There, shoot one of these down quick. There, he's coming. All right, chuck that down. He's on his chest. Yeah, we definitely got him that time. Jesus, this is a long-ass boss fight. I'm going to grab the carpenter and stuff now. Actually, I'll make better use of the max ammo and not grab it straight away like a little idiot. It's just charging the scepter that definitely takes the longest, man. If I knew we were going to be using it as much, I would have stuck on, like, armamental. I, I think that's what it's called. It's, like, the one that charges up your grenades and specialist, we specialist weapon faster. Grab the max ammo now. Okay, specialist weapon's getting there. Those red little fucking vampire things are doing my head in. I can't believe we're doing this on round 36 as well. I mean, Blood of the Dead, we, we lost it because of a glitch, but, like, we were still on, like, round 40, and we weren't even boss fighting. <laughs> I was so pissed about Blood of the Dead, man. Like, how can we get that far? Five out of five challenges complete, and it glitches. Lever was in two places at once. How does that even happen, bro? The game's been out for, like, seven years. All right, let's try turning this thing into the green thing. Yep, it's found it. It's this way I want you. Nice. And then I want you over this way. Oh, one more. Shoot that there. Come here. Come on, charge at us, man. There we go. Plant this down. Come on. He's got to be surely, like, nearly dead now. Oh, Oh my god, one more. It must be. They've got plenty of ammo on the Annihilator. We should be okay. Yeah, it, the, the Annihilator would be great if they just took out this one because it just doesn't work. It's making me waste so much ammo. The lack of Bandalier Bandit here is showing. Come on, you're nearly charged. Oh shit, our shield's about to break. Fuck off. I hate the red one so much. Alright, let's start rotating these to see where the green square is. Hasn't found it. Try the middle one. Hasn't found it. That's not good. Try this one. No? Where's it at, bro? There. Okay. And then make sure it's actually charged. Jesus. Tilt this over here. Oh, we changed them, the little rat. Is it here again? No? Oh my god, where's it at? Barely got any ammo, man. Where's this square? Wait, right, it's found it. Sod off. Alright, okay, I'm just gonna plant this thing down now. Hurry up, come here, come here. Come on, this has to be it, this has to be it. Surely it's done now, man. Is this a fucking joke? Bro, I've got no ammo left. What am I meant to do? Oh, there's no way we die by no ammo, man. Well, in times like this, I think you've just got to brute force things. Ow! Bro, these stat users are pissing me off. Why are you going the opposite way? All right, there you go. Oh, Jesus, man. It's going to shambles. We were there. We were right there. They're going to move in a minute. Oh, he's been trapped. He's been trapped. Oh, my God. The amount of zombies is going to fucking kill us, though. <laughs> There's the square. Come on, charge me. Charge me. Charge me. Oh my god, please don't down me. Bro, you ran through the square. How are you not stuck? Right, honestly, we've got 12 rounds of the mog left. If this next one doesn't kill him, I'm charging up my scepter with fucking grenades. If this next one doesn't kill him, it's so over, bro. You have no idea. Let's fucking go, man. Oh, I'm so smart. I'm so smart. Oh my god. I paused the recording, right? Because I was like, right, I have to evaluate my options here. It's good. Oh my god. Oh, oh, I need to calm down and explain. I am so sorry. Look at the state of the cutscene, bro. <laughs> right, I'm going to pause and explain what happened there. Just because you, you probably didn't get the gist. So, when I was down, I got access to a full ammo Alistair's Folly. I'd completely run out of ammo in every weapon I had and I paused my game because I was like, can I use grenades? Can I use my knife? I had ethereal razor. It just wasn't working. But I went down and I realized they gave me that. So I waited for him to go into the square, let the zombies down me and shot him straight in the chest and bing bada boom, we're in the cutscene. I apologize, it's really shit and I don't know why but that's dead of the night for you. Oh, if that's not going to make you watch the end, to the end, I don't know what will bro, that was actually like fucking some Neo type shit from the Matrix. Right, okay. Here we are. Ancient Evil. One of the last maps. Well, it's the last K Chaos map. And for some reason on this map, they spawn like that? Like transit? It's a little bit weird. Right, let's kill these zombies here. Now, this is the map I literally know the least about. And it's also the one that has like probably one of the highest amounts of shit to do in it with all the hands of like Arenos, Gaia, all that stuff. So we're probably going to be in for a long one here. All right, we've got all that open. I'm going to grab myself like a GKS. Get that open. Run over the other side and try to get some doors on that side open too. This open. This open. Oh, I don't know where I'm going. All right, okay, let's get the Sentinel Artifact on. I think I've pretty much got everything that I could have got open in that time without getting the Sentinel Artifact on. So let's do it. Fucking skeletons. You've got to headshot them while they come back. I'm going to try to kill as many of these as possible because they do give you 10 points per kill. And there's Pegasus. Max ammo already. Thank you. All right, and that is the Sentinel Artifact on. Right, we're going to do the round three strategy where, you know, you go 
up to round three and then you start getting everything done then because i'm pretty sure that gives you enough points to basically start on all of the hands so we'll give that a go so we'll end this round then we'll get started on you know opening the rest of the map you can get this door open though this one open as well god this map is massive man and here's the hand of gaia right okay we need to start looking for fallen hands double points perfect all right let's try and make as many points as we can here here's our first shield piece and also uh, we said we were going to go look for the hands but right now i think getting the apollo's will is probably like top priority because it's used for a lot in the easter egg is the golden bridal this guy's gonna spawn now we just have to you know shoot his weak spawn points points point i can't speak we've got a hammer we might as well just use it now yep there we go and that is the shield piece i require thank you very much and now we need to find the little spear i think it's by the store of athenians area and here's the last piece right okay that's the shield sorted nice there is not a lot of buildables on this map jesus all right okay let's get this thing built definitely the coolest shield in bo4 hands down has to be so cool man there we go there's a dormant hand right we can go start on the hand i think i'm gonna do gaia first we might as well there's another dormant hand right wait there's one by the store of athenians area that's good to know here's the hand of gaia and let's get this started nice little bonus points it's always appreciated and just like that there's the fallen hand of gaia that was pretty simple right we gotta upgrade this thing now actually wait no we don't it's the gaia one we don't need to this one can just chill all right let's go grab another fallen hand that was ridiculously easy. There's a one by the store of Athenians area. Maybe this map's not as hard as I thought it was. Pegasus is whinging because he wants me to come over. It's not happening. Pause at the hand. We'll put it back because we kind of need to. We want to pick up another dormant one because we need to do. Is it the. I can't. It's like a beginning with a H. I can't remember its name though. It's a yellow. I know which one I'm on about. Pick up dormant hand. There we go. Here it is. Hand of Himera. That's what it was. And you began with a H. But about the specialist. Just makes things easier, honestly. All right. And then that's that done. Nice. We've got the hand of Himera. Pretty easy if I do say so myself. Thank you. Right. This is the one that we need to get upgraded. To upgrade it, we need to find a mirror. And there's one just outside side of the bathhouse here if we go down here shoot that one more time and then there we go grab the orb run chuck that i've been trolled oh left and right cringe there we go there's the first one right our next one's over by the bridge i'm quite glad we picked up this gks actually because we would have run out of bullets in the uh well and by now probably there we go we'll go this way because we'll run through the amphitheater area this one's really close there we go that's the second one done right the last one's at the temple so we need to head all the way back now here it is knife that then run there we go all right okay prove myself to hermero we got this is how you get the upgrade now we have the redeemed hand and we just got to survive against some zombies oh this is sick man literally got like an orbital v sat <laughs> if you remember that kill streak from bo2 you deserve a veterans award swear to god oh this is great all right that's us done all right that's the redeemed hand of hermero done we can put this back now because we can't actually take it we need to find another dormant hand because there's now two more that we have to do in the underworld but we got to ride pegasus first he just said where sorrow washes over and that's in the underworld so we're gonna have to go to pegasus here we've done well though we've got both the hands that we need we don't actually need to upgrade the hand of gaia hello pegasus let's go bro what a sick cutscene man you can tell where all the budget went for zombies <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. He has a dormant hand. Fucking skeletons, man. You ain't nothing. Right, whip out the specialist, get the bird out, put it away, and grab the conveniently placed full power next to us. Insta kill, perfect. Right, let's start the hand of Aronos. Aranos? Aronos? I don't know. Don't know how you pronounce it. I ain't Greek, bro. We are definitely gonna need a better weapon than the GKS soon, though. But for now, it's okay. And that's it done. Right, let's get this upgraded. We'll also get this side of the map open just so we can get the other eagle out of his cage. Shoot this down. Oh, have you got to use an actual gun? There we go. And then specialist it. Just need to kill these skeletons. Oh, there's a guy here. All right, pack a punch is open, I think. Or close to being open. Oh, max ammo. Perfect. All right, pack's open. Nice. Excuse my specialist on this guy. He's doing my head in. There we go. All right, let's get this uh, hand upgraded. All right, we need to launch a zombie off this massive feather. Like that? Yes. Shoot that. Oh, God. All right, there's one. Here's the next one here. And this is also where the Charon Shrine is. Oh, Sharon? Charon? I don't know. Sharon? <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Surely one of them's got a hit. I think that's a part for the Pegasus strike as well. We'll pick that up. Oh, there we go. Zombie finally landed on it. But where's the feather gone? There we I can't tell if we did that one there because he said a uh, failure and then is never an option. Bro, I got trolled. All right, we got one more to do, I think. There's another part for the Pegasus strike. All right, okay. Here's the last feather. Don't question why it's round 10. I was waiting for a max ammo. Leave me alone. There we go. There we go. I've shot it twice. Move. Right, let's get this upgraded. Oh, this has to be one of the coolest ones. It's literally like an infinite thunder gun, man. I feel like I'm playing like Skyrim or something. Right, we're done. Let's go. Right, we'll put that back and then we'll go do the last one. We need to find our last dormant hand, though.
Oh, just spin the box here, try to get a better weapon than the fucking switchblade. Ballistic knife, that's even worse. It doesn't even one knife anymore. Come on. The ABR, it'll do, I guess. Workbench of Hephaestus. Right, okay, that's in the underworld again. It's a good job I only came back here for the clue. Right, let's jump through. And there's our last dorm in hand. Nice. Really want a better weapon before we start this ritual, though. Come on. MP40, I guess it'll do. Maybe not, actually. It's like not even killing them with four bullets to the head. Come on. Oh, no, I guess we are doing it with the MP40. It's just a specialist. Surely it's nearly done now. Yep, it's done. Right, grab the hand. All right, let's head over to the river and not die. Jesus, man. Bro, come on. There's no way we're going down already. Okay, that's the uh, talisman self-revive gone. All right, we're definitely going to need to buy some perks or something soon, but we need to head over to the river. I'm going to get cornered again, aren't I? No, I'm not. Oh, this is like the fucking wave gun, kind of. Oh, that's weird. All right, let's drink from the river. We've got to go find some coins now. False. That's one. It's a false one. It's a false one as well, man. Come on. Bro, come on. You're joking. How many false ones am I going to find? It's got to be a real one, sure. No. What? Okay, there's our second one. And there's our third. Right, there we go. Let's prove ourselves to Sharon, Sharon, Charon. I don't know. Right, see what the charge attack for this one is. Okay, it just looks like a lot of blood going between two hands. Right, what does it do? Right, let's get another reward going here. Kill zombies in location amphitheater. Okay, right, let's end the road. This one should be a little bit easier. We used a specialist weapon here. Oh, it's a blight father. It's a good thing we whipped this thing out. Go. We should probably also grab another shield. Oh, full power again. Sorry about the drastic jump cuts, by the way. My OBS just really doesn't want to play ball today. Like, I have had issues with BO4 throughout this entire recording. You can probably tell. Like, it's a little bit choppy. It's nothing to do with my PC. It's just, I think this game just is really GPU intensive, and I don't know why. Is it runs fine it's just when it comes to like recording with obs it just shits its pants but yeah we're up to the um challenge step here and then we need to go grab another shield and then start uh knife and oil spills let's grab this max ammo all right let's go get another challenge do not take damage that sounds like a challenge for me bro with the hand of Aranos, this should be okay we've literally just got a thunder gun in our pocket get the specialist out again come on surely it's nearly done by now oh we should really be grabbing perks as well i've only just clocked that we have eighteen thousand points in fact no screw that we'll pop a perkaholic what did we get some shell bunch of stuff yeah it's not too bad i would have want wanted windows whale but like you know it's okay kill zombies with equipment bro frag grenades it is i guess right okay epic reward we're good let's use our thunder gun hand here just get rid of these zombies we'll grab a fresh shield and let's go claim our reward what in the fuck is that oh death perception melee it and then yep we got an on fire spear now we're gonna go find some oil spills here's the first one there's the second one the second there we go we're gonna need to grab a new shield though because this one's about to break grab this relight it and there's the third one and that's that step complete the sh the screen is shaking god i can't speak today right we need to go back to the underworld to grab the hand of sharon good job there's a portal right here here we are right these are the statues i was looking for we need to shoot this on the ground stand in here there's the first one there's the second one there's the third and there's the fourth there we go oh and a nuke perfect now we have the spear step this isn't too difficult it's just really about timing we also need to find the walls that we need to shoot first i think the first one's here yep there's one probably isn't the best idea to be doing this like in the middle of a round so we'll just go around shooting the walls first here's the second wall there we go and there's the last one cool now we need to stop this cog oh, missed fuck's sake there we go there's the first one done zeon breezy thank you for subscribing there we go there's the second one done as well right we need the last one now this is the hardest one and there's the third one i know i didn't actually like record myself throwing the spear but that one takes the piss so we got it done now though we're fine we're fine we're fine we're chilling bro we're on to the next step now we do need a new shield though because it's literally on death's door fucking blight father man no bed did we do it right yes we did okay basically just had to throw a spear into another one of them and i just accidentally ended the round whatever and now what we need this guy to do is shield blast this little stone thing here right shield blast do you think come on doesn't help when we have like five thousand zombies on us though and we've run out of ammo in the hand of Hamera. isn't that great right come here and shield blast please bro that do it no it didn't you've got to get him to shield blast it properly okay there's no way that took three rounds for him to do bro. i'm on 50 hp i think i just saw it drop off let me just double check. Please tell me it did. I can't be bothered to go through that again. It did. Oh my God. Let's go. Right. We have the ank. Right. We need to kill man now. 
I don't know his name, so I'm just going to call him Man, because I need his spear. Let's give him the statue of whatever, or not the statue, sorry, the uh, the Ankh. And then he's going to fire this massive fuck-off beam, or at least I thought he would. Oh, whoops, I don't have the hand Hemera. That would probably explain a lot of things. We also need to go do the Sundial step before that. Getting way too ahead of myself. Give him the hand of Hemera, and then he should. Yep, he'll start firing that massive beam off, and we've got to protect this thing now. I'm just going to use the specialist here. Fuck off. Oh, this is actually quite difficult. Sword off, you stupid skeleton, man. And a blight father. Do you mind? What do these skeletons have against this beam of light, bro? It's not that deep. Here's the question. Did we do it? Because I took a down for it. I think we did, though. Please tell me we did. I can't be asked to do that again. Did it break? Fuck you, you stupid skeleton bastards. Let's go. Give me that shit. Okay, so last game you saw me faffing about trying to get the uh, raw step done and all that jazz. But what I failed to neglect that we hadn't even done the Gaia step, which is where you shoot the roots. Hence why I was getting nowhere and ended up dying around 34. So welcome to game number two. Shoot that. There we go. There's the second one done. And then fire one there. Yep, there we go. And he spawns in. Big old bastard. All right, now that we got him, he needs to come over to the uh, treasuries area. Also, I don't know why my game audio just sounds like I'm in an echo chamber. I think my dying wish is glitched. Here's the piece we need once more. All right, let's just hope he does it and I don't have to do anything fancy. Right, hat on. There we go. He did it first try. There we go. There's the piece we need. And I'm going to bring him down here so we can grab a spear. Rest in peace, that zombie. Gone but never forgotten. Is he going to die or what, man? Really don't want to do this mid-round, big fella. Please just die. Ow. It actually took me two rounds to kill him, right? We got the spear this time. We are chilling. And we're like 10 rounds down from what we were last time. Right, I need a shield. Right, let's clear out this horde and then we'll do the sundial step. Okay, this little fella here is our last zombie. Right. We kind of just need to lure him over because he's not meant to be here. Come on, little guy. While we're here, I think we'll buy some ammo for the mog. Stick that in there. Right, the gold line is here. And wait for him to come over here. Yep, yeah, do your really scary attack, mate. Cheers. Right, there we go. Right, now the symbol's on. Wherever, wherever the hole is. Right, it's here. So how many is it from that? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, there we go. Right, we need another electric zombie now. We have our second victim, I mean, uh, test subject here. That's going to allow us to continue on with the Easter egg. Come on, bud. You know what you have to do. I've always found the catalyst zombies so weird because they can't actually smack you, I don't think. They can only do their funny attacks. Yep, come here, come here. No, I didn't want you to do that. Stand on here. There you go. Right, how many is it from here? One, two, three, four. One, four. There we go. All right, we got one more to do. We need one more electric zombie, and then we are done. I'm also going to get rid of brain rot in case that fucks me up. And I'm also going to take the liberty of swapping out my hand for this. Put my gun in here. This is why we grabbed the blue one. Killer what we'll do. All right, we actually have two of the fuckers this time. Oh, I thought that was end around. Surely it is, right? Yeah, we got... Right, oh, please don't die. You got killer watered. Oh, shit. Shit. Wait, is he good? Yeah, no, he's good. He's good. You've got a job, buddy. You're the last of your kind. Let's not fuck this up now, yeah? He's gonna do an attack before he gets on. Yep. All right, get on. There we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, let's go, bro. That's it. Sundial step is done. It's arguably one of the harder ones to do, especially on this map, because you've just got zombies coming at you from, like, every angle known to man. All right, we've got my least favorite stop coming up. Stop. Step coming up. It's the raw step, the one where you got to kill all the skeletons. I hate hate them. Oh, a carpenter. Bro, I need mog ammo. Where is it at? There it is. Grab the ammo for it. We use the hammer a little bit here just before we start the step, so it's not too difficult on the already existing horde that's chasing me. We also need to grab the hand of Hemera, which we'll go do now. Probably took, like, the longest way possible to it, but it's fine. All right, give me the hand of Hemera, and we'll go start this absolute circus of a step. Give him that, and then he'll put his other hand. Oh, max ammo. All right, give him that. Now, I usually like to use the shield, but I don't know if that's going to be a viable option since I was winging it the last time. Yep, there's a guy there. Piss off. Fuck off, man. Move! There. Oh, they stopped it. Okay, okay, okay. We'll sort it. We'll sort it. It's fine. It might have took 9 million attempts, but there you go. That's all we needed. The fucking axe, for whatever reason. I can't believe that, bro. I lost all my self-revives doing that. We're probably going to die in the boss fight, but honestly, if we've got this far, I'm calling it a dub. Alright, we've got to go do the spotlight step now, but 
Uh, my hopes are not high for completing this egg, I won't lie. But we'll still give it a go. I'm not, I'm not, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna give up. Do you know what I mean? We've got this far. Might as well have a bash at it. You know what I mean? But it's just a no self revive thing that's like killing me. I got a little too excited with completing that there. We need to go give the uh, scepter to Ra there. You have no idea how long this egg's taken me, man. I've been like trying to crack this all day. Wherever we get up to, I'll be happy. And I hope you guys will be too, because this is took piss. <laughs> Alright, give him that. There we go. Right, okay, here we go. Where are we going? Over here. Right, so if they're up there, one. There we go. Move to this one. Use that. Go here. Shoot them. Right, okay, I think that's one round of it done. I think so, anyway. Right, okay, let's do it again. Shoot one of those. There we go. Go over here. One of them. I think you've got to do that one more time. We should have enough ammo to do it again. Right, one more time. There we go. Oh, my bad. Oh, fuck. And this one. Shoot one. Is that it? No, maybe one more time. I don't know what we're doing here. Right, here. One. There we go. Shoot one. I think we did that one all right. I think. Because my character said something's gone wrong. All right, go here. Shoot one. There we go. Another one of these. There we go. Did we do it? I think we did it. There's no more spotlight. Right, okay. Well, that wasn't too bad. I thought that was going to be a lot worse. It looks like we failed it. Let's give it another go, though. Right, okay. Here. Kill them all. This one here. Kill them all again. There we go. Shoot them. Get back to it. Yep, there. Oh, right. Okay, that's what you meant to do. Okay. Not just let it go grey. Get on here. Shoot that. Get on here. Charge attack. Shoot them. Charge the attack. Go here. Shoot once. And again. Like that. There we go. Another charge the attack. Shoot once. Yeah! Did we do it? That sounded like we did it. Yeah, we got the max ammo this time. Let's go. Right, okay. I feel like an idiot now. <laughs> <laughs> now we've got to enter some funky looking symbols. So it's this one, that one, that one, that one, that one, and then that one. Yeah, let's go. Slap down the Pegasus strike. That zombie's going to get killed by it anyway, isn't he? I mean, you'd think so. But Pegasus is going to rise this motherfucker out the ground. Whoa, <laughs> that's cool. Oh, it didn't kill the zombie. That's nice. I would prefer not to kill the zombie here. There we go. That's it cocked back. Right, we need to go grab a shield. Well, we have the shield, but we need the blue flame. So we got to leave here, unfortunately. Grab it there. All right, now all we need to do is run over to this little trap here, run through it, and hurry up, because our shield's about to break, but I think we should have more than enough time. We need to run all the way back up here, and then melee the crossbow, and then it will open the portal to the boss fight. There we go, and there's the boss fight portal. Right, what I think we should do, honestly, is we need to get the homunculus out of the box, and then we're pretty much ready to go, and I'm pretty sure the box is in here. Yes, and oh, it was. Oh, well, it was. It's not there anymore. Right, okay, look, I can't lie, I've been spinning the box for, like, a good 15 minutes. The round's just ended. I think we should just jump into it. We're going to be spending more than, like, we need to trying to hit the box rather than just going into boss fight right now. So I think we should just go for it, honestly. I know we're not going to have access to the Pegasus Strike once we get into the fight, but honestly, I feel like it's just, like, stupid to wait around for the monkey bombs or the homunculuses or whatever. I think we should just go for it and see what happens. Because it's been a fucking valiant effort since the start. Let's just hope we end it. Or oh, hope we end it. I was going to say, I hope we end it on a high note. Well, here we go. There's my boy, Pegasus. No, my boy. Holy shit. Right, okay, here we go. Also, there's that fucker throwing stuff at us. Oh, and there's this guy. Who do you think you are? See, these mini bosses are cool and all, but they're just annoying, man. Ow. Right, okay, well, he's dead. I guess the shield works really well against him. Right, let's move. Right, our priority is getting Pegasus down on some sort of island. Where is he? There he is. Definitely going to be using the hand to try to get him down, though. This launcher thing's quite cool. What a unique boss fight, bro. Ow. Trying to do as much damage to him as I can. Well, so, you know, trying to, like, not die. I feel like we're doing some good damage to him, though. There he is again. Oh, right, he's down, he's down, he's down. Do as much damage as I can with the specialist weapon. Right, when you get the fuck off this island, bro. Grab the max ammo. Ow, bro, he hurts. Oh, we got a self-revive back. What? I'm getting so many subs, bro. I'm not even live. It feels like I am, though. <laughs> Where is he? There he is. Let's try to do some good damage to him. Get fucked, Pegasus. Never liked you anyway. Nah, I'm joking. He was actually really helpful. Ah, oh, another one of the mini boss fucks have shown his shoulders first. Right, let's use the shield. Seems to do wonders. Oh, that launcher needs to recharge. Get me off this island, man. He's trying to do as much damage to, to him as I can. Ow, bro. Let's get me off this island. Right, he's down. He's down. He's down. The max ammo over there. But there's fucking things blocking me, bro. Give me this max ammo. I need some zombies, bro. I need to charge my specialist. Oh, asking you shall receive, I guess. It doesn't help that the mob is doing nothing. Ow, 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 ow. Specialist about halfway there. Oh my god, please, no, 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 no. Regen, damn you. Oh, okay. Bro, what is that attack he keeps whipping out? It hurts. 
Ah, fuck, he destroyed one of the islands. Right, we got our specialist back. Start doing some damage to him. Come on, show your face, your horse. There he is. I thought he fell there for a minute. Come on, come down, you big bastard. Right, I'm getting off this island. It's got all the electricity and shit on it. This one does too. What? Where is he? He's over there. Bro, I hear him. Where's he at? Come on, come down. Oh, that's him, that's him, that's him. Do as much damage as we can. We need this max ammo, man. Right, he got back up. Where's the max ammo? There's the max ammo. Cool. Oh, we did it, we did it, I think. Yeah, he kills him. Bro, no. Rest in peace. Right, we really need to start charging our, um... Ow, why is he hurting me? Why have I been down then? What the fuck? Where was... What? Nah, bro. Oh, I'm actually so upset. Do you know what it is? We gave it a good go. But unfortunately, I don't have all the time in the world to work on this video. Right, okay. Alpha Omega. Arguably one of the easier BO4 Easter eggs, but it's not easy by any means, like in BO3 standards, bro. It's still quite a challenge because it follows the, you know, do five challenges on every single map kind of thing with BO4. It does it on Blood of the Dead? I'm pretty sure it does it on some of the Chaos maps. You know how it goes with BO4 Easter eggs. They're long and tedious. Anyway, all right, let's go ahead and pop a shopping free here since we did that on nine. So I'm not going to throw a fit over using Gobble gums or elixirs as they're called now get this open get this open quickly run and get the power on there we go grab one of these get generators open and that's pretty much all we need to do honestly that was a good shopping free run kill some of these zombies for some extra points right let's go do the lockdown step and get the power on grab this piece all right star ventilation systems one minute till reactivation that is fucking long in the cod zombies terms for a lockdown man then we got to go up and do you know the actual pack a punch step which is rejigging all the vents outside and spawning a shit ton of zombies that's an insta kill perfect use the well in here since it's insta kill okay we're halfway done double points nice i guess we're only getting like 10 points of killing these crawlers anyway but it's still kind of nice all right there we go i think it's done yep there we go all right yep let's go get pack a punch on now here's our first vent here come on hurry up before they start spawning in there we go what the fuck is going on with the power bro don't want to grab that nuke because i don't want to end the round gonna try to get as much done as round, round one as possible here all right repair this there we go that's that on through here repair this one come on there we go right picking up this spitfire was definitely the right idea honestly some bonus points that's always appreciated what house are we missing i think it's a one back here yeah it's this one over here it's a blue one it makes sense because we haven't opened it right last vent to repair and then pack a bunch is on right, that's it right now i want to focus on the buildables first off we're going to do the shield then we'll do the ray gun thing and then we'll do the telepods because they're all needed for the easter egg well not really the ray gun thing but you know it's just nice to have right okay shield first it's not on there means the shield piece must be up here right somewhere yep there's the first riot shield piece nice now we're looking for the board bit, which can spawn in the cul-de-sac. We just have to, like, actually keep our eyes peeled for it, though, because it's kind of easy to blend in with a lot of stuff. There it is. And then the last one's down in the bunker. Okay, it's not there. There it is. Okay, right. Shield's built. Now let's do the ray gun thing. Bro, this bunker actually messes me up. We need to be on yellow house side. Let's get this middle door opened up here as well, because we need the galvan knuckles at some point. Nope, it's not on the table. There it is. There's the first piece. Okay, our next piece is in the storage area of the bunker. I do really like how with Alpha Omega, they took the bunker and ran with it because we had no clue what was underneath here it was like the biggest easter egg of black ops 2 in my opinion well like placebo easter egg because it didn't actually exist everyone thought you could open it but you just couldn't is it on this barrel no it's not is it on this shelf yes it is right, is it on the card yes it is perfect right that's another thing built now we just need to build the tally pads which we already have a piece for oh please tell me we have enough to open this door yes okay right it's not in there is it outside on the little pallet of wood Yes, it is. Okay, there's the second piece. I was going to say first, but no, it's definitely the second. And then the last piece we need is in the greenhouse. There it is. Right, we have got every single buildable ready at our disposal. Right, we'll go make the assembly kit since it's like the one we need like the least at the minute, but we can just go do that in operations. This lets us upgrade the Rigor Mark II, which we're going to be getting a free one anyway, so because it's right there. But it lets us upgrade it to an infinite ammo type. Right, craft the Rigor assembly kit. There we go. Right, okay, we'll go build the shield in the greenhouse since I feel like that's probably the better location for it. Right, okay, there's the the shield and then finally we'll go build the telepads which are in the apd control room but we can go through down in the bunker through this house i'm pretty sure yeah there we go there's our final buildable table two telepads for me thank you very much Right, that is everything we need officially built. Right, so I took the liberty of writing some stuff down, like, beforehand, so I don't have to keep stopping the recording and tapping out to watch a guide. We need to activate Rushmore now, so we can actually start the Easter egg, but simultaneously, I also want to be doing the Mark II frames. Now, for that, we need to go look for TVs, but we'll do that after, because it requires zombie souls, and we're just going to get too high up in the rounds. It's not going to be good. All right, access Rushmore. Right, our first code is 7626. We need the one in the MPD, which is this blue house over here. It is 968. 
four? Yeah, Rushmore's having a bit of an existential crisis because he hasn't been online for 50 years. Right, where is this stack of papers again? Is it on here? While we're here, actually, we can grab this key for the fourth code. Right, there's a stack of papers. Our third code is 0660. And then that little key we just grabbed comes in handy because we need to go to the yellow house now and open a drawer and then that will be our fourth code. I love this Easter egg in comparison to something like fucking Blood of the Dead Man. It's just straightforward. Just a lot of codes. Right, open that up. And then our final code is 2686. Right, okay, let's go input these into Rushmore, and then I'm going to start on the Mark II frames. So, 7, 6, 2, 6, end of that. 9, oh, come on. 9, bro, okay, I get it. 9, 6, 8, 4, end of that. And then it was 0, oh, 6, 6, 0. Oh. There we go. And then we need 2, 6, 8, 6. There we go. Right, okay, let's go start on the Mark II frames. Now that we've done that, that's the first step out of the way, nice and done. Nice and done, that's a new one, bro. Right, is there a one here? This is the greenhouse, not the yellow house. We'll go through yellow house because of the TV there. Are you on? Yes, you are. Right, okay. Right, now we need zombie souls to fill up this little TV. Then we've got to go fill, like, all four of them. Then it'll spit our code on each of the monitors. The only unfortunate thing is we're on such a low round, we're going to get, like, no spawns. So this will probably take us up to, like, maybe round six, which is still fine. We can also save our points for the galvan knuckles because that's needed for the next step. Okay, picking up the pace a little bit for round three. Jesus. They're already stumbling. Okay, insta-kill. We can just knife them. Number acquired, five. Okay, so the yellow house is five. That's our second number. Right, let's go back to the site entrance and see if that TV's on. If not, it'll be one of the ones in the bunker. Right, no, it's the one in the bunker. Okay. Right, okay, it's the one in the APD control room. It's maybe do fucking laps. Kerry Douglas, thank you for subscribing. Right, here's our next TV. I don't know how many souls it actually needs. I just, I think it's six. Might be similar like the, like the Mob of the Dead dogs. No, oh, Blood of the Dead for this game. Come on, where are my spawns at? Okay, maybe this will be enough. I'm not too sure. I think we need one more. Okay, no, that's it. Right. The APD one is four. That's our last number. Okay. Right. Since we're already in the bunker, technically, we can go back through solitary and just check the diner real quick. I also would preferably want to end the round now. Please just be the diner. Yeah, it is. Okay. All right. There we go. Right. This should be really easy. It's round four. We're getting tons of spawns. Double points. Perfect. Our numbers acquired. Nice. Whip out the katana here. Get some points with the galva knuckles. What's our number though? Nine. Okay. That's our second number, I think. No, it's our third. Right. So our last one would be the site entrance. Okay, that is perfectly fine. So it should be just here, right? Yep, there we go. Oh, God, I've run out of ammo. That is the worst possible time ever. I guess we'll use the shield. All right, our last number's four. Okay. We also are just short of enough to get some Galva Knuckles here. I think there's 7k on this game for some reason. Oh, they're 5k? What am I on about? Right, there we go. I'll right, we'll also grab our quick revive here. Right, okay, we can now input the following code into Rushmore. 4594. Actually, I think I'm just entering them wrong. Hang on. So is it 5494? Yeah, there we go. Right, okay, we can start the upgrade process for our ray gun pretty soon. But right now, I need to find a TV to continue this Easter egg. Because we can't actually start that upgrade process until we get a weapon with dead wire, unfortunately. And we just have 500 points. So I am looking for a TV. And I think I saw it was on somewhere. Is it this one? No, okay. Is it in the yellow house? It has a, I think it has a uh, chance of actually being in here. Oh, I think that's it. All right, okay, yeah, I think it's definitely this one. We just gotta wait for a zombie now. All right, there he is. He's coming full belt. Oh, wait, no, shit. We're looking for one with yellow static, not the broken arrow logo. That's after you punch it. I'm stupid. I think they're down here. And it's, yeah, it's literally right here, bro. That was really stupid for me. Right, okay, that is F0930. C1015, D is 0815, E is 1130, and then B was 0445, right? We have all of our codes, now we just gotta input them and figure out where our houses are. Right, this is A, that's the only code we didn't get, so we can skip that one. This is B, if I remember right, the clock is up here on the wall. B was 04, right, knife that once, and again. Right, that should be it, probably. We got code sequence incorrect, what? Oh, 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 have you gotta do it in the order that you found them. So we gotta do F first. Okay, well, we'll try that. We'll go find F. This is C. Where's our boy F at? This is D. So that means E and F must be the first two houses then. There's F. All right, so F is 9.30. Knife for that once. Wait, are the clock's not working now? What? Oh, bro, I'm so confused at this step, man. It shouldn't even be confusing me. Right, let's try the TV thing again. Right, okay, it's reading through the same ones again. Let's just go try and input them. Right, so our first one here is 9.30. There we go. All right, yeah, there we go. Security clearance black granted. Nice. All right, next one's C. I think C is the prisoner holding. Yeah, this is C. C was 10.15. So knife this once and then press it once. There we go. We also got a free upgraded weapon. And then D. D is this house here, right? Yeah, this is D. Clear out some of this horde here because I can't be entering a time when there's like 9 million zombies chasing after me. I also need to find out where is the clock. There it is. Right, D was 8.15. 
I am going to quickly go and gr run and grab a shield as well, because it's just down here. Oh, wait, no, we didn't build the shield there. It's at the greenhouse. I'm stupid. Bro, I keep forgetting. Have I got dementia? Like, I'm forgetting so much stuff. I'm going to be forgetting my own name soon. Right, it was 8 and then 15, yeah? All right, there we go. Scoot the current red granted. Nice. Then it's E, which is not this one. E, I'd imagine, is operations, wherever this one's clock is. I think it's upstairs, actually. It would kind of make sense for it to be upstairs. I won't, I won't lie, though. Yeah, there it is. So E was 11.30, and then one down yeah there we go right we also have a pack of bunch mark two at our disposal let's go and then b was 445 that's the one in the original nuketown cul-de-sac which one's b is this b yes yeah, it's b b was 445 knife that once and then like that and we got a knife it once more all right so if we go to a now it should just wind up correct wherever it is on the wall no i don't want to place my telepad there all right yeah there we go so our code is shit our code is not shit our code is 1045 i think if i can read time that would be really worrying if i couldn't there, there we go yeah he doesn't trust us but yeah that is the, how you do the step nice one all right he's gonna ask us to do a bunch of stuff but first we're gonna go get the weapon we have here dead wired and then we're gonna go shoot off a panel in the generator room to start the upgrade process for the Raygun Mark II. Right, hopefully it just gives us straight off the cuff and I don't have to spend all my points on it because I would like to grab some perks as well. No, that's brain rot. That would be useful for a step later on though. Prior free, bro, please don't do me like this. Yes, there we go. Killer what? Right, let's head over to the generators. There'll be a glowing panel apparently. Yep, there it is. I will be taking that. Right, what we'll do is we'll clear out some zombies and then we'll go look for these telephone posts because I think it's the sparkling ones you have to shoot and then, well, the yellow one at least. Wherever that is, there's so many across the map, man. I want a shield now, though. And there's the shield. Very nice. At least we have a pack of bunch of ray gun to hold us out until then, though. It's insane how you just get that for free. Oh, point city, bro. Okay, there's our first one. There's our second one. Okay, we're looking for another sparkling yellow little tower thingy. It's not that one. It's this one. And then this one. And then finally that one. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we did it. Nice. Right, now can we stick the canister in here? Yes, we can. Right, now we've got a soul circle that we need to fill up. I actually never knew this upgrade process was this easy. Also, it's so sick how they're using the generator that everyone also thought was something to do with the bunker as a way in this season. Bro, I'm not gonna lie. Alpha Omega's, like, design choices are so cool. Just the map is so Oh, shit. <laughs> we'll have this filled in no time. All right, let's whip out the uh, katana here. Oh, it's filled. Okay. Well, that did not take long at all. Let's pick that up. And then we can run over here quick. Move, man. And then get one of these. Yeah, there we go. Wait, we're pretty much set up. I've just got to go run and grab my perks. And that's why I wanted this variant. We should also pack it. Because it has infinite ammo, as you can see in the bottom right. It's recharging. Let's grab stamina up here. I'm sick of running around at a snail's pace. Chuck this in here. All right, we don't talk about the fact I just took it down. And I almost thought I lost the ray gun. But that's actually kind of impossible because they're technically the same grade as the staffs for like rarity so they can't be gone forever you just pick it back up right rebuy my two perks here that was ridiculous i should not have down there it's like one of them ones where you get cornered by two zombies and you got like like this this bro i'm not going down again piss off like i said it's one of them ones where you get cornered by two zombies and it's just over and right, it's access rush more again pursue all avenues of science and invention we gotta go find a crawler gotta listen out for this thing spawning in there we go there he is come on little buddy this way come this way no Come back, bro. It's actually kind of difficult. I don't remember this step being so difficult, man. Gotta be careful when I'm shooting as well. Fuck! I swear to God, if I go down one more time like that, man. All right, there we go. Have we done it? He went in there. There we go. Right, nice. I can't believe we went down again, man. I want at least one self-revive before we have to go into the boss fight. Grab a shield, because I feel like that's why we're going down a lot. All right, let's go do the second core value. All right, this one's pretty easy. You're just going to get malt and cough up the canister of 115. Right, okay, knife the door. Right, we need to go grab the Adam unit from storage, and then we need to lead him over to Malton's little fucking hidey hole and get him to cough up the 115. Come on, Adam. Let's go. Re-plush. Thank you. Oh, it's Ray Plush. Okay, I'll th thank you for subscribing. Got the Adam unit now, bitch. Let me in. Right, okay. Pick this shit up. Right, we got it. Let's go. Transfusion facility, and then put it back on the shelf. There we go. And we have Adam for a little bit, because we've got to, like, use him up, I guess, because he is the civil protector of the map. Right, let's go do core value three. These challenges aren't honestly that hard. Right, okay. We need to chuck a telepad on there, and then we need to go run over to the power door, and we need to chuck a telepad on there, which is this bit here. All right, cool. Now we need one of them shocky crawler things to shock this box and open it. We just need to wait for one. Right, we'll probably get one this round, honestly. Oh, it's a dog run. Never mind. I am going to take this as an opportunity to go and grab Dying Wish. There's my favorite crutch perk. Right, now I need one of them electric crawlers, please. We'll probably get one this round. Yeah, there's one already spawning in now. It's the only issue I have now. There's going to be shit tons of zombies, man. Right, we're going to use the katana. Going to try to avoid the crawlers, though. Right, okay. There we go. It's open. And then press F on it. Go. Run, man. There we go. 
Right, now we need to go with brain rot so we can get zombies to smash paintings. Yeah, I know how weird that sounds. We can also grab our last perk here. All right, electric burst. Nice. I'm mainly getting that for the sake of getting our modifier on Dying Wish because it's kind of a necessity. You don't want to be backed in a corner and then have one HP and then go down again. All right, please give me brain rot. Please, please. Firebomb. Cringe. All right, we've got to start saving our points again. All right, we use the katana because we get the melee bonus. All right, let's go try get brain rot again. I doubt we're going to get it first try, but if we do, that's a plus. Chuck that in there. What do we get? Brain rot. Perfect. All right, this is the first pain that we need. Come on, one of these brain rot. Never mind. I guess I'll go another one. Ugh, that's annoying. All right, okay, you should rip off the pain and quick. I can grab this one and leave. 4990. Beds is 4990. Right, the next one we need is here. I'm going to whip out the ray gun though, because we're definitely not getting another brain rot for a long time. Come on, surely it's got a brain rot now. All right, there we go. We got another one. 8174. Fuck's sake, man. One of the vents clogged up again. I actually got jump scared by them zombies, bro. Right, there we go. It's on. Right, and here's the last paint that we need. Hopefully, we can get the last zombie brain rotted, but I have no clue. No, please. No, okay. 6647 is the last code. I know I'm paused. I apologize. Right, let's clear out this round a bit here, and then we can go input the codes. Then we can go start the rush more step with all the powers off. Ideally, I want to save a zombie for that step because it's just way easier. Right, okay, we got one zombie left. Let's not kill him. All right, let's stick our first code in here, which is 4990. There we go. Then it's. 8174 and then it's 6647. There we go. Right, okay. This is the one where you have to turn off all the um switches in the correct order for the power to come back online because he kind of shits himself here. Right, okay. Diner needs to be on up. Beds is over here. It needs to be on. Oh, it's already on up. Hang on. There you go. Lounge needs to be on down. Wherever it switches. Hang on. Yep. Lounge needs to be on down. Generators needs to be on up. So we'll go do that one next. Generators is on up. And then the last one is storage, then solitary. So that's a trap. Storage needs to be on down. And then solitary down. Yeah, there we go. There we go. It's because I've read the word good at the bottom there. <laughs> right now we should be able to restart the power. All right, we're good. All right, the last core value, we got to go find atom units, I think. Oh, wait, no. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. What's the fifth core value? Oh, no, it is. It is. It's the atom unit. I was getting really confused. All right, let's go find some spark and atom units then. He has one. Let's overload him. Now we've got to do a minute lockdown. Honestly, with a ray gun here, we should be fine. You'd like to think anyway. I absolutely adore how fast this thing just gets zombies out my way. All right, lockdown's done. That's fine. Grab his arm. All right, let's go check down in the bunker to see if we can find any sparking ones. Yep, he has one. We'll do this one next. I'm going to wait for the katana here because I'm backed into a corner. Yeah, this lockdown should be pretty easy if we've got the katana out here. We've also got a long time left on it, so we can probably use it for, like, the duration. Got into a little bit of a sticky one there towards the end, but we're fine. Right, there's the second piece. Now we need to look for the third lockdown area. First, though, I am going to grab a shield because I am not fucking around. Thank you. Ah, right, here's our last spot. Fucking Adam, right. One last lockdown. We got this, we got this, we got this. Wait, hang on a minute. I can just teleport out. I didn't even mean to do... Is that a bug or something? It really doesn't seem like you're meant to be able to do that. No, we're going to do it again. Okay. Oh, full power. Okay, I'd really like to get my katana out. Now, please charge up, man. Right, okay. We've got a full power there that we can use to our advantage. Grab it now. Oh, my fucking God, man. Oh, we almost had it there as well. But no, it just had to teleport me, didn't it? All right, one more time. The only way we get through this is if we use the katana wisely. All right, okay. We're just down to the ray gun now. Max ammo. Ideally, probably would have wanted like an insta kill or something, but okay. Took another down, but we got it done. Finding the rest of our perks back. I think we got it done anyway. I hope. I can't be asked to do that again, man. Please tell me it's done. Yep, there's the head. Thank you. Grab another shield. Bro, they're getting pricey now. Right now, we can go chuck this on here. There we go. All right, let's go find this elemental orb thing. There it is. All right, this thing's going to take the longest route poss possible possible, to the APD, so we've got to be careful. I keep losing sight of the thing because I keep going inside and I can't see it. Well, this is actually nerve-wracking. We're getting so close to finishing this now. Right, okay. There we go. That took so long. Hello, Peter McCain. My favorite zombies character. Right, okay. That's the fifth value done. Let's access Rushmore. Right, now is pretty much just boss fight. All right, here we go. All right, got to charge one of these canisters up. We should be fine, though. This is so fucking goofy, bro. They're just running at us. Right, we're gonna let our ray gun charge up just a little bit here. Not there yet. Oh, can my gun just charge up, man? Jesus. All right, okay, here we go. This is the Avogadro part. Oh, Jesus Christ, they just nuked Nuketown, bro. Right, lounge, diner, storage beds. Lounge, diner, storage beds. I'm writing that down. Right, okay, we're at lounge. Right, here we go. Ow, ow, fuck, he hurts. Jesus. All right, I'm gonna whip out the katana. Uh, right, okay, that one's done. Give me my carpenter. Right, diner's next. I'm gonna pop one of these just so we can so charge up our um, thingy way faster. Where's the canister? There it is in the middle. I see. All right, let's so charge this. 
Oh, full power. Right, okay, let's begin the soul capture here. Oh my god, this is fucking nerve-wracking. Don't get too close to him. Jesus Christ. Oh, we gotta keep charging this thing, man. Come on, surely it's almost full. Right, there we go. Run. Right, we're gonna get to the diner. Here it is. Where's the canister? All right, it's in the middle. This is probably the worst one by far. God, bro, the amount of Adam units they're sending is so overwhelming. It does not help that our Reagan runs out of ammo in like 0.2 seconds either. Right, okay. Get out. There we go. Right, that's the second one filled. Now it's beds. I lied, it's storage. Right, get this turned on. Oh, bro, this room's tiny. Fuck's sake, man. Right, that's one of our... Oh, we don't have any perks now. Right, it's not all bad. We could have lost Quick Revive, to be fair. Right, okay, there we go. Right, our last one's bed. So this one. Gonna pop one of these. Start the stall capture. This room's kind of big, but the problem is with it is that it's got, like, a massive circle. Okay, we're running out of ammo. Gotta let our gun recharge, man. Oh, my God, we did it. Okay, run. Right, then we go solitary, yeah? And through solitary, we come back to the APD. Right, okay, let's pop another dead man walking here. Right, knife him. Get over this way. You dumb Avogadro bitch. Come on. Yes, 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 there we go. There we fucking go. Oh, my God, we've done it. We've beat Alpha Omega. Off you go to transit, little bro. I have Corona. Thank you for subscribing. What an occasion for you to subscribe. And we'll press F to claim the elemental shard. And on to Tag Datoan. And the last of many, Tag Datoan. Okay, this is the final Easter egg we have to do on Black Ops 4. And man, has it been a bit of a ride. Let's not freeze to death here. Let's get out of the water there, Jesus Christ. All right, let's get this power switch on. I am going to take the liberty of killing all these round one zombies. Just so we have enough points to open up the first door. Just so I don't waste my shopping free here. So we get an extra bit of extra distance. Fuck it, we'll also get this one open. Right, okay, let's get the lighthouse open. Pop the shopping free. Go, go, go. Get this open. Gonna grab a vapor, because why not? Run all the way back down quick, because we need to grab the blue rock for him, so we need to get that path open very quickly. This door open. Also, quickly run down here and get this other door open. There's the blue rock he needs. Get this open. And I'm pretty sure the only area we won't manage to get open is the boat. Well, the inside of the boat, you know what I mean. Right, let's go give the hermit the blue rock, because that's basically how we have to start off. Because he'll locate pack a bunch for us. All the way up these stairs here. Give him the blue rock. Right, okay, that's pretty much all we can do. Let's get this round ended. In fact, we can actually build the shield. I'm going to head all the way back down again. And we'll go out through this way back to the tag spawn. Not the original spawn. There it is. There's the first piece. Nice. Right, we need some points. Let's get this last zombie killed. We need to get this side open so we can get the other shield piece. And then we can get the third one. That's one thing ticked off the bucket list. Then we should probably focus on the cranks to get the facility opened up. Get the other two power switches on. Free wonder wall. Off, all that good stuff. Oh, and the Samantha little box thingies. Here's our second shield piece. We also need to make a quick start on the dummy challenges for the Hermit, which is fine. We can do that now. Pick up the snowballs while we're here. They're going to come in useful. Kind of forgot we picked up the vapor. Now, where is this last shield piece, man? There it is. Okay, cool. All right, let's go get this thing built then. And here's the perfect spot for it. All right, there's the shield. Nice. Good progress. Good progress. Start the challenges for this location. Let's get it done. Kill enemies with headshots and collect brains. That's easy peasy. Pick up the brain. Right, we need to get 25. Right, while we're doing this challenge, we can be looting other stuff as well. Right, now I do kind of want to focus on getting as many points as possible because we want to get that boat section open and get the other power switch on. We also want to get grab the cranks. We can also grab the icicle for the free wonder waff while we're here. Get that on the burn. There is our icicle. There we go. Right, we have a decent amount of points now. That should get us to the stern of the boat, which is, you know, where a lot of the stuff is, like the port, the crank, well, the first one. That'll get us up to that facility there where the third power switch is. There's so much stuff to do on this map, man. It's crazy. Right, there's our first crank. Nice. Right, let's make our way across the ship here. Got another brain here. Yeah, nice. 15 out of 25. We're doing well for this challenge. Right, we have 24 brains. Looking good. Get this barrier open. Yeah, this is where I want to be. The forecastle. We'll stick that in there. And it'll begin to melt. All right, there we go. 25 out of 25 brains. All right, there we go. We also got a piece for the dynamite. We need to kill them flame zombies with our snowballs. That's why I'm almost keeping some snowballs on me. We should also look for that other crank, shouldn't we? Before we do that, though, because we have it open, we can go rotate the first line into position. It's just here. All right, let's get this rotated. Right, that's that one done. Right, we need to find the other crank now. Oh, double points, always appreciated. There we go. There's another piece for the dynamite. There it is. Very nice. All right, let's go get this other line into position. 
while we're here also because we're a little productive we can also grab this key slap the crank on here get it twisted right now that they're both in position we can go grab the handle off the hermit we also get the second power switch on here now that we got the points for it all right we can head back down from here now and head up to the lighthouse like i said to go get this handle from the hermit get a carpenter from here kill 20 enemies with a shield bash that's so doable zipline handle that is exactly what i was looking for and we'll head up to the facility all right we are gonna have to end the round again because we need more points fuck's sake dog round that's actually kind of perfect because i need some ammo for my vapor here there we go we got enough points now get the safe open and then we got the real device nice one oh don't get downed by like four zombies it'd be embarrassing uh, do our challenge as well here, actually. Shield bash. All right, it's charged. Oh, that's another flame zombie. We can do one of these. And there is our third dynamite piece. Nice. Right, let's grab the golden rod. I didn't want to zip line to the ship. I wanted to go over to the... Oh, okay, whatever. It's fine. Let's head up to the top floor, and then we'll give him the real device, and he should give us the key. Real device. Create key, and then use it on this one. And then, free window off. And there we go. Definitely the worst variant of the Wonder Off, but it's still a Wonder Off. Right, we'll finish off this challenge, and then I think I'm going to go do the music create Easter egg for the little Samantha boxes, because we need them for the Easter egg too. And then I'm pretty sure we're good to go-ish. Right, it's 10 out of 20, not bad. Right, okay, let's go get a new shield. We're only just here, so that's fine. Okay, a couple more zombies. There we go. We'll use a katana here a little bit, since, we get, since we're going to get a full power from the drop. Let's redeem the full power. Right, we're going to go do the P-Jar quest, which we can do later on. Right now, I want to go do the music box. Get this door open. And down here, I think, is the third power switch. Yes, it is. Right, let's go find some key cards then. Here's the first one. Is it here? Doesn't look like it. It's not on the bottom of the rack either. That means it's in the toilet. There it is. Right, let's loop around quick to the uh, security lobby. Oh, we don't have dynamite. We can't do that, unfortunately. We've got to go the long way around. That's annoying. Slap these key cards in here. Grab them. Head back through to the main bit. Stick that one in there. And that one in there. And open the vault. Right, we need to wait for the vault to depressurize or open or whatever. Yeah, it's gonna, this is why there's a lockdown event. Because the door takes nine years to open. It's fine. We've got a katana though. We'll be chilling. Carpenter, nice. That repairs our shield. All right, there we go. Grab the Samantha boxes. If we're allowed to, Jesus, let me out. All right, there we go. Got full power here too. It's always nice. All right, and I think that is pretty much everything we need for now. Blood Wolf Bite, we'll grab that. Why not? All right, now we really need to be focusing on that challenge, the P-Jar one. Because we literally have everything we could possibly need. We just need to build the dynamite. I'd rather have a bunch of zombies, to be fair, and have them, like, slow and go do this than have loads of sprinters. So we'll go grab a P-Jar now from the top of the lighthouse. Pick up a P-Jar. Nearly there with the first one. We're not allowed to run, jump, or sprint, like, fully. So we've just got to kind of do a casual stroll down to the beach to empty them out three times. Annoying, but it needs to be done for these three, so... There we go. There's one. Got another PGR. What an amazing step, by the way. Cheers, Treyarch. There's the second one done. And the third one. There we go. Let's get our free self-revive here. And that is up. That's up four self-revives, bro. That's actually kind of nuts. All right, let's go do the one at the forecastle now. We'll go start that. All right, okay. 20 enemies, 25 enemies while we're standing still. That's easy. We should also probably just get the rest of the boat open. We haven't even been inside. Oh, stamina up. That is a shout. Shoot this pipe so that it, you know, diffuses this. And we get access to pack a punch. Very nice. We use the shield weapon as well here a little bit just so we can get... Some extra kills without using all of our ammo. 16 out of 25, not bad. We can use our shield bash as well, I kind of forgot. Oh, now we've got a specialist. Perfect. Right, that's that one done. Perfect. I just said perfect like twice in the past two sentences, I'm sorry. Grab this, we actually need that carpenter. Melee attacks. It's a good thing we've got that carpenter. And we should get a max ammo for the next challenge here, so I don't need to worry about ammo too much. Probably going to be a dog round though. Never mind. Our shield is definitely taking a beating though. Right, one more. There we go. Oh, we got a fire sale this time. Oh, max ammo, perfect. Ignore the fact I just lost all my perks there please totally didn't go down it's fine all right we need to find super ingredients now that's easy enough here's our first ingredient here's our second ingredient we should really go and get another shield huh if we grab that and now we need to go back all the way over to the tag to totem spawn not the original call of the dead spawn i always get them confused whenever like i'm looking at a guide and it says spawn it does my head in and there's the other ingredient nice all right we need to go take all of these back to the cooking pot now chuck them in there and then we need water grab some snowballs then chuck it off the pot grab a reward and then we're done here Right, let's go get the dials off the hermit, then we can continue on with step three. Let's do that on the double, because the round just ended, oh my god. That's a dog round anyway, we're fine. Take the dials, there we go. Right, now we need to go over to artifact storage, and then slap these dials on the respective holders, and then move on from there. But we're doing quite well. I've barely played Tag the Totem, and I've basically got, like, set up by round 12. We really do need to build that dynamite, though. This is doing my head in now. So many areas that need to be opened with dynamite, and I just have it ready, but I haven't built it. I'm gonna kill these dogs, because they're gonna get annoying for this step. 
step. One, two, three, and four. Right, three's that one because it dinged, and then... Ah, fuck, it was six. Right, six, and then two, and then... Right, we need the apothecary to tell us where we need to look for our first sacrifice. Okay, our first one is where mountains throw, and that's like the little passing by area, like in between the mountains up at the facility, and we need dynamite for that, which we can do, because we have the pull the parts for it, I'm pretty sure. Right, and that needs to be built in the gangway, which we'll go do now. Okay, let's get the dynamite built. There we go. Right, let's head up to the facility. Place the dynamite bomb, run away. And there's our first one. We're filth cleansers, okay. Really lucky, actually, because that's literally where we are right now. We need been decontamination. This is the loading platform. No, it's a specimen storage, my bad. There's our next one. One where bread breaks. I'd imagine that's in the little cafeteria area, right? And there's our third. These offerings please us. That's great. And our last bit of dialogue there was where ether was made. So we have to go all the way back up here, all the way back to the facility, and we need to go find the bulletin board and then knock it off. Grab this the is it the vessel or whatever it's called? And then that's this step done. I've always like wondered whenever I go on this part of the map, they definitely must have took some inspiration from D Machine, like like to put into D Machine from this, because that just looks way too similar to the thing that you use in the Easter egg for D Machine. Here's the bulletin board I'm looking for. Open the safe. Okay, day two of tag the totem so why is it day two um uh, i got really tired and halfway through the easter egg i was kind of just like nah i can't be bothered so this is the second day of me trying this easter egg even though i didn't even really fail it it was just more like willpower kind of thing because i'd already completed voyage that day and i was just very tired but we're back and we need to go to the walls of ice or whatever it told me i think that's over here how oh, i am getting swept by a million different zombies yeah that's over by spawn it's like the ice slide it's just down here knife this off here place this on there move and th give me bro, say your quote just give me the fucking seal of duality there we go all right okay let's make our way over to the ship and place this thing down we do kind of need to make sure we're also a little bit well equipped for this step because after we place the seal and shoot the orb we're gonna get infinite zombie spawns which we should be fine we've got the uh sharp shutter however it's called i don't know what else to call it like the wonder waff I, I don't know it's not really the wonder waff though is it i'm deep in this too much i probably butchered that german pronunciation as well i apologize to any german viewers i doubt there's many of you though stick the uh, Vessel down there. There we go. Right, he's gonna fuck off. Yep, there you go. I'm also just gonna take the liberty of shooting this pipe down so it gets rid of that fire. There we go. We shot the orb once, I think. And again. And there we go. Retrieve what we have lost. We gotta go look for a red orb around the map. And apparently this thing can spawn anywhere, so we kinda just need to keep our eyes peeled. Yep, and the round ended, which means that we are gonna get infinite zombie spawns. Looking for this thing could be a pain in the arse, man. So wait, it's a dog round. Does that not mean it'll just end instantly? It's not there. I saw that on the guide. It could be there, but it's not. Okay. Here's our first one. We've got some snowballs. Can I aim it right? Yep, there we go. It'll fuck off. I see it. It went onto the back of the ship. Or does that just mean there's another one spawned in now? Is it not the same one? I'm not too sure. I do indeed see our next one here. Remember, don't get too close to it. Just got to be careful. I think this is a pretty good distance. There we go. Shoot that one. That one's gone. One more to go. Honestly, I thought this step was going to be a lot worse than it is. Tell me how there's a dog underwater, please. And tell me how it's not fucking drowning. Okay. Oh, I think I see it. Yeah, it's there. Yeah, can you sod off? I want my max ammo now. There we go. It's gone blue. And that's all three of them done. Nice. And we didn't have any infinite zombies either because luckily enough, it was a dog round. All right, let's go back to the ship. Shoot them all once more. And then we need to go and throw away our snowballs and chuck a little music box in front of the campfire. We're making very good pace on this honestly do need to keep an eye out for the round counter though because although i do have three of my perks and like four self revives i think our weapons are definitely going to start lacking soon oh good use of the snowballs get another dynamite pcx and probably i'm gonna take the safe guess that we're gonna need another stick at some point so better to keep an eye out for the uh, flame zombies but then you know just completely ignoring them this door cracked open annoyingly enough though we need to quickly head back up here because we need more snowballs it's good drop there's just a little pile here okay chuck one off that That'll fly into there. One. Oh, it's a bunch of zombies. And I don't have a whole lot of bullets, so I'm just going to keep my distance, I think. Chuck one off that. Shoot that. And one off this one. Oh, one off that one. There we go. All right, we need to go pick that thing back up. Though. There's just so many zombies down there. There's another flame zombie. Perfect. It means we can get another piece for our dynamite. I don't actually know if we need another stick. It'd probably just be nice to have one on deck, though. Oh, shit, we need more snowballs. As you can see as well, I also took the liberty of getting the Samantha boxes back because, you know, it's a fresh run. I don't want him to explode. Right, fine, we'll do a full loop. There we go. There's another piece. I love how that system works, by the way. I'm so glad it's not random either. Honestly, I quite like how this map flows. Won't even lie. Thank you. Now 
that we got that, we need to find this campfire. We need out of the water first. Oh, Jesus, we almost froze. Right, we need another dynamite piece because the uh, campfire that we need over there to place the little seal on is blocked by one of those. And the only way you can destroy those is with dynamite. So we're going to have to go around until we see a flame zombie. Well, that was fast. I found one already. There we go. All three dynamite parts again. Do you know what it is? I kind of like the gameplay loop of rebuilding the dynamite, but it also does get very annoying. I wish it was just static and you just bought it again like the shield, but whatever. 2,500 eventually for a shield does get a bit crazy though, so I can only imagine what they'd be charging for sticks of dynamite. Quickly get this thing built. Grab dynamite. Oh, double points. Very nice. All right, now that we got that, we can actually go continue on with the Easter egg. Definitely need to consider pack a punch and stuff soon though, because our guns are starting to do nothing apart from like the wonder off here. But that's because it's literally the wonder weapon of the map. If we find the pack a punch machine, we've got enough to at least pack both of them once. And then I think I'm going to go get Dying Wish after we've uh, at least got like first pack on both of our guns. All right, okay, let's chuck this here. Move, because I think that can down you if you stay too close. I mean, why wouldn't it? It's literally a fucking explosion. Oh, the pack a punch machine's over there, right? Let's go do that. We've got our uh, specialist weapon charged, so we can easily get through this horde. All right, I think that's last zombie as well. Right. Chuck that in there. And um, we'll chuck this in here too. Even if we're not going to keep it as good to have both our guns packed. There we go. Place that on top of it, and then chuck one of these down. There we go. Oh my god, story dialogue, guys. All right, we need to go see the hermit. He's got a gift for us. And by that, I mean two massive blocks of stone. And wow, bro, is that kind of looks like the Origins camo on the um, vapor we've got here. The creeping haze, whatever it's called. Oh, we fixed our gearbox as well. I forgot I did that. <laughs> yeah, this vapor's tearing through now that we pack a punch there. I'm kind of happy. You know, I'd love to go and pick up those stones, you know, but like an entire swarm of zombies won't leave me alone. Oh my god, bro. You'd think it was like round 15 or something. That's why we got a specialist weapon. It also makes me like crawl in my own skin knowing that I'm using the Path of Sorrows as Samuel Stoolinger. Thank you. Right, let's head down here. We need to be down here anyways. Place the stones there or there. Jesus. Wait for the zombie to come through because I don't want to kill him. And then turn that lighthouse trap on. Oh, is it going for the zombie? Okay. All right, let's grab the soapstones. Let's avoid any water, which we can do pretty easily since it's just a clear shot up to the lighthouse. To the facility, so we should be good. Line up here. And I think we can place one of them. Yep, there we go. And now everything's a little too hot. We've got to go place the other one on the floor. Which is just here or wherever, I think. Yep, there we go. Oh, I didn't mean to pick it up again. Yep, there. And pull the shower. Oh, I wish we could get Dying Wish, man, but we're like, oh, we're like 500 points short. It's annoying. Grab the other stone, chuck that on there, and we should have access to the fuse. Yes! Right, let's go grab the elemental shard. We'll have to take the long way around because I don't have the little bridge open in between the two zip lines, which is fine. Put that fuse in there, and this door should open up, right? Oh, it needs souls. Okay. Oh, never mind. I actually just rewatched the guide, and I oversimplified that step so much. That is ridiculous. I thought it was like, oh, it needs charged up, so it'll just be some souls. Nah, 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 nah. There's like two things you gotta shoot, then you gotta charge three generators up with like electric zombies, bro. We're in for a long run with long run? Long one with this run. Okay, there's our first one. And there's our second one. Okay. Right now we gotta kill electric zombies. Shouldn't be too difficult. Alright, okay. Here's our first generator. We just gotta kinda, you know, wait for last song. Oh, there he is. Then we gotta end the round. Oh, full power. Don't mind if I do. Honestly, I've been having fun with this Easter egg, man, like so far. It's definitely like a longer one. Oh, it's a dog round. That sucks. Like I would say, no, it, it definitely is a longer one, but I feel like it's a little bit more enjoyable than, like, you know, solo Blood of the Dead, you know, like the, the challenge galore. It is round 17, so I'm imagining that a lot of electric zombies should spawn. We should get this done this round, if not, probably, like, round 18. Yep, there's our first electric zombie. Uh, is it just one it takes, or is it, like, multiple? I guess we'll find out. All right, there we go. There's one. Oh, a nuke. That's kind of perfect, actually. Right, I think it is just one, honestly. Our next one's here. Oh, this spot's kind of shit. Right, there we go. There's the second one. That was lucky. He came pretty early, and then we have a specialist weapon. Right, and our third one's just here. And unfortunately, there's no more electric zombies. Looks like we're going to have to kill these last two. That sucks. See, I like the sharpshooter, but the massive issue I have with this wonder weapon is that, yeah, yes, it kills them, but it kills them extremely slowly. Right, there's another electric zombie there. Can we try looping loop them around? Right, there we go. That's it. Right, I am going to kill the majority of this horde off before we have to do anything else, because... I don't want to die picking up the fucking elemental shard. I don't know if this is a PC thing, but like, whenever I pull out my shield sometimes, it just is not there. I don't know why. Okay, I may or may not have straight up just took a down while trying to pick up the shard. <laughs> Ignore it. We just need to go grab Quick Revive again. I've took the liberty of grabbing all three. Weirdly enough, like, the most important one here is probably Quick Revive. Because for some reason in this game, it's like the one for regeneration. I don't know. I don't actually know how it works. I think it just speeds up how fast you regenerate. I think that's it. But I just know it's very good to have. All right, give me the elemental shard. There. There we go. There we go. All right, and let's go quick revive again. There we go. All right, all four perks. I feel much better now. Because our modifier has been activated, so we get 200 health. We get dying wished. Right, now we need to go do the orb step again, because Black Ops 4 loves its 
repetition for whatever reason. Why did they think doing the same thing over and over again is enjoyable? In what world? Probably be a good time to pick up some snowballs too. I think there's a pile just here. Turns out I'm absolutely tripping. Okay, whatever. Oh, there's some here. That's fine. I also really like how it doesn't take away your music boxes. That would literally turn this into the moon easter egg. Put the other gear box back there. That should fling us now if we ever need to use it, which I doubt it. But it's good to have. Chuck that on there. Move so the thing doesn't down us. Right, okay. Yep, that needs to be shot. I'd really prefer to not die in here. You know, shoot this thing. There we go. Right, we need to go find more red orbs. It was a piece of piss the last time, so shouldn't be too bad this time either. Let's see our first one. Can we get a first try? Yes, we can. Right, shoot that. Here's our second one. Oh, it's behind dynamite. Oh, you knob. Oh, we need to get another stick of dynamite. Oh, that's annoying, bro. Well, funnily enough, there's a fire zombie here. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to try and hit him, though. That took some doing, but I did kill him. We got our first piece here. Oh, this is so annoying, man. It's right there. Oh, wait, hang on. Hang, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I am being absolutely dumb. Please tell me I can just do this. I, I can. Oh, my God. <laughs> what a waste of time in snowballs, bro. Saying that like they don't do piss all damage. I know we could go over to the golden pack, but I can't be also waiting for the lighthouse to rotate, so I'm just gonna chuck my uh, secondary in here. And that is another flame zombie. Might be a good idea to get another stick of dynamite, although I don't think we're gonna need it, really. We're, like, two steps away from boss fight. Hence why I'm upgrading all my stuff. There we go. It's about as strong as we can get it just now. There's our last one. Okay, let's hope it doesn't, like, fuck off because we're getting a little bit too close to it, I think. Can I get a better angle on that? Throw a snowball off it? Yeah, there we go. Right, that's all three of them. It's another piece for another stick of dynamite, too, in case we need it. I doubt it, though. Grab some more snowballs before we head down there because we need more anyway. That one, that one, and then this one, or this one. There we go. Grab it again. Get out of here in case we die, you know, to this funny orb. Throw away our snowballs. Do we have the Samantha boxes still? Yes, we do. Chuck that on top of there, and then chuck a Samantha box on top of this. And we get a little bit more ether dialogue. Pick this back up. All right, we need to go up to the Hermit's Pad, otherwise known as the Lighthouse, because we need to go do a little lockdown for him. Should be pretty easy. We're, we're like pretty much set up. We just need another shield, and I think, yep, there's a zombie behind us that we can headshot here, which will allow us to grab another shield. Go. 2,500 for another shield is fucking crazy, man. Round 20 and I'm on 30 points, right? Say your dialogue. Thing, thing your thing down. Yep, take your seal of duality. This shouldn't be too difficult. I'm also cutting a lot more in this video because I think I'm coming down with a chest infection. I'm coughing so much and I really don't want to have to like edit out a bunch of coughs. So I'm kind of doing it now in nuke. That would be much appreciated. Takes the heat off my back for a little bit. This is pretty tame so far, honestly. We've got our uh, three music boxes still. We've got a specialist weapon. We've got a shield. We're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. I'm glad those napalm zombies, like the ones on fire that you get the parts from, aren't like the chaos ones that literally explode and insta down you if you don't have all four of your perks. Oh my god, okay, 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 okay. I take back what I said about it being tame. I'm whipping out the uh, katana here. Get this thing up to level three because we're probably going to need it for the uh, boss fight. Jesus, this one's long. Oh, insta kill. Did we really just die and wish on insta kill? All right, is he done? All right, nice. All right, take the seal of duality. Right, we got to go up the pack a bunch machines now. All right, let's get out of here before the round 21 zombies start spawning. All right, there's our first pack a bunch machine. We'll go do that one. We are running a little bit low on ammo though i hope we get one like a max ammo or something soon we could probably do a challenge or something for one couldn't we though chuck that in there we've just got to go about each one of the pack a bunch locations including the golden one to uh charge up the agarthen device as one would say whatever the fuck that means okay we did get this up level three nice okay it's done here i'm just gonna clear out all these fucking electric bastards because they keep stunning me grab that oh, was that max ammo no it's not it's a fucking zombie point cash thing right, the beam's pointing towards spawn we can run up and grab another shield we have two clips left of this window off. I wonder if it's worth it to get a thunder gun for the boss fight, because I know you can get one by completing all the challenges. Here's our second one. Chuck that in there. Okay, yeah, we really need to pack our um, vapor a little bit more here. Let's use the uh, sharpshooter. Our uh, path of sorrows is done as well. We can use this. Oh, right as it fucking finishes as well, man. That's annoying. Well, at least didn't go above halfway. Where's it pointing to now? Over there. Double points. Oh, that could have been the max ammo we needed, man. Okay, the round ended. That's fine, though. Chuck that in there. Oh, I didn't know you could get to the sunken path behind the pack a punch machine that would have been good to know you know a little earlier oh dog round that's actually kind of perfect as well get max ammo oh they count as souls there's the max ammo we needed i'm gonna try keep the use of the uh sniper rifle here to a minimum just so we can save it for the boss fight okay we've got the path of sorrows that should help out okay that's that done there i'm gonna kill the rest of these grab that run what is that that's a full power right here's our fourth and final one chuck that in there come on surely it's nearly done oh it's done right okay there we go for the final time we need some snowballs 
And chuck this on here. I am freezing very fucking fast. Right, there we go. All three of them done. We need snowballs, though. My bad. You would not believe the amount of tomfoolery I've had to go through to get to this stage, man. I ran out of ammo, so I was, like, running around like a headless chicken. That one. Go. That one. Go. And finally, that one. Grab it. Plonk this down here. And then throw away our snowballs, because fuck them. And then chuck down one of these. Should be the last bit of dialogue. Okay, let's grab the Agartham device. And the lighthouse beam has changed over to the golden pack a punch. There's literally nothing else for us left to do now. I think we should just jump straight into it, honestly. All right, let's make our way up. All right, here we are. Insert the Sula duality. Let's give this a go. That's it. Oh, God, this is scary, man. I've never done this boss fight before. All right, okay, so take us back. We just need to follow this thing around. We're going to max ammo soon. All right, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. It's only the first stage. I'm going to kill the ones that are behind us. Try and charge up our katana. Really don't need to worry about ammo too much. All right, got to charge this thing up. Go pull out the katana here. Oh, a nuke. I actually don't know what that does for us. Oh, shit. It's gone downstairs. Okay. Get out the lava. No, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Keep moving with it. Keep moving with it. Come on. Catch up to me. Okay, we're doing fine. We're doing fine. I don't know where it's going to stop next, though. All right. Okay. I'm popping one of these. That should charge it up fully, honestly. Yep. There we go. Grab these. I need these. All right. It's going to head over to the boat now. I need to be careful with this lava, man. It's like really fucking me up. It's nice that we got that max ammo, though. Double points. I don't, I don't really need that. Oh, my God. That, that's what I mean, bro. The lava's so bad. I'm whipping out the katana. Got God, we don't have a shield, man. Maybe we can grab one on the way up. No, I don't think we're going to be able to, unfortunately. It's fine. Oh, full power. Whip that out now. Right, that's perfect. We need to charge it up anyway. Come on, must be nearly charged by now. Shit. I hate when the katana does that. I can never tell when it's about to go off. Right, there we go. Grab the max ammo and let's get moving again. This will probably be the scariest part going in the lighthouse because it's so close quarters. But I believe we're going towards the facility first. It's going to go upstairs. Yep. All right, wait till it's on the zip line and go. It's fine. It's not ticking that long. Bro, hurry up. Up. Jesus. Right, let me back in. Okay, that wasn't a very good down. I mean, no good downs are good down, but we should be alright, I think. I'm gonna chuck one of these. I'm also gonna pop my talking about regeneration. I forgot I had this thing. Chuck another one. Got a path of sorrows. Get that on. Okay, yep, another charge up event. That's fine. I hope this is enough, man. Oh, it's not. Surely we're close. Come on, surely. Come on, please. And conveniently enough, that's where my OBS decided, yeah, this will be a great time to stop recording because of drive space. So yeah, I did end up beating Tag the Totem, but I didn't get any footage of it. Just pretend you saw fucking the hermit going up into the sky and, you know, I picked up the little thing and you got the cutscene and all that good stuff. I'm really sorry it was cut so short, but I did, I promise you, I finished it. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like on it. And if you want to see more content like this, why don't you subscribe? If you've watched all the way to the end, you are an absolute legend. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and this series, and I will see you all in the next big project.